happy saturday okay i have to get the music going because i don't have spotify open but guys welcome back in hello happy saturday what are you guys up to i gotta switch my Vir shadow also virgo virgo thank you so much for five gifted subs to the channel and community shadow with five more gifted subs as well and snap of light snap thank you for 21 months of continual support are you headed out on the bike today i gotta switch it i've been doing cat sleep relaxing and calm music for ginger whenever i've been leaving the house so i gotta switch it back to here we go okay back to the lo-fi thess welcome back in orixa hi london hi virgo Thank you so much. Shadow, thank you. Django, ready for chaos to, uh, yeah, completely. It's going to be a chaotic day, especially with the DLC popping off. Yes, absolutely. Star Citizen, welcome back in. Yang Sai, Anon. Guys, Sai Beard. It's freezing cold today, so indoor, indoor bike. I finally did get an indoor bike, by the way. I did finally pull the trigger. Natty, hi. Charles, hi. Pixie, hi. Ninja, hello. Varden, welcome back in. London, good morning. Good morning. Cybeard, thank you so much for five gifted subs to the channel and community. Yanks with the 100 bits for. Hawkeye. Yanks with the 100 gifted, the 100 bits. Uh, Pon Pon's never coming back. Hawkeye. Thank you so much for 10 gifted subs to the channel and community as well. Charles, hi, Mazda, hi, Shadow, Varden, Taney's here, Art I see as well, and Anon, thank you so much for all the gifted subs to the channel and community as well. Finally catching a stream again. Where have you been, Hawkeye? You missed so much. You missed penguins slapping each other. You missed <laughs> Fable, Fable shenanigans as well. Rainy, what's up? Welcome in too. Guys, I did see Dune. Okay, so just I want to put this full full disclosure and everything. I'm really excited, but we are doing um, I'm going to try to intro for about 20 minutes today. And then I actually am announcing a long term sponsor that we now have. And I'm so, so excited to share it with you guys. Anon, thank you for the gifted sub to Mazda as well. So we're going to kind of go through the website and I have an unboxing with you guys. And then we're going to get started on the game. Probably about an hour. It probably will be an hour long intro today. Overzealous, how was your week? Mojo, welcome back in. I haven't gotten to try it yet. So I just bought it. I just pulled the trigger, I think. What was it three days ago and so the bike hasn't been delivered and i also kind of messed up because they could have delivered and put it together and i don't know why i wanted to get it sooner so i just had them i'm having them deliver it and i'm gonna have to piece it together strictly welcome back in Sybeer, perfect timing with the stream today just finished prepping my wait wait kielbasa stew wait wait you said strew but you meant stew right <laughs> for the crock pot i need to start doing more crock pot meals honestly jack jack welcome back in and metal gear good morning anod with the gifted sub to mace as well maces no i'm not saying this right i think it's mace <laughs> scarlet scarlet thank you so much for 16 months of continual support as well unboxing taco bell look guys i talk about it all the time i wish this is not a taco bell sponsorship i know you guys guess that every single time and trust me, I would be hardly able to contain my excitement if it was. But I am happy to say that this is a sponsorship with a company that I've already been using. I've already loved thoroughly. And I just believe in wholeheartedly. As always, you guys know me. I'm only going to take sponsorships with things I really believe in. Um, so I am excited. I am excited to share. I feel DeWalt. No, it's not. I wish. Uh, yeah, Home Depot sponsorship win. Mm hmm. Is it a Peloton? No, I didn't get the Peloton. So you guys would probably be pretty surprised. I was looking at a lot of things. It wasn't a Peloton. It wasn't a Nordic track, it, but I was looking up. I did a bunch of research on some of the, like the best indoor bikes and I don't know the brand's name. So I'm going to have to look it up on Amazon because I did scoop it up through Amazon. I didn't end up getting um, I didn't get the Peloton because uh, they were I just I was looking into it and I just don't know how much I don't like the subscription on top of everything then you have to get the shoes you have to get all of the things let's see the one that I ended up going with was they're so expensive this one was like a middle rate I feel like it was oh it's actually supposed to arrive today so I will give you guys the update on that as soon as I test it um this one's brand is called I thought it was kind of like a good in between a sponsor to Michael Me Myers themed gym outfit what this one was called Schwinn Schwinn Fitness and it had really good reviews and everything so I just kind of decided to go with that one Schwinn it was like a nice in between 
Rocky, welcome back in as well. So I'm gonna have to test it out. Rain, Rain, welcome back in as well. I see, I see Shadow, I see Mace as well. Yes, I hope you enjoy the sub and the emotes. I eliminated rowers that required a subscription, not happening. I'm trying to do less subscription things, to be honest, like I already pay to go to the gym and having an indoor bike isn't enough for me to cancel my gym membership, even if it was a Peloton. So I just wanted to go with something that was gonna still get me moving because I mean I talk to you guys about this all the time like I have such a sedentary lifestyle um that it really has I feel like I feel myself not being as active or as healthy as I feel like I used to be but I think also I just think it's a little bit of getting older I'm trying to find myself find things that keep me entertained more with working out I can't do the same weightlifting exercises that I used to and feel the same like energy with them now you can bike during movie nights. Yes, I was doing the, well, I love my, I, you guys know I have a little um, treadmill under the desk and I loved that and I felt like it was perfect for it. It's obviously a Stanley Cup sponsorship. I don't think they need to do any sponsors with how much it's already swept in the world. <laughs> Multi Moo, welcome back in. I miss so many streams. Wait, wait, Z, hi. Well, it's seven. I always, it, there's not even a Z in it, but seven, welcome back in as well. I didn't even know you were streaming. Yeah, I normally stream on Saturdays. I do, this is kind of the normal thing. Today's stream is gonna be a little bit different. Hawkeye. <laughs> Ridiculous. Hawkeye, thank you so much for 20 gifted subs to the channel and community. Jean, Jean, Geo, Geo as well with the gifted sub to the channel and community. Guys, thank you so much. I also think we're out of blue knees from last stream, by the way. That's not how it works. It doesn't work that if somebody gifts 50 subs, I play it for the next intro. Billy Two Names, thank you so much for the gifted sub as well. And Dill Pickle and Highland, guys, thank you for the follows. Master Da Vinci with the gifted sub. Billy with the Hunter Bits as well. I'm falling behind on all of this. Guys, thank you so much. And, and Anon with all the gifted subs too. Billy, hi. Martinez, hi. Welcome back in too. Hello, hello. All right, I'm scrolling down. I'm trying to see. I see Handsome Caboose, a sponsor to the Michael Myers. I actually am ashamed to say that I don't have a lot of Michael Myers inspired clothing. I think I have a couple, like I have a Christmas shirt with Michael Myers on it, but workout gear, I don't know. No matter, you remind me of the babe. Power of voodoo. You do, you remind me of the babe. Yes, do we have the new GPU set up? No, we don't have the new GPU set up, but I do have high end. There's a lot of standby, standby. There's things with everything. Standby. All right, you're getting ahead, get ahead. There's actually reasons. There's kind of reasons behind all of it too, but I do officially now have both of my 4080 supers. So things are about to happen, but yes, standby for the updates. Kevin, welcome back in. Ah, finally her early. I finally here early and there's a 30 minute starting soon. There's actually more than 30 minutes today because we're doing a little bit of sponsors too. A little bit longer. So many things. I'm trying to catch up. Guys and Hawkeye, just thank you so much. Um, anonymous loss? Anomal anomala <laughs> anomalous. A gopher thank you for the follow by the way lucas thank you for the gifted sub to the channel and community as well and anon with the gifted sub to fixer and also servius i'm gonna turn this down for a second <gasps> did you guys get to watch uh did anybody watch florence i want to hear y'all's thoughts and feelings on the game i need to know do i have rocket money for my arugula do i have money for my arugula is this what you're asking I got a Peloton treadmill, doesn't require a sub unless you do the classes. So you could get the bike without doing the classes. I just, I still, at the end of the day, it was like almost, I don't know, it's just the cost comparison. It just, I, I know what's gonna happen is I'm gonna use it religiously for a little bit and then I feel like I'm gonna fall off and then I'm gonna remember that I have it and use it again. And I always like, anytime you get something new, I feel like you're really like excited and involved with it, but I'm gonna try to work it into my routine. So I didn't need anything and I don't need somebody to lead me through a class with the biking and everything. I feel pretty confident in my own abilities to push through without somebody yelling, you've got this, go. No, I, I do respect the classes. I love them. I used to do a little bit of, you guys, there was an era where I was like spinning. Oh my gosh, I was loving spinning. Um, I've done, I've tried all sorts of different things. I've tried um, uh, Pilates, I've tried yoga. I just think that I'm the type of person that has to try a little bit and just go back to them and just keep my brain like fresh and new and try different things. 
I had a spinning error at one time too. <laughs> Virgo, it happens to us all. Spin class is a lot of fun, but it's different with the person. It's it's a little bit different with the person like right there. And then I feel competitive with everybody in the room. I don't think I'm going to feel the competition through the screen in the same way. So I don't even think this bike has like a massive screen on it or anything. In Spain without the A. <laughs> With a spin class? Absolutely. Guitar dude, thank you for the follow as well. All right, I saw rain. I see Philly. Philly, welcome back in. Donk as well. Again, I wish. I wish. Trust me, with all the Stanley Cups that I bought for my friends. Uh, I saw Extrovert. Extrovert, welcome back in. Old Bones High. I've had a Peloton bike for about two years so far. I loved it, but I just canceled the subscription. Started riding while watching Disney+. Plus. Yeah, I feel like for me, like I... I would probably be biking while I'm watching something or during movie nights, something like that, you know, compete with Anna on the bike. Oh, that would be a cool idea just to kind of like be tracking how much we're riding. That would be a good incentive. I mean, I know that that'd be kind of fun to link up and do that with in the discord as well. I know that a lot of you guys will share like how many miles you've gone in the day and it's it does help. It really does. Um, Jasmine, welcome back in. And Nack, we've also owned a Blue Knees. Okay, I already read that one, and that's not happening. I disagree with this. So Dune, guys, how, how many of you guys have seen Dune so far? Flip, welcome back in as well. I have a stationary bike. Use it while gaming or watching shows. It's the best and time flies. I'm excited. I will update you guys on this. Alani, oh, coding, please. Don't tease me. That would also be horrible since I'm trying to quit. I'm trying to... Mm -hmm. since I'm trying to guys thank you so much for the hype train right off the rip as well and if you have gotten a gifted sub from anybody I hope you give them a big thank you I've seen it recently I'm seeing it on the for the third time you're seeing it for the third time I saw it last Saturday I haven't even seen the first dune yet yeah so first of all it was awesome meeting my brother's new girlfriend she's incredible I love her so much and I hope he doesn't mess this one up okay let me just start by saying that because that was like a big portion of the evening also, Stefion. Stefion, thank you so much for the gifted sub to Taco Bell. <laughs> thank you. I really appreciate it. Um, oh, gosh. Okay. So let me start by saying when I was watching Dune, I didn't have to use the bathroom at all. And I was really impressed with myself, despite having two beers prior. Ice, hi. Ice, welcome back in. Brother, you've been warned. No, she was really cool. Probably too cool for him, to be honest, if I had to guess. Uh, yeah, I didn't do any pee breaks. I didn't even get popcorn, though, because it was so packed. Um, the line to get the popcorn was just ridiculous, and my brother had been running late, so we just didn't get to the movie theater in time. Um, like, we barely got in right as the last trailer was running, which was kind of nice. I didn't have to see, like, the horde of trailers that they show before. So... I enjoyed the movie overall like when I was sitting in it I was just in awe and I was just sitting here and I was like cinematically this is probably one of the greatest movies I've seen it's very artsy it feels like a space opera I feel like the best way to describe it it's like a space opera and or sci-fi opera I guess I just was so in love with all of the shots I think artistically it hit the mark like no other film that I've seen in a long long time definitely a space opera um I know sometimes trailers are the best part and plus I haven't but like for movies now like I haven't gone to the movies in so long this was the first time I will say if you're debating on if IMAX is worth it it was worth it okay it was worth it now I'm probably talking a little bit louder because I definitely feel like I'm a little uh, uh loss of hearing today I'm not gonna lie they had it pretty dang loud but the IMAX was so worth it best I've seen in theater is still the original Lord of the Rings movies oh yeah but that was never in contest like it was never a question it will always be that for me but IMAX was definitely worth it for me that was like my take on that overall I love the movies I do I liked the first one I enjoyed the second one the thing about it is that's really weird and I don't know if anybody else is going to relate to this I personally just don't feel connected or invested in any of the characters like but I still admire and like the the series I just couldn't care what happens to some of the protagonists and I just don't feel bonded to the characters but I still enjoyed it a lot um and that was just kind of like my personal take on it though my dad felt a little similar as well also Mayor Charizard welcome in and Drew Bradford thank you for the follow welcome in as well I really like the mix of sci-fi medieval stuff it's kind of cool I will say the um a lot of the fighting scenes were epic like they were just incredible i've heard other people say the same thing the protagonist technically isn't good either it's i haven't read the books to be honest at the ending with what happened 
with some of the the romance drama it made me want to read the books but I just yeah I don't know I there's n never been this big draw to me for it I guess I've never I think it's like the size that's definitely kept me away from it I that's why I've been avoiding the is it the prior the orange the priory priory of the orange or something massive books tend to just scare me away especially as somebody who's just getting back into reading it would be a large feat to take on for me right now the books are really good in my opinion do you feel like they're better than the t than the series so far paul isn't meant to be a hero makes it hard to have him as a main character right oh my gosh there there is a part where i'm like wait where did you get a black robe and also why is this feeling very it, it gave me strong sith lord vibes for a second like there were definitely sith lord vibes but correct me if i'm wrong but i had heard a little rumor that that was a strong like star wars had a lot of um I guess they drew a lot of inspiration from the Dune series originally. Maybe I'm old school, but I think that the good, the bad, and the ugly is one of the best movies ever. You know I haven't seen it in so long, and I need to. Dune inspired Star Wars a lot. Okay, yeah, it's it. Um, I think a lot of people talk about it being like the cornerstone for sci-fi novels and just for the genre in general. The quality of the writing of the books is less daunting read. I have heard, so I did, uh, my dad was talking about how he went into like reading about the author and how um, the author would like, I guess, like get up and be like, I'm gonna write every single day. And so it would slowly develop. And that's why for some people, I think that there's segments that they feel probably feels a little drawn out is because it's gotta be an interesting process to get up and be like, I'm going to write. 30, for 30 minutes today and whatever happens happens and so I don't know I've, I've seen like the reviews on it the reviews are so 50 50 it's like either people say it's the best book and series ever to exist and then other people are like I don't get it I don't get the allure it's a dense book Devik wait that's your first time gifting as well Devik thank you so much for the 10 gifted subs to the channel and community thank you so much I really appreciate that and it's your first time um, yeah, thank you. And anybody that just got a gifted sub, I hope you enjoy the emotes and please give Devik a big thank you. Um, I love the philosophy in the books. There's a lot of books too. My dad absolutely loved you and I'm not sure if I inherited the gene. My dad is kind of on the fence with it. He, he's, he's a big sci-fi nerd. Don't get me wrong. My dad loves sci-fi and he loves, um, I guess like history books. But he, he said that he never jived with Dune personally. It's almost like Dune is telling the viewer that we shouldn't trust. A cur yeah, charismatic figures. Yeah, that is a good take on it as well. I think though there's a difference too. Like when I say that I don't care what happens to any of the protagonists, um, it's, it's not because I'm like, oh, he's not a hero. He's not a bad guy. It's like, it's not because of the vagueness of his character or any of the other characters. I don't know why. I just don't feel connected in any sort of way or I feel like I feel like there's there was a lot of there was a lot of things that I was like oh, the characters that I did find interesting I feel like they exited the scene before they came in like they they arrived and then they ended up leaving before I really got to see them develop and I was like oh that was such a cool character and then they like jettison him and I'm like no what's the name of the guy behind the wheel of time oh I don't know who writes that one I've never read that one either yeah you're very charismatic so we don't trust you never trust anybody no i'm just kidding from the trust issue girl herself jay no welcome in by the way see it's your first time chatting and chicago driven thank you for the follow duck face thank you for 36 months of continual support as well i really appreciate it yeah i i haven't looked into the wheel of time books um i did start to try to watch the tv series and I, I couldn't guys I don't I just couldn't I couldn't get into it I do think the books and, uh, and movie adaptations are hardly ever going like one for one I think it's really hard to compare them so I definitely would give the books a go for sure uh, Wheel of Time is my favorite book series ever Faust welcome back in by the way um I think that the largest takeaway for me with the second Dune is that I truly believe they can keep doing adaptations justice if they produce more of what's happening here. And I'm sure Dune is so expensive to create. I'm sure it's some of the most expensive creation of some of these visual scenes that has happened in a long time. But I just really believe that there would be so many incredible books that they could adapt. And if they kind of kept a similar style, it would be so good. It's actually a lot cheaper than most Marvel movies. 
tell me it's not cheaper than Marvel, uh, Madam Web or whatever that one is. Please tell me it's not cheaper than that. I'm actually writing a short story, are you? That's actually really cool. Somebody else was writing too in the community. Did your brother ever read the body? Wait, wait, wait. Did your brother ever read three body problem? What? No, I don't think so. What is this? Bearded, by the way, welcome back in. And Sizerer, welcome in as well. Boat, boat, boat. Dennis knows how to create some crazy ass tension in his movies. So, yes, my face felt, I don't know how to describe this. And I, if you've seen it, then maybe you know what I'm talking about. But my face felt very just like tense the whole time. I think that's why I didn't feel the need to go to the bathroom or anything. I just felt tense the whole time and I left the film and I like felt like my face needed like I needed like a massage on my muscles or my face because I just was like I think I, I just, it was so good though it kept you like in your seat I guess it kept you on your like the edge of your seat waiting for what was going to happen next cinematography was amazing yeah felt like a turtle <laughs> Wait, Kozak, Kozak, thank you so much for 11 months of continual support as well. I saw that Han Zimmer tour yesterday. Ever since I have to binge watch every movie he does music into. It was amazing though. I'm sure. Oh my gosh. Wait, Duckface, by the way. Hold on, going back like one more. Duckface, thank you for three years of continual support. Truly, I really appreciate it. Um, and also Heisen, thank you for two months of continual support. More like an armadillo, <laughs> an armadillo. Not gonna say it, I'm not doing it. <laughs> Kozak, thank you for almost a whole year of continual support and I'm sure it had to have been amazing. And Shadow, thank you for the gift of the Cobra too. Loris, all the resubs today. Doc, hello, Hiffin, welcome back in. Um, Marvel movies? All right, wait, wait, frugal movie making exercise. Wait, are not exercise in frugal. No, absolutely not. I think they do do, don't they do a fair amount into marketing too? Like I think their marketing budget must be bananas. Uh, yeah, I have no desire. I haven't seen a Marvel movie in, uh, in theaters since the snap one, Thanos. End game, is it end game? I think, maybe I saw no, I think it was Endgame. I think that was the last one I saw. Yeah. But to be fair, I'm not a big film, like movie, the snap one. I'm not a big movie goer anyway, I guess I'd say. I mean, but you guys know this. This is like, I know some movie references and it's like, I have my tried and true set of movies I love or TV series, but anything else, I feel like y'all have to be the reason that I go to watch something new. Otherwise I will miss it for the rest of my life and I'll continue to keep watching the same shows that I always watch like Gilmore Girls or Lord of the Rings for the 12th hundred, the 111th time. Loris, thank you so much for three months of continual support as well. And also Juicebox with 44 months. Jack, thank you for the follow as well. If you guys are popping in for the first time, we are going to be starting in 30 minutes. We do have a little bit of a sponsored segment here. Um, I'm really excited to share this with you guys. So we are going to get started on that portion. But Lord of the Rings, always skin trade. You know Lord of the Rings nonstop. Um, but if you guys are new here, we are officially in the DLC for the game. So we are in Phantom Liberty. We have not finished the base game. We're holding that off for later. But yes, I'm super excited to share this with you. Okay, so this is really low key and everything. New Mac and also New Mac, thank you for the follow as well. And it's okay with you. I'll stay for a while. Juicebox, I think it's been a little bit more than a while now. I think 44 months might be a little bit more than a while. Lord of the Rings sponsored, no. Okay, let's get into this guys. Um, no, I'm actually really excited. I like to be as transparent with you guys as possible, especially with this. And what? Hold on. New Mac. New Mac, thank you so much for the Prime Gaming sub too. Did you just pop in from YouTube or from stream or what the heck? Boz, yes, yes, it is Dogtown area. Sorry, I'm all sniffles today too. I'm going to need to run to the bathroom and put my... Um, Antihistamine and striker striker thank you for two months too a couple two monthers guys i'm so glad to see you're still enjoying your time here but um no so full transparency like i you know y'all have known i've been doing this full time for a while i very rarely take sponsorships unless i absolutely believe in the product and that is how i believe it should be i'm never gonna like go and do like a collaboration or a deal with some company that I don't believe in wholeheartedly. So I was over the moon when this happened, because if you guys know, I have been working, well, I've owned their products now for a little bit. It completely changed everything. 
you you may realize that I kind of like wooden slats. Do you guys get that? Is that like a thing? I mean, it's in like nearly every room in my house. Um, no, we are officially sponsoring with Fractal. So if you guys know, I have used Fractal more recently. I have had a slew of different cases, including actually a Leanne Lee case. But yes, we are officially partnering with them for the next six months. So I'm super, super excited. This was a dream, like an absolute dream. Joining the Fractal family. Yes, Anna's Anna's a part of it. Quali, Quali is, Zara is. You might know a lot of other creators that are part of the Fractal team. And I was just over the moon because not only do I have one of their cases with the wooden beams, the North, which we're going to go over today, but I also have their little Terra. So I'm gonna walk you guys through the website for a little bit today. And then I actually, yep, somebody brought it up, the Fractal North XL. I have, I have, it's massive. So we're gonna unbox it. But this couldn't have come at a more perfect time. London. London, thank you so much for the thousand bits. Congratulations, Cast and Fractal. I really appreciate it. Yeah, how many of you guys already have a fractal case? Oh, I just absolutely love them. Jockster, thank you so much. And yeah, welcome in. We have so many vets here. You are so welcome here. Thank you. Kiwi, thank you so much. Tubi, thank you guys so much. I really appreciate it. I hope you guys have had a good experience with them. I've absolutely loved both of mine. So I'm going to switch over and we're just going to walk through the website um, real quick. But yeah, I wanted to ask, like, how many of you guys already have one? Millie gives us a hand for it. <laughs> My poor headphones, I'm always pulling them out. I feel like I'm always like accidentally yanking them out of my head. Also, overzealous. Thank you so much for the gifted sub to Jockster from one vet to another. The XL is so beautiful. Yes. Okay, so that's what we're kind of emphasizing on today. So as you guys know, they've had the North. They've had a couple of their cases. I'm going to walk you guys through here in a second. All right. So they have the new North. So sorry, guys. It's going to be super bright here for a second, but... Yes, I have had the normal North for a little bit. And the reason why this was the most perfect time sponsorship is, if you don't know, I kind of told you guys that I've been trying to switch to dual PC setup for a little bit. And I'm an aesthetic girly, okay? I'm an aesthetic girly through and through. You guys know this, all right? I also, like, look, the wooden slats on the front, the wooden slats back here, it was absolutely perfect. So I personally have the white with the... This might come as a shocker for a lot of you guys, I don't have the glass. So they do have the tempered glass if you like that see-through look. I actually have the mesh. I'm now a mesh girly because I don't care about the lights anymore. I'm not a, RGB lights for me are just not a priority like they used to be. I feel like I just wanna pick parts because of their functionality and not just because of aesthetically like how they look. But you can still see some of the glow through the mesh. It is such a gorgeous case. Yes, the mesh is better for temps as well. Exactly, spazzy, spazzy. I know I, this was killing me not to be able to share this with you with everything we were talking about. Spazzy has been helping me with my dual PC setup. So the North is what I'm currently running my PC on right now. As you guys know, I know you keep coming in. Capones especially keeps asking, are we using ray tracing at my dual PC setup yet? Why am I going dual PC setup in the first place? This is something we're like, I would love to just have one powerful computer to run everything, but just because I'm trying to switch over to being able to offer 4K um, quality and everything, it's just going to do a lot better for me to be able to run on two separate programs. And also in case we, as we've had before, sometimes the power be going out. And so um, not only do I have a backup for that, that uh, spazzy, what is it called? I have that as well, but if anything happens with the capture card like it normally does, I don't have to end stream and start it back up because I'll be streaming from a separate computer. So 35, welcome back in. And Matt and Red Goals, guys, thank you for the follows as well. So the North is my main case. And today we are unboxing the North XL, which is their new larger version of the North. I now have two 4080 supers, but my current PC is running that large graphics card. Do you guys remember? I told you guys that my PC is running hot right now because my graphics card is taking up a slot of my fan. So I'm running on one less fan than I normally am. And the graphics card is literally taking up the entire North. So as I talked to you guys about it before, but I'm surprising my dad with a custom built PC 
my dad is my absolute inspiration for gaming. Like I talk to you guys all the time. We used to do like the point and clicks. We played um, a lot of, oh my gosh, a lot of fantasy general. And even though he doesn't game that much anymore because he just doesn't have the time, my dad is approaching retirement. So I figured it was about time that we upgraded him for this. Um, there's not a link. So you can do the exclamation mark. You can do exclamation mark fractal if you want to check it out. But um, there's no kind of like I don't get a kickback or anything like that. So like there's not a discount or anything like that. It's just kind of spreading awareness. If you guys have not heard of this brand, um, I've loved every single ounce of using it. I think aesthetically, even just having it down here. I wish I could show you mine right now, but it's down here and it just looks beautiful. So this is the XL, which I will now be able to take my old graphics card that I was running hot on the normal North and I can put it into the XL and it will fit perfectly. Like, I don't think it's going to cause an issue at all. It looks beautiful. It's yes, the wooden slats are life. <laughs> Is your dad's first game going to be Spider-Man? So I actually, he did talk about wanting to do Spider-Man. So I've been asking him for games that he'd be interested in doing, but I think the first game we're going to try to get him into, I'm also going to try to buy some pieces for this. If anybody is into, if anybody in the community is really into, um, flight sims let me know like your setup i don't think i can get him the whole rig but my dad his entire life has wanted to be a pilot like his whole entire life back in the day he just didn't have good enough vision and they didn't allow people that got corrective like lasix or anything like that back in the day you weren't allowed to join the military and with lasix or anything like that and so he kind of had that missed opportunity so he's always wanted to be a pilot and flight sim i feel like is the closest way for me to get him into it so yes we are going to be using the xl that we're going to be unboxing right now is the case that i'm going to be using for him um and then i'm going to walk you guys through just kind of the components i have a lot of components from my last couple builds so i'm going to be kind of frankensteining this together but i still want to make sure that it's super powerful and it's something that he'll be able to use for many many years because now with retirement on the horizon he's got a lot more time I think he's gonna like he's gonna start streaming over me honestly <laughs> yeah yeah so it's just beautiful through and through not only just in looks but performance wise as well it's again just been one of my favorite cases I've previously worked with not worked with but I've owned I think a Corsair case and then I had a Leah and Lee and this one has been the easiest for installation as well like it's the build versatility that they offer it's the like flow of how everything goes in there oh also depending on your fans they do offer other products as well i personally haven't tried their fans or their power supplies but i know that they're starting to put more into those as well dad and daughter co-op stream oh i'm sure he would be up for that but i don't know i don't know there's just some boundaries you have to have rita thank you so much for the whole year of continual support as well here's the thing is like my dad is really cool i don't know if you guys realize this my dad is like the coolest man i know in my life and if i brought him on stream he would completely take it over and honestly he would end up forming a stream and nobody would care to watch me anymore because he would be the life of it he is the coolest person <laughs> be cool hi by the way it's been sick all week finally starting to get better there is something going around like a lot of people have been getting sick so yes we officially are going to be unboxing the north xl but i also want to show you guys some of the other ones if you wanted to be a pilot, MS Flight Sim, VR might be something cool he get into. That's what he was talking about. He was talking about the VR aspect of it. Now with the VR, like the VR side of it too, are you using like the um, controller as well? Like how do you operate that with the VR? I'm just trying to give him like the most immersive experience possible for Flight Sim. Like I want him to feel like he truly is flying. There was a Dune. There was actually a Dune. So did, wasn't there like a Dune update to the Flight Sim or something? He would love that so much. He's the usurper. He would use it. It would. It would become a dad stream. It really would. All right, Maggie, your dad just went live. I'll have the tab pulled up. That is exactly what would happen. It's true. It's so, so true. They did do a Dune DLC. Yeah. Also, Mad, Bubbly, and Nico, guys, thank you for the follows. Welcome in. Rita, thank you so much for the whole year. 
this, uh, yeah, this is the other case. So they have quite a few cases actually as well. I haven't gotten a chance to look at the Ridge, but I like the skinny boy. They have a skinny boy. I think what I've always enjoyed about all of their cases is just aesthetically they're beautiful, but they also fit size wise. Like not everybody's going to want a massive case like the XL, um, which is why they have the normal North. But then if you want something even smaller, my next streaming. So the next one that I'm trying to build right now, the ones that I've been telling you guys, it is really silent. It's super quiet. This boy, the build is so complicated though, because I've never done a build for like a smaller size PC, but this is actually what's going to be my streaming PC, the Terra. I even have, I'm so excited too, because my, uh, my CPU is colors of Virginia tech as well. So it just fits so perfectly, but yes, this is, so this is going to be my other one as well. And this one is sting. I named her sting. Well, I guess him sting. Yeah. This one's like a cute one as well. And actually I know spazzy has Tara. So I know spazzy you've been enjoying it quite some time now. Right. And laughing windows. Thank you so much for the prime sub. I really appreciate it. Thank you. I love the understated designs. So Meshify 2 is my case. Meshify 2. Let me see. Is it through something else? I've never heard of it. I'm assuming you've watched Top Gun. DCS is a flight sim with or without VR. And the F-14 is one of the many aircraft in it. And you can co-op with it. Wait, I could do co-op with my dad. But you need with or without VR. So you could do it without VR. So maybe that's something that we'll do is when I build this, like when I'm done building it and I'm waiting on a couple of extra parts, I'm going to prioritize building my dual PC setup before his because we have a little bit of time before he does retire. He's got a couple months left, but maybe we'll do some kind of celebration co-op stream of some sort. He might not be on camera, but maybe we'll do like his voice on it or something like that. But we could do a father daughter I think I could get together a father-daughter flight sim experience with him. Yeah, we could be co-pilots. That would be a dream come true for him. That would be so much fun. So you're going to have a Terra and a North and your dad gets the XL. Yes, exactly. I don't even have the XL. I did tell my dad I wanted to get him like, I just wanted to create something that was going to last a long time for him because he's not going to put in the work to do, you know, upgrades. At least I don't think he might end up. Um, laughing windows. Thank you so much. Where did you come from? Thank you for the prime and overzealous. Thank you so much for the gifted sub to Trev as well. I do DCS a lot nowadays. I'll check up my, wait, wait, I'll check my setup on discord somewhere. Yes, please. Absolutely. Yeah. So I just, I really have enjoyed my experience with them. I hope you guys do. If you've been using them for a while, then I think it speaks for itself. But if you guys are looking for a new case anytime soon um, and the North is looking a little too small, like I said, they now have the XL, which is perfect for this build that we're going to be doing. Um, I hadn't considered doing the build on stream, but if it's something that you guys would be interested in seeing, um, I know I talked about this when we were unveiling the Pokemon cards and everything. If it's something you guys would be interested in seeing, maybe we could do um, a build setup as well. A build stream stayed, yeah. Pretty sure you can fly over your neighborhood as well. Probably not gonna do that one on stream, but it would be cool to do off stream. <laughs> It'd be cool to do off stream. <laughs> that would be really cool, yeah? Okay, okay, I'll definitely look into it. Once I get all the components, we'll talk about doing like, maybe like a Friday night special or something. Does your father have an accent? My father is from like, uh, he he's all over. He's from Denver, but then he grew up a lot in the Appalachian. Like, so he has quite an, I don't know. I don't think he has an accent, but I think some people think he thinks he, <laughs> some people think he does. It's a, it's a weird combination. It's a very weird combination. Wood and white case is insane. It's the wood for me. I just, as soon as I saw this, I was set. So yeah, it does come in white. So if you guys like that kind of bright design, it's white on the outside with that black sleek interior. But the case that I'm unboxing for you guys today is actually not the one that I normally have. Also, I love like the gold detailing, the wood grain. This is like the most me case possible. Are you kidding me? Uh, today, so for my dad, I did the black with the mesh design. So that is what we're going to be unboxing today. But even look at these details. Oh my gosh. It's so, it's so beautiful. They look so sleek. This is giving, it's like the sleekness and design of the Death Star to me. Not really, but I guess it just reminds me, for some reason, it reminds me like the sleek style of the inside to those kind of structures. It's the gold trimming. 
what Friday thing are you planning? Not for this Friday. No, this Friday we don't have anything. I don't think. Uh, I don't know. I haven't planned it yet. It's sleek and beautiful. Yeah. Do you guys have any questions about it before we do the unboxing and then we'll get started on cyberpunk? Very Scandinavian over the design. That is very true. Well, it is a Swedish company. So, I mean, they knocked out of the park. It's that minimalistic, beautiful, warm. But that's the thing about it, too, is I mean, you guys know I'm a big interior design person and the older I get, like I've never, I know we joke about me having like all white walls and things. My home is not like, it's not empty by any means. It's not minimalistic by any means, actually. Like despite what it looks like, I like to incorporate a lot of warm colors. I don't just have white walls. I literally just painted my bathroom this massive green, like dark, dark green. So there's that, they're the Ikea PC cases, but better quality and easier to build with. Absolutely. <laughs> I would not compare the two at all. Uh, Jin, is it ginseng? Thank you for the follow as well. I really appreciate it. No, I'm not. A, no, I'm not a minimalist at all. Actually, I don't like the gray. I actually am very I talk about this all the time. I do not like the gray floors. I don't like the white walls. I don't even like the barn style either. It's just I like a more like cottagey warm feeling, which is why I incorporate a lot of wood, a lot of um, paneling, like a lot of paneling can bring a lot of life into the room. I will like to do um, more antique kind of hardware choices as well. My idea PC case is a discarded cardboard box with a dusty fan mounted inside. <laughs> it's also nice too, because they do come with fans as well, which I think is kind of pretty, I think that's on brand for a lot of cases right now. They'll come with some, actually there's the last case I got didn't come with any fans, I don't think. Um, but these do, they already give you kind of like a kickstart with that too. Wonder Boy, thank you for the follow as well. Guys, give me one second. I just need to blow my nose. Hold on. I'm a minimalist. Are you? So like, I used to think I was a minimalist, but not pastel. You like pastel colors. I think I'm liking more rich, dark colors now. I kind of want my home to be just... The, the downside to it is I totally get where people... There used to be a time, especially owning my home... There was a time that I was like, I want to keep it in pristine condition when I go to sell it. And then at some point I was like, I'll just paint it back white when I want to. But for now, I'm going to be living here for a couple years. I might as well make it a home to me. Like I stopped having that kind of like, let me plan for the next buyer. Like, let me make this home enjoyable for the next buyer. Didn't make any sense. <gasps> No, it is Slytherin green. And also the Terra is Slytherin green. Oh no. <laughs> no. It's not quite Slytherin green. It's a little bit. It's, uh, it's like, yeah. I'm never going to escape it. I'm stuck being a Slytherin for the rest of my life. I know. Hold on. Give me one second. One second. Ugh. But yeah. All right. Well, let's unbox. Let's unbox this big boy. Um, he is quite large. TJ, thank you for five gifted subs to the channel and community as well. We also, for the next month, are going to be having a little fractal emote. So you can see the fractal emote. It's in lieu of the race you and it's so dang cute. So you can use that as well. And then we will be partnering with them for the next six months. So I hope you guys enjoy if you have gotten one. And if you do plan on getting one, I think you're going to love it. I think you'll love it either way. I'll get the white version XL because I'm doing a liquid cooling for both CPU and GPU. I'll be impressed by the design. I think especially if you're doing the liquid, you're going to go with the, I wouldn't go with the mesh then. Are you going to go with the mesh? If you're doing that, you would go with the tempered glass, right? So you can see through, I would say, but the XL, absolutely. The spacing on that would be beautiful. Hold on. I got to find it. Find it. I'm not seeing the image on it. Hold on. Yeah, I think the tempered glass would be perfect for that. You can get the 420 front for the water system. I've never actually contemplated getting. I had a friend who did one, but isn't it a lot of maintenance? Like, don't you have to? Oh my gosh, this is. Let me switch back to full screen, guys. But this is <laughs> massive. I have to say, I do not need a better one. Do you already have the north itself? Yeah. All right, we're gonna switch back over here for the unboxing. Oh no, it's gonna play catch up on the alerts. I'm sorry, ignore it. TJ, thank you so much for the five gifted subs. I really do appreciate it. I love the fractal cases. Do you have one? I love my fractal cases. You have multiple fractal cases. 
Does it work for laptops? I don't think they have components for laptops yet. Mm. A sponsored section. Awesome. Mr. Yes, welcome back in. Great. I'm going to have to take my headphones out because it's going to pull it for me. Great. Thank you for the five gifted. Sorry subs. Are they sorry subs? I don't think I'm going to be able to get this out. Oh, no, no, it is not commission based at all. No, no, not at all. So if you use the link, it, it, yeah, you do not have to use my link. You can use my link. You can use any of the other creators links. Absolutely. It's not like that at all. I, uh, I personally don't like, I don't do, I don't like to do the commission based where it's like, I need to get a certain amount of you guys to click on things. Like I just don't roll that way. I don't, I'll get, I'll try to get you guys discounts on like things that I'll take on like sponsorships, but I'm never going to take ones that are like, I get a certain percent. Guys, this is, this is massive. This is massive. Oh my God. Okay. Let me see. Cam jam. Okay. Let me think about this. Let me, maybe it's not, it's thick. Maybe the thing is, great, here's your commission. Get out of here. I'm gonna try going this way. We're gonna go this way. Yep, we're gonna pull it this way. <laughs> flip it. I'm not gonna, you want me to flip it upside down? Mm, no, no, no. Okay, yeah, this works, this works better. They said, screw weight distribution. <laughs> Tip it's on its side. No, this is working. This is working well. I want to see the gold detailing. That's what I want to see. Uh-huh. Great. Thank you so much for the 5,000 bits. You didn't catch it? This is what we're going to do. I'm going to do this. Okay, you know what? You're right. That was a lot easier. To be fair. To be fair. <laughs> that was a lot easier. Okay. Big boy. Unboxing Millie. Come on, Millie is a little bit bigger than this. Millie is just a little bit bigger. Okay, hold on. Let me put it up on my, oh, oh my goodness. Okay. We don't do a lot of unboxings. I kind of just realized, I was like, we don't. Ah! We really don't, do we? All right, we wanna flip him on this side. Oh my gosh, it's there. It's there, it's there. I could fit in this thing. I actually am interested to see the comparison side by side with mine. I'm kind of surprised. I, the only thing is I'm hoping my dad's okay with like the large case. Oh, that's so pretty. It might actually be a Death Star. <laughs> that's what I'm saying. I'm 4'11". My last three computer cases have been 30 to 50 pounds in weight. You do not, wait, wait, you do not try a life such things. Wait, wait, do not try to lift the thing out of the box. Is that what you're saying? No, this one's actually very light. Like, I think that's one of the best. Oh. Okay, wait, no, this is the tempered glass. This is the tempered glass. I forgot about that. Oh my gosh. Okay, so I wish I had more of like a desk to show it. Camera? Camera? <laughs> My camera's like, that thing is too big. <laughs> what? I kind of want to show you guys how easy it is to get inside of this. Camera? I've never seen my camera do that in my whole life. AJ. AJ, welcome back in. About to play some Gwent with Jonathan. I haven't played since we got together. I need to prepare for June. You do. I need to prepare for June. We're going to have to go back to, this one might be too hard for me to like unscrew completely. Do I still have your cat cam? No, I do not. We're gonna take the tempered glass off real quick so we can see the inside. Yeah, yeah. Even the camera thrown off by the size of this monitor. It is deep. Honestly, I, I'm kind of, I don't want to go through the work of it, but I'm kind of like, maybe I should keep this one for myself and give my dad the normal North case. <laughs> maybe. Vault Hunter, welcome back in. I need a PC build. My laptop is amazing in mobile, but VR, I've got to try the 400 TX series. Check out this case. Like, I'm serious. I've been using this and this is why like, this is why I said this to begin with. So this is the tempered glass one. This is why I said this at the beginning. I would not be partnering with them if I didn't already use them guys. Like I was using them way before we did a partnership. Just so minimalistic, simplistic. You have all your cords going up here. I will pop a picture of my current build like on the inside down below, like in the discord later, just to show you guys, but you can, the cable management is so easy on these. Oh, it's so, look at all of those. Holy cow. 
I think I'm gonna switch with my dad. I think I might switch. The camera's sabotaging. I actually, actually wait. I don't think I want this one. Handsome caboose. And honestly, that's another aspect of it too, is like, as far as cases go, it depends on what you're looking for. For me, I find that these cases are well-priced to the point where it's like, if you wanna go with the mesh or you don't wanna spend the money for maybe as many, like you can save in other aspects and then kind of splurge on the case. I feel like that's what I would do because externally, that's what I care about. Like when people come into my house or anybody sees my PC setup, they're just seeing the case now. Like they don't care about the lights. You know, like a lot of, I feel like you're the only person who normally cares about the lights. Look at the gold detailing on the base though. Mm. Oh my gosh. I love it. Okay, my dad's getting the white one. I'm keeping this. <laughs> Look at the gold detailing on the top. If I had known that, I would have done the black to begin with. I really would have. <laughs> the blue light is my best friend size. <laughs> if you put it on the floor, yeah, let's actually put it down here just to kind of show a comparison size wise. Uh, I don't really have dimensions on my, <laughs> I don't exactly have dimensions on it, but but super clean. I think it would fit under here perfectly. I like the mesh top for my Corsair has. Um, this one isn't. I forgot that I did ask for tempered glass for his because I was going to. So my computer doesn't have very like lit up components, but a lot of the pieces from my dad's that I was like Frankensteining in were from my old build, which was filled with RGB. So I had picked the tempered glass so that he could see the pretty lights. You know, the fireplace is massive. That is true. <laughs> It does like in size comparison, but that's it. The wooden, the wooden panel, it's me, it's to a T. It is me. All right, guys, that concludes this segment. So we're gonna get started on Cyberpunk, but I just wanted to unbox this with you guys. I'm gonna keep you guys coming along with us for the building of my dad's PC. I'm gonna seriously consider if I wanna switch mine out for this. I... <laughs> I kind of want to, but then that means that I have to keep my old, uh, I guess that means I'd keep my old graphics card and my dad would get a 4080 Super. Hmm. AJ, yes, have a good one. Absolutely smash it. Win the matches for us, okay? Best check that if it fits before making a final decision, but look at the gold detailing. This is so me. <laughs> I built a new PC last year and I wanted this case so bad, but you couldn't get it anywhere. Were they sold out for a while? I think when they first, cause they're newer, they, they absolutely are a newer company as well. So yeah, I have a feeling that for a little bit, it was difficult to get. Um, I know currently they just launched the XL on the seventh. So they should, blah, blah, they should still be available. Yeah. It just came out on the seventh. Yeah. The normal North has been out for a little bit. Yeah, wood on the PC is such a clean look. I mean, I kind of like wood. <laughs> That's absolutely gonna get clipped, I already know. Ubi, also thank you so much for the Prime sub. Thank you so much. And Orbital and also 113, guys, thank you for the follows. We are about to get started on the gameplay, um, but I just wanted to share this with you guys and yeah, just tell you guys thank you. Cause all of these, like I say this with every sponsorship, but these opportunities would not be available or like even an option without y'all support. So thank you guys for just bringing a lot of my, just making a lot of my dreams come true. Um, I've never worked with a, I guess I, I haven't, we've never done a sponsorship for actual gaming gear or anything. Like we've done sponsorships for games now and for Disney but we've never done any kind of components for building PCs. So this is a really exciting moment for me. And it happens to be with the company that I wanted. Like this is the one that I wanted like more than anything. And I believe in them and their products thoroughly. So from anybody who's looking for a PC, I definitely recommend it um, from somebody who was it. I like even before I was partnered with them now. So absolutely pray. Absolutely. Yeah. And all the dimensions are on the website as well. So, I mean, I would say, of course, like when you're building your PC, ensure you check compatibility, like make sure you check compatibility because I run into that issue myself. Like, um, spazzy when spazzy and I were working on the builds. Yes. It still to this day, double, triple check all your dimensions. Absolutely. Organism. Welcome back in Zico as well. And Morpheus. Thank you for two whole years. You like wood, you say, tell us more. I knew this was going to go to, um, I will say that I think 
I think the wood paneling on the black, now check, uh, I think the wood paneling on the black might be a little bit darker. I'm gonna do a comparison and I'll post a picture in Discord as well because I do think that this is a little bit more um, like a dark oak, whereas the other one is a little bit lighter with the white. It's darker on the black one. Thank you, Z yeah, Zen, yeah. It's darker, which this is the color that I've been obsessed with more lately. Like this is a lighter shade back here, but I've been obsessed with this rich oak. Oh, it's so beautiful. You need three fans in the front? Yes, I think you, no, there's three. Yeah, three fans in the front on this one. You can get by with doing two fans on the normal north. Right now I'm running, I wouldn't recommend it, but right now I'm running two fans on the front to fit my graphics card. So I'm excited to be able to fit it into this one. So the design of this one is fantastic. Yeah, and so if, if maybe one of the things that you guys were holding off with on the normal north was the size, you now can get it in larger, but. There are websites that let you put in hardware that you're looking for. Yes, Maddie Man. Well, PC Builder, like PC Builder is one. Okay, I'm gonna put them down. I'm putting these down. So I will keep you guys updated on the build for my dad. Now I'm gonna have to make the hard decision of, I kind of want to keep this one. <laughs> I kind of want to keep this one. <laughs> no. <laughs> my dad is also coming today. So I've got to try to hide it from him. And I don't know how I'm going to hide this massive box. I'm going to have to put it into a room and be like, do not go. Turn back, Sarah. Reek and also Zeno. Guys, thank you for the follows. Out of curiosity, how did I settle with the name Casticlism? That is a fabulous question. Also, Darpass, free fractal for mods. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Star pass. Thank you for the 500 bits. I guess I don't have a, I don't have a name thing. I do not. Does he not watch your stream? Dingle? No, he doesn't. He'll watch my YouTube videos. He'll always like send me, he'll send me like updates and he'll be like, Hey, uh, I clicked on your video. I didn't really watch it. Cause sometimes he thinks he's like, it's kind of weird. I think it would be weird. Like think about, it's kind of weird when you watch somebody that, you know, I guess. Um, but yeah. And I just don't play games that he really cares about that much but he'll always click on it. He's always like a very supportive dad. Yes, yes, Zico, they released. Yeah, that's what we were just covering as the release of the new North XL. And it is fantastic. Um, Casticlism comes from a combination of things, mostly because I don't think Squeegee was gonna be a good name for, for a Twitch name. Um, but no, I started with Casta. I used to go by Casta, Casta 11, Casta all of these things on like Xbox and stuff. Um, and it came from a book that I loved. It was like a YA book that I loved reading when I was a kid. And <laughs> the protagonist's name is Katza, but my brain read it as Casta the whole time. So I thought I was so cool picking the name from a book. Little did I know I messed up the name myself. And when I went back to reread the book, not only did I realize that, but I also realized that some YA books are better left like as a memory. Like maybe you shouldn't go back and read it too, too much. And then I added Clism a lot later. I actually used to be KS underscore, KS underscore Casta for Kill Steel. Grace Lane. It's still a good book. Jess is actually reading it right now herself. I'm so nasally. I'm nasally. But yeah, first usernames. KS underscore Casta was not it. Okay. And then at the time I was going to school, I was still in the military. I was personal training. There were so many things I was doing and I felt like my life was a catastrophic event. Like I just felt like a tornado whirling around in life at that moment. So then I added the Clism part to it and I wish, I think looking back, I like Casta. I do like Casta, but I do look back and wish I had been like magpie or something like something that still included a little bit of my real name. First username is buried in a deep, dark underground, never to be found again. Well, you guys remember it used to be Killer Eel, right? Muhammad Akoko, guys, thank you for the follows as well. Um, yeah, I just used to be like that. I feel like I used to read things very, even sometimes I kind of felt like if you've ever seen the sheriff, I'm not <laughs> the sheriff in uh, Robin of Men in Tights. I do that sometimes. Casticlism wouldn't roll wouldn't roll as well. So it's good. It was a misread. Yeah. Cats, a cat cyclism, cat cyclism. Well, even now, a lot of people, even now, a ton of people can't say it like correctly. Like everybody's always asking, like, how do you say it when we raid or things like that? Oh, I love my fern. I love my fern. I'm finally at the point where, I mean, if you guys have been following for a while, I've tried a lot of different products, tried a lot of different chairs. I've tried a lot of different cases. And I'm finally at the point where I'm like really happy with my setup and everything that I have from my earbuds to my case now, like I literally couldn't ask for anything better. Um, and that goes with my chair, 
my chair is one of my favorite things. Like I can sit in this chair and I quite literally do sit in it for hours and hours in a day. Great story. Thanks for the history lesson. Totally relate to the naming after the story. Picked my name because of Handsome Jack and Caboose from RVB. Okay, I don't know the Caboose, but Handsome Jack. I mean, of course, of course. Yeah, Magpie's like, but then, yeah, Magpie's a cute name. I like it. I always kind of like the idea behind it more, but I think that I've grown to really just feel like cast is nice because when your name is different, like my name is drastically different. I think that's how I'm able to kind of draw the line. I mean, we talk about it before, but that's how I'm able to not really get as hurt or bothered when people say things or like we talk about comment sections or stuff like that. It's a lot easier to not care when you feel like they're not talking about Maggie. They're talking about casticlism because it's very much two different things. So having that kind of separation in name alone also helps, I think, separate and just detach from people criticizing you because they don't know me as a person. They know a version of me or like the streamer side of me. So it helps a lot, which I think with Magpie, it'd be different because my dad always called me Magpie. So I think there's a little bit something special there about that remaining just a nickname for him. Also, Bjorn, thank you so much for the follow as well. All right, you guys ready for some cyberpunk? Magpie sounds a little bit like a pet name, I feel like. Yeah, I feel like it would have been kind of weird for a username. Easier to compartmentalize, exactly, Striker. And y'all know I am compartmentalizing queen over here. Judgy. Judgy with the 10 gifted subs to the channel and community. Dude. Thank you so much. Judgy, welcome back in. How are you doing? Good morning, Night City. Let's go. Sturdy, dirty. I don't have it added. Hold on. I realized now I don't have it added. There we go. Nice. Phil, Phil, welcome back in. Okay, I do think we've seen both of these, I want to say. President Myers must have been waiting for a whole week. President Myers? Mr. Myers? Oh my gosh, President Myers. Right, 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 right. Myers, yeah, it's been a week. Give me a break. Imperial, welcome back in. Organism, enjoy the lurk. Yes, if you guys have not played the DLC, what are you doing? Get out of here. You're going to get spoiled. You're going to get spoiled. I love you guys so much, but save your own playthrough get out of here run away the intro is done we're officially getting back to gameplay um but yes if you guys are new here welcome in thank you for everybody who followed during that intro we were doing a little bit of a um really cool opportunity and sponsorship that i was so excited to share with you guys so we are back to the game though it has been a week i did want to let you guys know that we will be doing full cyberpunk streams here on out until we finish the game so we won't be taking those fable breaks on thursdays so it's gonna be back-to-back -back cyberpunk. Today is also gonna be a little bit shorter of a stream. I'm gonna to have to skedaddle right at 2.30 because my dad is gonna be here and I need to make sure I hide this case from him as well. Um, so tomorrow is gonna to be a longer stream though. And I kind of talked about that on Thursday as well. Sunday, we're gonna do a little bit longer of a stream. Salamander, I'm only halfway through the VOD, so I'm gonna to have to go and try to catch up. Yeah, no, absolutely, absolutely. Thank you for stopping by Salamander. And I hope you have a great rest of your Saturday. Games here with Casta, no way. Imperial Red and also Dancing Gentlemen. Guys, thank you for the follows. And Judgy, thank you so much for 10 more gifted subs to the channel and community. Clumy, Naughty Peach, hello? Srujan? Good presentation of the sponsor. Probably the first time I didn't look for a skip button during a sponsorship. No, man, I appreciate that. I mean, I think that's part of, I feel like that's part of just kind of what comes across when you're picking sponsorships that you already are either using or like it worked out really well because you guys know that I'm doing a build for my dad and it was a perfect time I think to do a to do a partnership it's been probably overdue that I did pick like a peripherals kind of computer component sponsorship to do and it was just one I think I waited and it was worth the wait like I've, I often get presented opportunities, but I never want to pick a sponsorship unless I really feel like I stand beside everything with them. It's a huge compliment to the devs that they managed to make such a rainy, destroyed scene. Like, the whole city though. I mean, all of Night City looks beautiful in its own regard. Yeah. 
like especially bring your dad on stream so i did talk about doing a father daughter possible stream where he's probably not going to be on camera but we could do some kind of voice thing harold thank you for the follow as well Yes, Pi, we're uh, partnering with Fractal for the next six months. I'm super excited. This is also our first time like long partnership as well. So it's really special. Today is just a huge day, guys. Shadow, thank you for the 500 bits. Dark Star with 300 bits as well. Thank you, guys. Truly. And again, these opportunities would not be possible without you guys. So thank you. All right. We need to head to... Oh, yes. Wait, I think we're about to meet the character that you guys always say and spoil. This is like the one spoiler I know. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. I gotta take my controller back from the Xbox though. No, man, thank you. Drax, hi, Drax, welcome back in. I'm mostly a lurker, but I just wanna say it's so cool to watch your channel grow. Clue me, thank you. Don't yeah, it's, uh, it's a lot's changed over the years. A lot has happened. Um, and I'm, I'm just so grateful to the process along the way. And I think, I'm, I guess that like this sounds weird, but I'm grateful for it, this, like I call it a slow burn, but if you're new here, it has not always been like this. Like I've been streaming for almost six years and the last two years it just completely transformed when I went full time. But it was nice to not immediately see any, I think rapid growth can easily, be hard to deal with and I haven't had that and so it's been this nice slow burn and I've been able to keep ahead of it and on top of it and not feel like I burnt out or anything like that which I think can come from immediate gratification you know so a man away a man away welcome back in as well are you gnome fractally in fractal oh noble one maybe you're the one who can save the world although more like <laughs> no <laughs> no Striker, yes. So we just uh, we just rescued the Prez, and we are headed to. I have not played all week, guys, but I'm so excited to get back into it. Oh, Thursday is gonna be. Oh wait, maybe Monday. It might be Monday. I don't know. I'm gonna see. I do want to finish a bunch of gigs, but I want to open up into the rest of this. Yes, we are headed to the Capitan. Capitan. Mm. Back to the land of the living. Shame Songbird was the price to pay. Think she really kicked the bucket? My gut tells me that the fiasco's nothing but a small setback, although my nose did catch the unmistakable whiff of a runner's deep fried gray matter. Now all that's left is surviving NC's most twisted district while babysitting Madam Prez herself. Shivy, take a sampler gig next time, would you? This woman, we did not read this bio, and I want to read this bio today because I've never been more impressed by a character. Like, she came in swinging. Her whole, like, everything about her is phenomenal. Shadow. Also, Surge, thank you for the follow. And Shadow, thank you for 500 more bits. Thank you. Um, how come the screen looks so small? The screen? What are you talking about? Madness. Madness, thank you for five months as well. Thank you. The Prez? Amazing. The incumbent president of the new United States of America, Myers was born into a wealthy and influential East Coast family, said to be descendants of the first English settlers aboard the Mayflower. She began her political career in the U.S. Marine Corps. Yeah, insane, like, fighting abilities. And I actually, I think we had talked about that before we even realized that she had previously served in the military. You had to know that she had some kind of training background with it. Like, she was so skilled with that weapon incredibly impressive i'd say who my favorite character is but i don't think you've met them yet i don't think so if it's from the dlc probably not unless it's songbird or rosalyn i don't think so hobbit man thank you for the follow as well um her patriotism courage on the battlefield obedience and discipline paved the way for her rapid promotion and brought her the attention of the militech's top brass after the death of the corporation ceo donald what donald lundy it was myers who succeeded him succeeded him there are conflicting opinions about Meyer's reign as president of the corporation, but her reformist zeal has an earned her more opponents than supporters. Oh, okay. Without waiting for an official vote, 
of no confidence, Myers tendered her honorary resignation as CEO, justifying the decision with her intention to run for the office of the president of Noosa. She won the election, becoming the second in the brief history of the new states woman in the Oval Office. She ended her first term with a bang with the unification war in 2069 to reunite all the states. Despite military support from Militech, Myers had to withdraw the NUSA troops from California. Her shattered expansionist dream apparently didn't deter her Myers in the slightest, nor have they damaged her popularity as she went on to win two subsequent elections and is now gearing up for a fourth term. Although as a politician, Myers appears in her element, those close to her know she misses her time in the Marines. That's not to say that the NUSA's president's life is devoid of excitement. Repeated assassination attempts confirm that a dead Myers would be more valuable to some political factions than the status quo. Yet for the time being, the greatest danger in the president's life remains her long-standing nicotine addiction. Has she smoked in front of us? I don't think we've seen that yet. Is she popping zinnies? What is going on here? Banna, welcome back in. 2069 noise, bunny. Also, Zoe and Zavi. Zavi, guys, thanks for the follows. Welcome in. She has one of the longest bios. Like, we've seen a lot of long bios, but it goes to show you how well thought out and well rounded their characters are. Like, truly. She's hidden the vape. Is she the president's committing zins? <laughs> A little zinny. Uh, FIA. Federal Intelligence Agency. Okay, no, I didn't. I don't think we read this one either. The Federal Intelligence Agency was established in 2006 after the dissolution of NSA. Oh, whoa. And CIA. Both which were implicated in organizing a conspiracy to overthrow the U.S. government. In theory, it was supposed to take over and join their functions, but in practice it remained an, un an underfunded institution of marginal importance, importance for almost half a century. This all changed after the ratification of the NUSA's constitution in 2053. The FIA was granted extensive power and privileges, and a huge budget made it possible to recruit a veritable army of secret informants and equip them with state-of-the-art technology. That's got me excited. That statement alone. Whoever we're about to meet, I wonder if they're going to give us some of this. Since 2065, when Rosalind Myers became the NUS president, the FIA steadily grown, has grown in strength. The active participation of agents in the course of the Unification War has become an open secret. After the war ended, the FIA's involvement in the direct military action was greatly reduced in favor of data acquisition and analysis. FIA agents now conduct intelligence operations around the world, loyally and discreetly pursuing the NUSA's political objectives. The weekly reports that President Myers receives from the FIA's leadership provide her with the invaluable knowledge of the plans and actions of foreign governments and multinational corporations, and even a few influential private individuals. Skeptics say that the FIA serves Myers mainly as a secret weapon in her political games against Miltech. The reality? Only the FIA knows. Only they know! That is so cool. I love the detail that they put into the DLC, like, by itself. Ooh! Secret agent reporting for duty. We didn't do the official swear in, but. So I think there are, wait, whoa. Hold on. We do need to toss some things in here and we now have the relics. Do I have any more relic things? <gasps> okay, I've missed, I've missed playing this. See, this is what happens though. You take a couple days off and then you come back and you, oh, I'm a chocobo. I forgot. I forgot that we're a chocobo. Shadow, by the way, MT Arcade, thank you for the follow and shadow. Thank you so much for the thousand bits. On top of it, you're popping off today. I'm keeping it classy as a chocobo. Yes, absolutely. <laughs> Aw, Def, welcome back in and thank you for the hydrate. Mm -hmm. Chocobo with some kind of orange outfit underneath though. Let me see if there's new hats. Maybe not the chocobo, whoa. Advanced lightweight polycarbonate Arasaka helmet. Okay, that one's not bad. Chocobo. Chocobo. Is this... <laughs> I think I have to go with the white hat for the chocobo. Space chocobo. The space chocobo. I would love to see a chocobo with a little astronaut helmet. Absolutely. All right. Let's get into it. Michael. Michael. Hi. Are you already on to like your second playthrough of the game at this point? 
Let me go over here. Oh, and we did kill those people that came into here. I am going full Johnny at this point in time. I've completely become Johnny. I know the boots, lady. The boots? These boots are made for walking. We need to try to find the president's, uh... The president just sitting back having a beer, dipping. Like, oh my gosh. The enemy could even see her if they were blind <laughs> with the chocobo outfit. We're headed to, I wonder if, I guess I should just go on foot. I think it's easier to go on foot. Yeah. Side jobs. <gasps> Side jobs within it. Ooh. Side job side. No, those were beat on the brats. Never mind. A lot of these were here before. John John, thanks for the follow as well. Hmm. We need to make sure we're keeping our eyes peeled for the tarot cards too. I'm 52 hours in and still first playthrough. Oh, Michael. No, 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 no. I guess I don't even know quite that. Hey, made the right call not taking that fascist ass oath. Oh, yeah? Some causes are worth pledging your life to, V. This ain't one of them. Mm, F the system, am I right? How'd you come to that? Because with the biz done, their arm will still be far up your ass and you'll be a meat puppet. No, I was once at Corpo Jarhead, right? Practically no? dove in the uniform head first. They had a real hard on for the oath. Repeat after me, bloody fucking blah. But we love a good oath. Can't remember what I solemnly pledged to do. Sure, you want to talk about this? Got a hand it to you, V. Oh, Wiser than I was back in the day. I feel like he keeps giving us more and more compliments. Louis, we love side jobs. We love gigs. We love our side jobs. Yes. You're stuck with classic Johnny, not the emo Johnny. There's an emo Johnny. Just your hi, welcome back in. The side job there in Dogtown is actually really good. I'd recommend doing that one. I think we're gonna keep we're gonna want uh I think we're gonna wanna go a little bit further in main mission, right? Before we do any kind of side missions yet. I think I would just say, just give me like a, give me a little tap on the shoulder when you guys feel like it opens up to kind of allow me to do some more side missions and things like that. Mm-hmm. Yeah. The English I absorb here is going to get me. <laughs> it's going to get me what sooner or later? Sorry, what? I hope you meant beat and not meat. Lay in. Thanks for the follow as well. You'll know when. Yeah, I feel like this is very much... It felt even weird to kind of pause the... Oh. Lovely. It felt really weird to pause right there as well. This, uh... The main missions go, like, back to back to back, and they fit so perfectly that I couldn't even tell the break in them. Ah, <sighs> Something's beeping. I'm doing every single side uh, mission, exploration, and minigame. Yeah. Dogtown chose a new pope? Maybe the Veep crashed Space Force 2. Oh. Curious as I am, we got an important call to make. Again, I just want to point out that he's not wearing his glasses as much as like anything else. And it's got to be important. Don't tell me though, but I feel like it's got to be important. Pray, pray, ski, welcome back in. And also Serge. Serge, you came from YouTube. Uh, wait, 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 wait. Wait, wait, there are cool walkthroughs of Detroit by you. Love it. Sergio, yeah, thank you so much for popping over from YouTube and welcome into the live side of things. Thank you. Uh, there's a way to change how Johnny looks in the main menu, maybe? We'll check it out at the end of the game, but I like his classic fit. I do. Hmm. I don't like who she is when she's with that breathtaking guy. <laughs> he does somehow bring out the worst in me. This is why I have to wait. Okay. Do I need to get ready to take things out? I mean, it's gotta love a bad boy. Pricey, did you did you buy the XL? Yeah, Gee, I just was showcasing town. it earlier. My my. Yet again with my favorite mark this my side. My favorite of the voice. I uh, only did the one gig for you as far as I recall. Hmm. And let's not forget our torrid tale of his Haitian voice sounds different. And animals. You could not have made contact with the VDBs without me. Your source for adventure I am, in Dogtown as elsewhere. So, we finally gonna meet in person? I can say neither yes nor no. In lieu of an answer, I've new work for you. 
I hope you'll accept. Is that the same voice One as the main last game? Thing. How you breached Dogtown's border, I'm not certain. Though I suspect not via the main gate. Irrelevant in any case. It is the same I've one. secured clearance for your future convenience. Your name and likeness now registered in the system, granting unfettered passage over the district threshold. Talk again soon. Okay. Uh, yes, I'm obsessed with his voice. He streams too. Oh, is he normally, is he more of like, is he a voice actor first and then kind of a streamer on top of it? Or was he a streamer and then got into voice acting? Precise, thank you for the follow. And also, wait, I just saw that you got the, you did get the XL for the 49D, nice. Which color did you get? Because I just was showing, oh, I just was showing the black and it has the gold accents and now I kind of want to, now I kind of want to switch for the black. I just, it's the gold accents. I know that's so silly and I'm probably not going to see them that much, but they're so crispy. Will be the voice in the altars. I don't know what the altars is. Raffle, raffles, raffles, welcome in. Uh, only if you owned PL at the time, then you could call him first. I don't think I ever was able to call him. We talked to him one time before, one or two times. I think we've talked to him. Hands used to have a different VA. So we used to have a different VA and then, and then they switched it out later on. Is a VA first. He was streaming a lot recently and he took a lot of, and then he took a lot of gigs. Oh, that's really cool. Yeah. I'll have to check out his stuff. Mm, he still streams on Twitch, moving house at the moment right now. That's really cool. If you call me, it's a talk biz. I don't do chit chat. Our Dogtown streets can run rather narrow, though not by European standards, mind you. You'll require a suitable vehicle, one which I happen to have already arranged for you. Collect it at your leisure. You're welcome. This is the car that I always wanted to pick up. Isn't this the one that I told you guys? I was like, I want this car. I want this car. And he gives it to us. All right. A good fixer thinks of everything, don't they? Dogtown is what Europe looks like. Sounds lovely. Thanks. <laughs> I'm going to be sassy. This is what I was trying to tell. I bought the black with the walnut and the brass accents. Yes. The walnut desk will look so clean. I was actually thinking about how it probably looks really beautiful with, you know how a lot of people do the Ikea desk hack where they'll use the walnut top. And then the bases, they'll pick for something different. The walnut goes so well with it. Yeah, I guess it is more walnut than like an oak. Yeah. Wayne, thank you for the follow as well. It's the same voice, but someday you should watch the video of the old VA. He was young, fast talking, used to car salesman kind of guy, which I think first was the vibe for Pacifica more than okay. And then they switched it out when they, did they switch it out when they brought forth the DLC? Like, did it switch completely? Michael, welcome back in. Not really. I got it kind of highlighted a little bit. Y'all know tips, tricks, or spoilers? Okay. Uh, also see, thanks for the follow. Welcome in. Interesting lore when you're playing as Johnny. Went to save alt. Part of larger operation. Miltech was working for NUSA who wanted Arasaka out in Night City at the time. I need to do a whole video to describe everything that we've kind of experienced as well at this point. I was doing a really good job at reading the shards at the very beginning, and then I had death by shards. So I kind of want to go back probably at the end and click on a couple shards and get you guys to explain a lot of these side stories. But we'll talk more about the history behind it at the end. Absolutely. Do they sell case panels as spare parts? My parents case is full black, but if it can get gold accents, I don't think so. Of course, safe driving. I do want to pick up this vehicle, guys. All right, we need to sneak around too. But yes, I want to pick up this car because I was waiting for this for so long. I've never switched cases before. Is it easy? I'm probably going to get the white XL. One, do you already have one of their cases? I find... So I've switched cases three times now because I am a little case goblin. Okay, we don't have to worry about them. I think as long as we don't have... As long as we don't stay in their vision for too long, I think we're fine. I'm a little case gremlin. And it took me a while before I discovered Fractal. And now that I've had them again, I love them. I personally don't think it's too, too difficult, but it depends as well. I find the most difficult part of switching out a PC coach. The most difficult part about switching out the PC for me, it depends on your fans. I have the Leah and Lee interlocking fans that like, I don't have to worry about all the RGB connection and all of the cables and the wires connecting. And it makes a night and day difference. I think we need, I guess I should get a car. I guess I should get Millie. I think it depends on what you're used to. Wait, I didn't even have to pick it up. Who are you and what have you done with Millie? 
pie. We love to see it. Banana, thank you for the hydrate as well. Mm. It's a loot box. It's kind of like a loot box. I'm a loot goblin. I am. Ginger, no. Ginger. Gotta catch them all to the fractal cases too. <laughs> it's true. It's true. I'm gonna start getting, my brother is gonna get the next one. Everybody's getting a fractal case. Uh, this is kind of like a Millie. It's like Millie's older brother. The Mackie. The Mackie. All right, this is gonna be the Mac dump truck. Look at this, what are you putting in here? How am I supposed to fit all my wood in here? This is absolutely ridiculous. What am I gonna, I could fit the fractal XL case in this, probably about that. That's probably about it. <laughs> Millie has evolved. This is the evolved Millie, it's truly a Pokemon. Okay. What is that, to step up? Oh, <gasps> no, does it extend when, I don't think you're gonna be able to see it, but I'm assuming that it extends when you're trying to step up into it. I got a, I got the Fractal XL and Millie XL all in one day. Fourth hands and single runner, guys. Thanks for the follows. And Drifter, thank you for eight months of continual support. Look at this, though. The best part is my arms, my shadowy, skinny arms. <laughs> all right, Mackie. Mac Daddy. It's the Mac Daddy. NC77. There's some thick boy wheels. Do they have oh shit handles? I don't see oh shit handles. I don't know. Millie always had good handles. Hmm. It'll work. It'll work. I suppose. Ah. Uh, I know. I. But I'm telling you, once you step up into a vehicle, I might never go back to Millie. Once you have a step up truck, I told you guys I'll never go back to a sedan in my life. Actually, that's probably. At some point, I'll probably go back to a sedan, but. For the time being. All right, let's go to head to the cab. Okay. I think we've tried to drive one of these and the handling is horrid, but let me see. Oh, I missed the music. I can just imagine you driving this. You can just see you eyes above the steering wheel. <laughs> it's the spaghetti arms. Yeah, pretty much. Did I slept on my neck wrong and my neck is killing me. Millie's older brother, Milos. It's Milos. Lazy bookworm, welcome in. Thank you for the follow. Oh, I missed the music. Hold on. Okay. It's on my side today. Maybe. We lost everything. All right, let's go. Oh, there's Millie. Look how much bigger. You're right, it is an, it's the evolution. It is so much. Oh, it's so slow. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Gotta go this way. Hold on. No, don't dodge into the road. Amos, Amos, is it Ao Miss? Ao Miss? Thank you so much for the prime sub and welcome in. Thank you. Hi. I'm so glad to see you're enjoying your time here. Wow. This is fun. This is a cool area. It doesn't have the same feeling as Millie. It's not even slightly as fun as Millie. Look at Millie go. Yeah. Mac, daddy. Mackie and Millie. Mr. Hands. It just makes me think of Mr. Bones. Mr. Bones feels rattling. I think, oh, I think that there is a, another vehicle collection maybe? Mysterious Signal. That's new, we've never seen those before. Hold on, hold on. So miss, Ao miss, it is Ao miss, okay. Hello fellow Lord of the Rings fan, welcome in Ao miss. Yes, oh, you are absolutely welcome here and you are in good company. We are, I can't say all because some of us try to get under my skin by saying that Lord of the Rings is not as good or is not the bee's knees, but I'd say a lot of us love it here and you are so welcome here. Yep, there it is, great, trying to start. Yep, always trying to start something. Jasmine. Do timeout crate. Can you do timeout crate? They've been banned a few times, Turin, but they are continuing to come back. We're going to leave all the side missions. I think we do want to press forward just a little bit more with the main missions. And then we're, again, just kind of remind me when you think it's like a good time for us to break out and do more side missions. Bring the hammer. Who do you want me to time out? Jasmine? Is it Zen? I feel like you're, you're still gunning for Zen. Darp flower. Bye bye, Darp Pass. Bye bye. Bye bye now. 
We lost everything. And before I accidentally ban somebody else. Ain't nothing without your help. Check out Ronald's Prime Stems. Okay. Snacks? What do you Schwab. Need, Bite me. Pop turd. Is that a cat taking a dump? No, it's a dog. It's a dog. It's like Pop Rocks, but Pop Turds. Carlson's in your mouth. Carlson's in your mouth. I don't know about that one. I don't know. Buy you me. Hey, yo, I love a good loiter. But you gonna buy some shit or not? Okay. All right. Uh. Looks like a chum who's been around okay. town. Around? Shit, girl. This is my home turf. Who'd you think I am? Schwab, Schwab, no, <laughs> is it Schwab? You talking to the Pacifica Typhoon, Chum, AKA the DT Prodigy. Oh, the yeah, DT Prodigy. Yeah, okay, that one ain't my fave, but. <laughs> uh, when they was pumping me with boosters, could blast 100 meters in 6.0. I like yeah, his pants. Yeah, you heard right. Now I ain't do hardly 100 a day, no more. But what I'm saying is, hell yeah, I've been around. I like the pants. Pacifica Typhoon, seriously? <laughs> I like it. Shadow, no. Hashtag justice for Pon Pon. Get it out of here. Mm hmm. Blue Tendo. Typhoon Ronnie, huh? Are you serious? Scan the old screamers if you were doubting. Old Ronnie was a legend in the making. The hmm. headband is everything, yeah. How'd your rising star suddenly fly? It is a ring. Well, there's this chick, Fiona. It had this, um,. Center for Gifted Youth and Shit. Future sports stars. All Fiona. good, right? We, we talking uh, roof overhead, real food, training, boosters and chrome, uh, heaps of chrome, Chum. Princess Shit was Fiona. all rainbows and roses till you stumble. And Chum, I fucking wiped out. Landed uh. in the D-Town street with mean ass migraines and insomnia. Oh, the insomnia. And I was lucky too. Somebody's just screaming in the distance. Yeah. Uh, D Town Districts, tell me what you know. I guess we do want to figure out what's going on in this area. Yeah, the headbands, everything. Anon, thank you. No, Anon with the gift is up to Pon Pon uh, Love. D Town's Districts. What do you know? <laughs> Which ones, baby girl? Golden Pacific being the north of D Town. I got this uh, hill there, Luxor Heights. Mam is Name chained. makes a promise Don't and delivers. <laughs> Supreme views, 10 out of 10. Longshore oh. Stacks is the west side. Place got history, feel me? Uh, south is Terra Cognita. You best stay the fuck clear there. Terra Cognita. All right, before, hold on, I'm sorry, I gotta, let me, let me go take my antihistamine real quick, because my nose just, the allergies are strong today, so I'll be right back. Hold on. Hold on. Uh. You wanna come in? Oh my goodness, I thought I was gonna have like an allergy attack. Crash and DTR, guys, thanks for the follows. Welcome in and shadow these pesky allergies that have just become my whole life. It doesn't matter what the season is, it's all my life. Oh, what is happening in the background? Is Millie on a killing spree? <laughs> Probably. Rocky, thank you for the 200 bits in shadow. Thank you for three more gifted subs as well. Since I got you, why try to avoid? Actually, I do wanna know the. Gotta say, first time I'm in the hood. So, Terra. Got any the Terra. Uh, travel tips? As I say, steer the fuck clear of Terra uh, Cognita. Uh, <laughs> the place was a fucking Quan's paradise years back. Somebody's Talking screaming space in the light, background? Chrome of the future, all sorts of tech. <laughs> Shit'll fry your skull sponge. I now, hate that phrase that they use. Dust and scabs. Red ass <laughs> motherfuckers running the place. You go to Terra Cognita? You a corpse incognita. <laughs> giddy. <laughs> I love it. I love him for like giddy to giddy. Isaac, I thank you. I take a lot of pride in that. I do. Golden Pacifica sounds grand. All right. Golden Pacific. Grandiose name, am I right? Shit, mm. chum. Suits promise Eddie's raining down from every window. Peep shit in solid gold. That sounds painful. Prove true enough for my man Hanson. He the only one making fat stacks in that place, huh? Hanson. Golden Pacific's a bar guest breeding ground. Got their beers, logistics, fun times, 
All in one hell of a dangerous place if you was not one of them dogs. This makes me think of Atlantic ah. City. Like something about this feels very Atlantic City. <laughs> Tywin Lannister, what? He's rocking a fallout jacket. It's that blue, that kind of ah. fallout blue, yeah. Lux or Heights. Know anything Good morning, about him? XPS. Hi. Hey, best not snoop round there. Them voodoo boys been doing voodoo ah. shit since they made it their crib. Mm. Now they hop between two beds, Scavs and Hansons. For your visit, it's good to know who they be fucking around with at the time. Ask for trouble otherwise. Longshore stacks? Okay, longshore stacks, what do you know? We should buy something, mm. I feel bad for Everything like, pre using them for conversation. Shit, Start seeing containers, means you found a place. Them I containers, they used to hold bricks and beans for building the hood. Shit got clapped, Avi. He's wearing but a bolo big -ass tie. And <laughs> gone nowhere. I just noticed the bolo. Now we detailers, we resourceful. Some clever tombs grabbed them and behold, clean uh. living space in high rises, no less. Ain't no shit go to waste here, you know? I know, I know, since I got you here. Oh, oh, strictly. Gotcha, gotcha. Also, Stu, or Sue, Sue, is it Suitors? Suitors, welcome in. A new viewer here. I'm only on part seven of the VOD, so just dropping by. Gotta catch up. No, absolutely. Thank you so much for popping in, even on a little bit on the live side. That means I'm assuming we probably won't see you for the live you on the rest of this. Life, okay, sorry, sorry. Thank you for coming over. And I, I'm glad to see that you're using the archive channel and catching up on the VODs. Thank you. Since we're already Liar. Talking. Yeah, yeah. Well, what you think? Hey, 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 hi, liar. Some points of interest caught my eye since I got you. Let's ask you about some this. pretty unique places around here. Uh, this hood just exuding clever now, ain't it? <laughs> I want his pants. I want his pants. Oh, I do want to ask about the pyramid, though. There's so many. Oh, that does not look good. Pawn, pawn for life. Been to the stadium. Interesting place. Been to the stadium. Quite a sight. His smile. He uh -huh. has such a cute smile. They had big plans to set up shop there, you know? <laughs> but whoop! The competition whooped my typhoon ass. Mm. You, you know, Nighthawks was roosting there while Hanson was still shitting his diapers. How's it go? Good times make bad tunes, then bad tunes fuck shit up. Sounds about right. Bottom line is all about the eddies. Who got the most scratch? Hanson. Stadium ain't his main biz, oh no, but I, I ain't gonna say no more on that, huh? Hanson has that, like, uh, handsome Jack kind of voice that you know you just don't like him. Like, he just has that kind of voice about him. She's an upper and troll. Is it trollers? Trollers? Trolls? Thank you guys for the followers. And liar, good. Honestly, everything's been pretty good. Good. How about you? We gotta catch up soon. Whoever wrote this dude's dialogue did a good job of giving him a specific vibe. It's if very you ain't consistent. A customer, you a leaving customer. I haven't bought anything from you. What? You're just talking. There's a skyscraper. Let's ask about the pyramid. We even got a pyramid. Hard to miss that one. It's like Pretty Vegas cream, meets huh? Atlantic City. Fix this thing so for show. Beers talks get drowned out by wild party hubbub and tracks that are fire. Sith Lord. Privacy guaranteed, hmm? Bottoms open to all the riffraff. Mm. Upper levels, though? Shit's for VIPs. Big players. Big beers. <laughs> feel me? Maybe go and visit bits. myself. <laughs> Banging tunes, dent slides of Snow White, uh. and the biz is in tune. That's how you get in the major leagues. I love how I just stumbled upon this. I don't even know if he's the person that we're really supposed to be talking to. I think I just stumbled uh. on the guy that has the most dialogue for being an NPC. Came through an expo hall recently. That's true. Came through this mm -hmm. kind of expo hall. Some curious mock-ups of all kinds of buildings there. Oh, ho, ho. you got guts, girl. Like what you saw? Oh, them suits must have been tripping balls coming up with them district plans. <laughs> and then wham, reality kicked in. There's like an echo Guns in his voice too. woke up face down in the streets thinking, where did it all go wrong? Expo ain't no place for civvies. You got pre-war goods and shit there. Best stay clear, especially since Pete's been hearing blasts and explosions. I no wonder if the blasting has anything to do with us. <laughs> yeah, we barely made it out with our life in the expo. Big skyscraper. skyscraper. Know anything about it? Sorry, I left it, but I haven't seen the Suits skyscraper. Folks called it the Black Sapphire way back when. Folks call it the Hotel or Tower these days. Places gilded, I hear. 
pretty much out of reach for us mortals. Mortals. Apple hands his <laughs> eye, his golden air. He okay. wanna make jewels yeah. with you. He gonna invite you there. He had a view from the top of motherfucking Nova. Might be a little crazy, but I ain't cray, -cray, cray enough to find out for myself. You know, I actually was gonna share this with you guys too. Oh. Since we're already talking. Let's do see what he has to... Oh. Yeah, yeah, well, what, what you think? Futuristic wrenches? Ah! Thanks. Well, helpful. Seem to really know your way around. Well, shit. In my line of work, it's all about the gossip. It's the juicier, the better. I'd send some real spicy ones your way if you're so inclined. Uh, yes. Sure. <laughs> what? Fuck it, why not? Be nice to know what the street's saying. Oh, we're linking? We're sinking? Yeah, starting to get me now, huh? Gotta get a leg up whatever way you can and get old D-Town. Stay in touch, Chum. All right, Chum. Let me, uh, let's let me buy something got. from him, too, because he gave us a lot of dialogue. Dream is shit you ever seen. I never talked to this guy that long. No, I thought he had some interesting stuff. Let me remod Dark Pass real quick. Also, London, thank you. Nope. Hold on. Um... Real quick, I did not mod Darpas. Darpa? <laughs> okay. Uh, London, thank you so much for the gifted sub to Liar. Liar, that's crazy. Yes, we'll definitely link up. I want to hear more about how it's been. And Sneaky Flamingo, welcome back in. Darpa has now been removed. No, added and removed. Mm-hmm. We need that pic of you. You took on the statues on Discord. The pick of that I took. Oh, I was okay. So I was going to make one of my thumbnails for Florence and I was like looking through my photos, my photos. And all of a sudden it was me with the statue. <laughs> I saw it to furious to furious. Thank you for an entire year and welcome back in. Thank you. I modded DARPA. Uh, we hate to see it. You have an updated. I haven't updated the Widowmaker. Still epic. I'm really because I'm pretty sure what? Wait, hold on. Let me actually look at what he has. Let's see what you got. I thought we did. Dreamy shit you ever seen. Looks like a sink strainer wrench in the future is already here. <laughs> All right, he's got bubble gum that questionably looks like a condom wrapper. Um, a cube. I think I should buy the cube. A fan. Hygiene bag. Morley. Oh, should we buy some uh some zinnies for the president? Cell builder. What is a cell builder? Permanently increases max health by two. I'm gonna buy that. Boost the economy. Buy stress ball. Okay. Wait, 179 eddies for a stress ball? This better eliminate every single stress in my body. Every single piece of it. Postcard from Night City. We'll buy a postcard. Another postcard? Lottery scratch card? Looks like another loser. What are the odds? Ah, uh, previously enjoyed to perfection. Stop. Some say they're more effective than pills. Cheaper too. No, actually, I don't think they've made it. I don't think they've made it cheaper at all. I need an extra fan for the overheating PC. <laughs> so I'm going to swap out my PC like today. Souvenir magnet. We'll do a souvenir magnet. I like it. I like it. And then let's sell junk, which means I'm probably selling back some of the items that, yeah. Wait, no, 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 we have to keep the vinyl records. Hold on, vinyl records need to stay. Also, I like my candles. The, the bloody bandage can go. Also, what is this, a leather bracelet? No, that's, no. No, he does have creatine, yeah. Okay, I'm out. Yeah, I don't, I don't think that was what we were supposed to do, but. Hmm. Disarm. That could have gone poorly. Disarm. Captain Caliente. Guy clearly Johnny. Down at this place. Where is he? Stash house by the looks of it. He's in front of me. Right. Let's see what's here. That wasn't tracking on the audio. Dogtown inflation is rough. <laughs> it's really the cost of living is insane. Truly a half price slice. Sorry. What? Let me turn off. Mm, connected devices. She'll kill, us. She'll kill us. Wow. Okay, implants for cheap's got a problem. Most of these, yeah, the nano gel, you're a winner. I need your help. Megamit, do you guys remember when I got 
What was the the one that I abs read? Wasn't it read carefully? What was the one that you have to pass on to fight? Yes, if you send this to only three people, I cannot believe I fell for that. All of these are the scams. These are all scams. Surujin, thank you for the gifted sub to Bunny, by the way. Truth in plain sight. Okay, let's get going. Hmm. Scan the area to find the old telephone. Hmm. Resolve. Hi. Rezol, I guess I should say. This game is crazy. Played in VR. Somebody else was talking about that. I just cannot. I think a part of it is because I'm streaming. Like, I couldn't imagine doing VR while streaming. But that's impressive to play a whole game like that this length as well. Oh, phone. <sighs> Damaged. Dang. Okay, damage caused by a drop from a great height. There's got to be some more. The memory, the email. No, it's the text threads. It's like, you will die if you do not send this. There are three more people and condemn them. Shade, thank you for the posture check intrusion. Thank you for the gifted sub to Spurious too, Spurious. I hope you enjoyed the sub in the amount. Hidden hmm. door. What's this? That'll do. Antique. Junky variety. Mm -hmm. Wonder if it even works. Huh. We'll go back in a second. Loot everything because I think there's a lot of new items over here. I also need to watch out for mines. And they call it a mine. There's a way out of here. Maybe. Mm. I'm trying to decide if I should just connect just to get the points math math welcome back in dj hi as well guys hi wait i gotta make sure i'm posture checking all right let's just start hacking whenever we get the opportunity because i would like to max out oh two ic's i can go the bd route or 55 to bd 55 but i can't hit bd with that so i'm gonna need to go bd to 55 bd to 55 to bd then I see to 55. I'm going to lose the top one, though, unless I go 7A to 7A. But there's not a 7A in this row, so i got to go I see to 55 to 55 to BD. That will work. I hit the wrong button. Lovely. Lovely. Mojo, you're having pizza already? Is it lunchtime where you are? It must be, like, middle of the day. I didn't eat breakfast, and I should have. I did eat. I did eat. Thank goodness. Ah, oh, the chocobo. All right, let's ditch some of these real quick. Knack. Um, Knack, it hasn't been played. It's been blocked. It's been blocked. We need to go into the car and just drop off a lot of stuff. Like all of these melees I can drop off and that will give me a lot of space in my... 20th century inspired landline telephone functional. Are you kidding me? For real? that okay yep breakfast is overrated oh okay uh zero nine three one okay three one good morning good morning good old 20th century times spell power hi hmm. huh. cash now <laughs> oh, come on. Answer. It's because I pressed the wrong button. I'll have a double cheeseburger. While no, no, no. I, I know I pressed the wrong button. Uh. Reed? Listen. I'm really I've got no out. time to play games. Hello? Fossil's probably busted. Busted. Or you flubbed the number. No. What do we do now? Also, are you getting paler as we... Oh. The music changed. The whole music changed. Um. Call me V. Andrew Jackson, basketball court. Ryoko. Noted. Uh. Not exactly loquacious, no. our man of mystery. Could just prefer text. Damn sure I do. Something tells me his text would be a little bit more entertaining than Takimura's. Ryoko, thank you so much and welcome into Live Set. Welcome back in, I should say. Um, but I'm glad you watched Florence. I hope you enjoyed it. Such a beautiful short story. So good. 
Yeah, next Friday I'm going to share another one that's kind of similar to that. Um, and they both remind me so much of one another. Okay, go to the basketball court daytime. He's a zoomer trying to woo. Hold up. I actually want that tomato juice. Hold on, I like tomato juice. Okay, run away, run away, run away. I didn't do it. I don't think this is the best way to get here. What the heck? There's a lot of weird stuff happening. I do like that. I think there's like whole new NPCs for this area. Are you okay? Oh, I don't think he's okay. No. No. Oh my gosh. I... I don't even know what's happening in this area, but I feel like we need to get out of here. It's a mess. Okay, let me store all of these. That will help a lot. And then let me store anything that I'm not using. Pistol. Wait. What? There. There. Nope. Nope. Oh, Skippy. Skippy. You, Skippy, get out of my inventory. <laughs> it won't let me. Let, like, Skippy can't be stored, I'm assuming. Skippy, get out of here. Get out of here. <laughs> to be fair, not as bad as Cleveland, Ohio. Oh, my gosh. But where are the necromancers? Where did you see that sign? It's a normal Saturday in Dogtown. I went from Night City to an even bigger crapple. <laughs> I was not expecting this. It's slappy. Sla honestly. Welcome to Dogtown, Turret. <laughs> Everybody's like, you'll soon learn to sleep at night with all the sounds happening. Um, right. Okay. I just, <laughs> I guess it's only fitting that we have a different look too. Oh yeah, you're right. Beware the necromancers. Just normal signs. Black dog. What the dog do? Never stop me. Are there different songs happening right now? Marty, McFly Rock. <laughs> Thank you so much for the tier one sub. I'm so glad to see you're enjoying your time here. Thank you. Um, can I get that dog? Guys, I think there's new songs being played. I don't recognize all of Same shit, different day. Okay, there's kind of beauty in it though. Boom. Thank you. Let's check it out though. We'll go this way. This is my anthem. You guys already know. What's it down there? I only try to focus on the one lyric. Everything else I block out. Big man doing big man things. Whips. I just don't think it has the same feeling as when we're driving with Millie. I'm so disrespectful and this here's the anthem. Oh, the... I needed to see if the cops were as vicious in this area as the others. Alright, I think we just need to be on the down. Yeah, we need to be down. You just gotta test out. I was assuming there wouldn't be cops in this area. I didn't think the NCPD... It's not NCPD, it's the... Bar... What was it? Bar... Something different. No, it's not the cops. It's something different. They're called, um... Start with the B. Yeah, they're not actually cops, so it's probably... Yeah, bar guest. Bar guest. Wow, this is actually kind of pretty. Something about this reminds me of Last of Us when they're walking through and they see the giraffe. I need to run over for science. Science rules. Same bloodlust as Millie. 
The Mac Daddy doesn't play around. Hmm. Oh my goodness. Attention? This is a whole nother city. Like, this is crazy, guys. Again. Project Red doing it again. <laughs> One does not simply create DLCs. We make entire expansions. What are you on about? Oh my gosh. It's Millie's angry older sister and she don't take no shit from any other cars. This is Vance's really cool. Look at this. I mean, in some ways I like it more, but... I still don't understand how this was right under our nose the whole time. Did I just never... Uh, did I never look at this area? Was I not allowed to go in here? Or was this not here? I'm trying to... Surely I drove through this, right? Ah, what is your next non-so-casual game after Cyberpunk? Uh, Knights of the Old Republic. We're doing Knights of the Old Republic. I couldn't go in. So I always just drove around it? Floppy Pickle, yeah. Floppy Pickle. This game and Rebirth are my top five games. Well, it is the season. It's the time of the season. Uh, this, and then I was actually just talking to... I was, <laughs> I was talking to my agent and he was telling me that he was like, I gotta be honest. I know that, you know, you're excited for the Elden Ring DLC. However, I think you'd really enjoy Baldur's Gate 3. And I was like, no, you and everybody in my community. <laughs> I just, if I did do Baldur's Gate 3, it's another, we're going back to back long games. Yeah, I know. I know, I think if we were to do it, I would do like part one. Like I would do act one and then pause. You passed close to Dogtown entrance quite a few times. I remember passing close to them, but I don't remember it being like all blocked off, like this whole area. I don't remember that at all. Mike, Mike be high. How would you describe life right now before streaming? And any advice on what's going on for what it feels like? Wait, wait. Or any advice on just going for what you want when it feels scary to do so? Oh, there's that's such a loaded question, Mike. Oh, life right before I went full time. Terrifying. Terrifying. I mean, it's such a leap of faith. You really don't know. Um, I think you can think you're prepared. You're never going to be prepared enough. But I think that you can put things in place to make sure that that leap of faith is a little less scary. Like I felt like I was, I could try it for a couple months and if not, I still had the opportunity to go back to my old job. Uh, and now, now that so much time has passed, like it just wouldn't be possible to get back into my old job really. Um, but yeah, I think making sure you maybe have backup plans is the best way to describe it. I 400 hours in Baldur's Gate 3 and never finished the game. Bye. If you're going to start Baldur's Gate 3, it's such a goat. The goat of the goats, Serazio. <laughs> 200 hours on Act 1 alone. See, that's the only downside to this. And Satorio, thank you so much for uh, three months of continual support. And hello, welcome back in. Thank you. I'm on my fifth playthrough of Baldur's Gate 3, playing it right now. I think there's no denying that all of you guys help me by <laughs> bite. Is it bite? Um, I think there's no denying that I would absolutely enjoy it. I just think it would lock us into Baldur's Gate 3 and only Baldur's Gate 3 for a very long time. I tend to get very aware that I've been playing a game for two or, or three months. That's when I feel like, because not everybody's going to like Cyberpunk. Not everybody, I think, not, I want to see that. I think that's one of our, is that one of our, not every, yeah, that's one of our tarot cards, I think. No. Just a really cool graffiti. Right. Noise. Uh, yeah, I just, I try to do a variation of things, but now that we're starting to do like a cozy game once a week too, for people that don't love cyberpunk, they can pop in for those streams and such. Third honor mode. I think I would be down to do like act one. I again think it would take two to three months though. The cozy streams are for switching things up. Yes, exactly. No, absolutely. And Bugsy and Psyops, guys, thanks for the follows. Welcome in. All right, Johnny, let's wait. <gasps> no, there's a tarot card. Perfect. Yeah, I'm assuming the tarot cards will be aligned with some of our main missions. King of Wands. The Wands? I'm the Wand Master. Let me see. Get out or bring out your wands. The master of planning and unorthodox ideas. An individual who brings people together and radiates inspiration to those they consider friends. However, 
Their enemies will soon find that they are impulsive, devastating force of nature, capable of breaking oaths and crossing any line just to see their goals achieved. Yikes! That went south quick. No. If Classy was here, Classy would say Aries in a second. Oh my gosh. Bye. Everyone Thank you for the okay. follow. I'm glad to see you enjoying your time Better. here. Okay, let's sit down. He doesn't want to say anything. I'm on my 111th yes, playthrough. Nice. Today is my 111th birthday. You said 150 hours. Game to remember. Johnny Silverhand, basketball fan. That's new. You know what I All right. Okay. Squats. Starting. Cloud over One there. I see you. The fucking ball. <laughs> Cut the riddles, please. How do you mean? You're up against seasoned players, whereas you just stumbled onto the court. Mm -hmm. These are trained sociopaths. Pretend to be your friends while they fucking ain't. So go out and play. Just don't get played. Oh, thanks. Great advice. You're exaggerating. You don't trust Myers? Just come out and say it. You don't trust Myers. No, her type is all. Guys, I'm not good at basketball. Worse. Armed forces. No guns. Saying no to high-ranking cunts like putting your mouth over the barrel of their gun. Get shitty fast if you try to run. Take it from a deserter. He's got his glasses back on. Could enjoy the game instead. Supposed to trust deserters now? Uh, no offense, but could we just chill a sec? Watch the game some, enjoy just that. Do they like Why punch not? people mid-game? How about a hot dog and a cold beer while we're at it? Pretend we don't got a worry in the world. That would be so nice. Well, when you put it like that, yeah. fine. Savor it while it lasts. Don't turn around. Eyes on the call. Oh. <laughs> Hands, what you hold it? Uh, a token? Don't know who I'm talking to? I see you like something. to know who I'm talking to. Blind, Mitchell. You know who I am. Nope, nah. -uh. Oh. Don't do that. Just don't. Okay, I'm not moving. So I'm not moving. Uh, can you see him? Johnny, who the hell's breathing down my neck? How the fuck should I know? Only see what you see. Oh. I see you holding something. Show me. That's so interesting. I hadn't thought about it from that side. Yeah. Got this token. Could just do act one. Yeah. Mean anything to you? But I need to make sure. Keeps his cards close. This one. Who sent you? A mutual friend. I'm gonna get straight to it. I mean, he's got Rise a gun to my ribs. Not. And neither do you. Got a pro spy here, V. Is she safe? Not if we waste any more time. Hard to say. The longer we sit here, do you That's see it. what happens? Dribble around him. Were you followed? Did you even bother to check? Uh, I'm not sloppy. That's not true. Don't know. Wasn't looking for a tail. Well, you get one point for being candid. Voltimar is fine. girl. Black Thought and Merrimack, Hillen Street. Three minutes, front seat. We better leave separately. Don't want anyone to get suspicious. As the you have a gun pressed into my ribs? Don't holding hands? Reed? He's already gone. Slippery motherfucker. Oh, I think he likes me. I think we really hit it off. <laughs> sure, bet he's got candy in that van. Uh, Ready oh. to find out? <laughs> Lollipops, candy. Oh my goodness. You see the guy I was talking to? Hey, you see that guy I was talking to a millisec ago? Big guy? Coat looking yeah. like he's planning on flashing some kids, huh? Hey, oh. shut it or get oh. lost. Oh my gosh. Anybody else possibly see? Probably not. With the right guns installed, man. No. Dunk even His voice was really sm uh, yeah, low, though. I felt like that was way lower than I was expecting. Know, uh, Mego, Azen, and Mike, guys, thanks for the follows. Welcome in. Wham, Good down. morning, Dogtown. <laughs> Just casual. I can't wait to explore some of these buildings, though. Give me my life back. Oh, that's sad. Lollipops, candy. If you have seen Chitty Chitty Bang Bang, like then you will also have been scarred for life and never forget that saying as long as you live. I don't even see him in here. Good morning. 
Yeah, no, Shard, Shard, I definitely would like to try Baldur's Gate. I think it's it's going to take longer as well because I've never played anything like that. Oh! I don't know who he is, but I like the interior of his vehicle. Yeah, Naughty, that's what everybody's saying. That's why I'm like, I think I should do it. I just... I want to play a couple of shorter games before, but I think we could maybe dive into it for the summer. Before Possibly. we go, apologies for the precautions. I only ever rest so much. Sometimes it's just safer to shove the barrel of a Malorian between a Troon's ribs, even if he is on your side. It's nothing personal. No hard feelings, I hope. I'm sorry, good morning. <laughs> pew pew, welcome in. Don't remind me of that scene. Chitty Chitty Bang Bang is top notch, absolutely. You don't but... have all day. Uh, so, yeah, there's not a lot of people that can, uh, can, I would say, usurp Johnny in my mind right now, but it just kind of, kind of is taking his place. I wouldn't mind if we shared a shard in my brain. Uh, nice to meet you, too. Hello. Earth yes, 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 yes. But... <laughs> Nice meeting you too, Reed. Not a phrase I often hear in this trade. You're not in the biz, V. Major be. HR, I'll take that HR complaint. I'll take it any day. Slap it on me. <laughs> Actually, I am since yesterday. Actually, I am though, just mm -hmm. since yesterday. I was about to say your first times out are the hardest, but I'm not gonna lie. I combed FIA data for info about you. Interesting profile. No man. Back in Done his research. No longer extent. Now a freelance merc. <laughs> to make things more interesting, FIA agent. He received a commission last night. Impressive, but I know. One thing eludes me. What drove you to get entangled in this mess? I do just want to say the detailing in his face. And I think it's, 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 uh, yeah, yeah, it's the beard. It's the beard for me. Um, the detailing that they've done. We don't have all day. Songbird hired me just a gig. Hmm. I have been wondering that myself. It's all felt like they've done such a great job of making the DLC feel like a whirlwind from the moment that Songbird brings you in. It feels just so fast paced. And I think they really meant it to feel like that too. Like you almost don't feel like Hello. you have that downtime. Earth to be. I know Idris, I'm sorry. Amish, thank you so much for 10 gifted subs to the channel and community. Thank you. Welcome back in and thank you so much guys. I hope you give Amish a big thank you if you got a gifted sub. Uh Songbird. Songbird hired me. Know her? Look at the expressions in his face. So me. Something up? We used to work together. I thought I heard the last about her, but that girl's a magnet for trouble. <laughs> right. It's time we paid our friend in distress a visit. I wouldn't say that's like a address, please. I, I wouldn't. That code is not giving me flasher vibes. But I wouldn't say it. No, if, if OK, just FYI, not so sure you're going to like it. Try me. Abandoned building on Elizabeth Crest. Abandoned building on Crest Street, eighth floor. Damn straight, I don't like it. You know nothing about a magnet for trouble. Let you me tell you about Millie. Dogtown. This music. She doesn't need a sitter. Myers can take care of herself. Not a damsel in distress. Sar, take charge. Yeah, me too. It's not a first rodeo. Survived a few assassination attempts. Real tough. But still. I would she never say something sus. Hold up. I need to take this. Oi, red flag. Why are you calling me on my day off? Also, he barely fits in the car. Last Look at that. Heard, he's he's like tucked in like a shrimp. Ask Bob. He owes me a favor anyway. <laughs> yeah, well, tough nuts. You'd have to manage without. Oh, are you not? You're not even looking at the road. Boss, man. I work the door at a club. Selection, you know, bouncing. Working as a bouncer? I guess it would be a good, yeah. FIA no, special No, no ray tracing on. Bouncing away time mm. in a club. The job attracts ex-cops and commandos, too. I know a few. I took the candy. Bunch. Trouble. <laughs> Easy to blend in with over beers. Uh, no, that's a good. I think that is a good cover. 
This is not how I imagine spending my day off. Saving the president? Great action BD shit right there, am I right? I feel yeah, like I'm sure, giving off so. flirty vibes with my voice, though. Does my eyes still smoke? Oh. I, I can't remember seeing her smoke. I'm sure she did. I think they did I mention that. on the balcony this morning. Why you ask? Oh, she when did, yeah. When things start to spiral out of control, she's likely to light up. It's high time we help her out. Do you think he served in the Marines with her? Before he went FIA, maybe? Don't actually answer that. Um, yeah, yeah, I've played horror games before. I would do it again. Yeah. I normally play horror games more around October. I'm not good with horror games, but I'll play them. I'm always down to play them. King Greco, and also, is it un unhucked? Thanks for the follow, welcome in. Let's go. Get out. Mm. Vehicle's nice. I will say, looking like a fishbowl with this, so this windows. He needs some more tin if he's Eight working floor. undercover. Yeah. Lead the way. Lead the way. Madison, we've done Madison. We've done a couple other things. Biggest munch, by the way, welcome in. You can actually find him working as a bouncer at the club before you start Phantom Liberty. Wait, that is a really cool fact. But Naked, which, which club did he say specifically? Is it a club in Pacifica? That's such a cool little tidbit. Eternity, thank you for 10 months and welcome back in. I didn't say I was good with horror games, no. Where Dino is, oh. Dino's, um, Dino's up here, yeah. That's cool. Oh, what is that club's name? Yeah, he's a sleeper agent, not an undercover agent. Yeah, that is a good point to make the distinction between the two, good point, Ward. Or war dancer. Also, munch and talk, guys. Thank you for the follows as well. Eternity, hi. How are you doing? Mercy is for the week. Dinos? Every time I go dinos? Oh. More people. We find a couple more bodies that she's had to take out. Oh, I love Dead by Daylight. No, I love. I, I normally do Dead by Daylight by myself, though. Professional button presser on elevators at this point. Honestly? This Electric orgasm or something? Is that what Capable it's called? Capable taking care of herself, you know. I actually had uninvited guests last night. Injected via the garbage chute. Sometimes that's the only way out. <sighs> okay. Mm -hmm. I'm still waiting for the Subnautica. That would be the true horror game for me. I was talking about it when I was playing Forest on Wednesday with Anna. She was like, "I there's no way I can see you playing that." Forcibly, this whole level would be in shambles. No way she would have gone quietly. Take point. Hmm. Open up. I still it's don't me. think. Yeah, I don't. No, is that part of the mission? Is that somebody snatched her? Oh no, nope, we're good. Is this how you greet me? Uh. Sorry, Rosalyn. Are you all right? I'm good. Glad to see you are too. Close the door, close the door. Close the door. Subnautica's your favorite game of all time. Poppy's Playtime would be fun. I think that'd be like more of a YouTube, maybe for YouTube for Halloween. You remembered my number. Some numbers you never forget. Hmm. Level with me, Rosalind. You never intended to call that line. Well, I found myself in Night City with a bounty on my head. So it seemed the right moment to reach out, have a tete-a-tete, -tete, reset an old friendship. <laughs> when I need something. I'd offer to sit down and chat over coffee, but the clock's ticking. I need to arrange a passage for you to Washington. Hmm. No, Reid. We need to talk first, all three of us. Here. The president, a merc, and a special agent. She said three, Johnny, not office. four. Question is, where do I fit into this joke? You don't. You don't. You've seen the, the Leviathans? News. No, yeah, exactly. Uh, Hanson's spin work never fails to amuse. Ken, hi. Thank He's you for He's not acting purely months. on his own initiative. Someone from our camp's propping him up. Who is backing him? Actually, good point. A, any idea who he's in bed with? Rosalind has more enemies than you can count. This shit runs deeper, Reed. I wasn't alone on that flight. I heard So Me was on board. Who's So Me? Where is she now? V was the last person to talk to her. Oh, Songbird, it was So Me. I always forget. They keep interchanging it. Um, 
Yes, Little Nightmares is super good, Mr. Chill. It's possible she hit ice. I mean, I guess it's possible, no. but I feel like she's... likely scenario. Got caught in some ice on the combat bot when she hacked it. Mm. One little mishack happens even to the best, but no way to know for sure. Mm -hmm. Unfortunately, we need hard evidence, not Shiny speculation. Somebody needs to go after. Reed, I needn't remind you what this means for the NUS's national security. Besides, she's your prodigy, Saul. You taught her all your tricks. Oh? Hell, even recruited her. She and V have a unique... Uh, bond. It's a lead. Our only one for now. It's a party, Zoe. You two have to find her. Together. We're working together. I already together. died for the cause once. Not enough? Uh, yeah, Reed, let's talk about that. You died? I know I can't wait for the third one to come out. The DLC. Yes, Darth Vicious. We're on to the DLC. Also, Zand, thank you for seven months. Ken Dog with 11 months, guys. Thank you so much. I really appreciate the continual support. What do you mean you died already? What has my eyes told you about me? Said you'd let an intelligence cell here. Went into hibernation at war's end. So she omitted the fact that Arisaka tried to smoke me. <clears throat> Myers? And that I ended up in intensive care with three bullet holes. That six months had passed before I could take a shit on my own. Might have slipped her mind. Sensitive Convenient. conversation. Well, now you know. Not everybody wants to admit how long it takes them. <laughs> Songbird needs your help. Got a debt to pay, Rosalind? That's interesting. Sky, hi. Let me get this straight. You abandon Reed and NC. Leave him for dead, and now expect him to jump right back into shit? Newsflash, Madam President. Got a hell of a debt to pay. You're right. Hmm? I'm sorry, Reed. For those seven years. I'm trying to get, like, a good angle to see both of their Is expressions. that enough? To get us a fresh start. A half-assed apology? I'm here. I'll help. But I'm doing it for Somi. And my country. Call me naive if you like. Hmm. As for you, V. You said in a car a songbird hired you. Correct? I don't know how much she's paying. But you better ask yourself. Is it worth it? Doing this because I need to survive. I don't think that they really need to know that, but this still this still goes into like the biggest question that I have with the whole DLC, doing the DLC before finishing the game. Cause if you guys are popping in for the first time as well, that's what we've done is we've done chipping in, but we held off on Nocturne on uh, Nocturne. And there's like one other side mission that we're doing for Johnny, but part of it was her saying that she could help us and save our life. Don't have all day. And I'm like, is that actually possible? And does this whole change, does, does this change the whole trajectory because I'm doing the DLC before I'm finishing the main game? Don't answer this. That's just like the biggest question that I have in my brain right now with her offering this. And it, it has to be too good to be true because then it would, wouldn't you know, it getting, going into the DLC after finishing the game, wouldn't you know, like it would change the whole, ah, the whole plot. Not doing this for the Eddies. Something's more important than Eddies, Reed. That we agree on. We all got our reasons. Oh, Tinamu, really? Mine's even got a name. The Relic. If I don't find so me, I'm literally a dead woman. Seems don't we're say all on the same page thing. now, V. Which means we can help each other, too. Okay. Shake hands, think so? Oh, yeah, but you know that's how I play is I make us like, I'm making a lot of assumptions that I'm saying like I'm talking and thinking out loud for you guys to understand like what's going on in my head. We'll be. see about that. Agreed. Think so too, Reed. If we want to find Somi, we got to dig deep. I mean, actual reconnaissance. No stone unturned. We need contacts and formers not afraid to sing. Mm -hmm. Who might see something in it for themselves. You'll need to earn their trust. Huh. I'm gonna go in with confidence. Mm, have the confidence. Rest easy. Can be real persuasive when I need to be. Zeal's good, but don't wreak havoc. Not too much, not yet. 
I need to arrange a safe passage to Washington for Myers. Expect my call soon, V. Okay, this is probably the best time to kind of split off and do some side Thanks. missions, I'd assume. For everything. Buy me my nice dinner sometime. Polo. Also, Adkoto, thank you for three months of continual support. And Polo, you just followed and also subbed. I really appreciate it. Thank you. Welcome in. Buy me a nice dinner sometime. <laughs> you do this often. Invite presidents out on dates. Often enough. Okay. Dinner it'll be. She's got to survive till then. All right, I need to make some calls. He's like, quit flirting. I'm doing this. <laughs> Exit the building. All right. Yeah, this is probably the best time, I would assume, to... I'm looking... No, no papers. Not this time. Yeah, Dogtown. Waterfront. I like listening in on their conversations. You just beat the game and the DLC the Look, way that I'm doing it? We should leave. Best if we weren't together. V, you'll go five minutes after we do. See Sugar Mommy Myers. Good luck, V. I mean, you guys know I have a thing for Myers. I mean, look at him. Yeah. All right, we've got wardrobe. So this is kind of like our dance? Sorry, what? So what? Let's just say it'd be a bumpy ride. They're just talking and I'm dancing in this moment right now. Nine, uh, Wick, guys, thanks for the follows. Polo, where did you come from YouTube or from Twitch? Um, I really appreciate that sub. There's been a lot of first time subs here. I'm glad to see you guys are enjoying your time here. It's one step up from the Shepherd Shuffle, but it's pretty bad too. Oh, it's pretty bad. Wait for Myers and Reed to leave. Okay, I'm gonna let them leave. I do need to run to the bathroom real quick. This is probably a great point to do side missions that you started. Yeah, yeah, we'll be doing side missions. So today, so as a reminder, side missions for the main story are pretty much done other than that one side mission with Johnny. We do have gigs, but I'm going to do an isolated like gig stream for the most part, probably on Monday or Thursday. I'll just go through and do a lot of the old gigs. So we'll be doing side missions that are related to the DLC. Don't worry. Um, yeah, because that's Nocturne. The only one that's really available to us, I think, is this. And then the gigs that are here for Mr. Hands. I do want to do Mr. Hands' gigs because that is related specifically to the DLC. Yeah. Let's do the main game side mission. There will be more. Uh, I think I'm going to go the route that I want to go. And hopefully you enjoy it. But yeah, I mean, I appreciate the input, guys. But I am going to, at the end of the day, go with whatever I kind of feel like is best and works with me and how I want to play the game. I'm always open to y'all's advice. Absolutely. But yeah, Mr. Hands, Mr. Hands. It's giving me Mr. Bones. Mr. Bones feels rattling. I think there's no, I think at this point, like there are better routes to take, but for it being my playthrough, it's not necessarily like a wrong way to go about it. There's also only one side mission anyway. So I don't know what you mean by that esports anyway. The only thing that I could do back with the main mission are gigs, but the gigs are relevant to the DLC. So I think they'll be fine. I think it'll be good. Let's see if we pin it, if people can know. <laughs> The Dogtown gigs are awesome. Thank you. Yes, Non. I mean, all right, is it not? Is it Nano? Nano? I'm saying this so wrong. Please tell me how to say this properly. I did the exact same thing. Yeah, all the gigs related to main game we'll do on a different day. Absolutely. We'll keep DLC kind of together as much as possible. We're the dancing queen. Um, the only side mission that we have right now, find the tarot. Oh, I do want to find all the tarot cards, but we already only have one left to find it which will probably be aligned with the main mission, so we'll see it anyway. Aaron Waynes. This must be the DLC, the no easy way out. No, this is different. No. Is this part of Beat on the Brat, but this is somebody from the DLC? Aaron Chum is a big-handed bastard who knows how to handle himself in hot water. Sure, we gotta help each other out and all that, but watch your back. You're about to walk into the lion's den. I know you're all about helping lost souls and walking elderly ladies across the street, but please, please don't get killed. Assisting some lesser dogtown boxer. No, the boxing continues. I'm gonna have to respect everything just to be able to do the boxing missions, truly. Mm -hmm. All right, we're waiting for them. That might open up into more, so let me wait for them to leave. But I'm going to run to the bathroom real quick first, and then we're going to get started on some side missions and the gigs. I've been waiting for Mr. Hands. Y'all remember during the main game, as soon as I heard Mr. Hands' voice, I was like, I want to do his gigs. Where is he? And I kept asking those questions, and I had no idea that he was related, like, specifically to the DLC. What? 
what thank you for 16 months of continual support as well thank you guys yeah um it's kind of one of those things that i i'm not dismissing what you guys are saying i really do appreciate when you guys are like hey this this would help you get some more insight into this or things like that but um i do have a problem if you guys are telling me to do something like i hear you guys and i'm gonna make my own path and navigate this game how i'm gonna play it that's like the only thing that bothers me is when you guys are like no this is the only right way like i refuse to believe that i'm sure there's many different ways to play this game and i'm gonna do one that fits with me and my play style um so i ask and remind you guys to respect that okay i'm gonna tell you what to do when i want to do it i know all right i'll be right back oh no i lost another good blender bottle I've done it. I forgot to wash the Splendor bottle, so it's been sitting for a couple days with protein in it, and I think there's no coming back. I think I've got to put another one up on the wall. Also, Braun, what's up? Welcome in. Hacks, thank you for the follow. Rocky with the 200 bits. Why is there a scam, Dram? Uh, put a fork in it. I think we're kind of done with it. I really enjoyed this stream. When I missed the stream, I'm going back to watch the VODs. I love how you're presenting your content. I also love the vibe in this chat and the stream. Akoto, thank you for such kind words. And I'm glad that you've enjoyed your time here. I really am. Last another bottle of vodka. <laughs> not, not the blender bottle. Thank you so much. And yeah, the VOD channel is always there. And you're welcome to pop in live whenever. But just thank you so much for the kind words. Oh, that was exhausting because I was running up and down the stairs. Choco, guys. DC, Choco, also Wombat. Wombat, hi. Wombat, thank you for two months of continual support as well. Loving the FF7 Rebirth playthrough. Thank you so much. The next episode goes up today. Next episode is more main mission centric kind of stuff too. And Darpass TJ. Was I gone for that long? Man, that was a long pee to be fair. Watt, thank you. Ola, thank you for the follow. Darpass TJ, Beatubs, DC, and Toaster, thank you for the follow as well. And a goat... A, Adkoto, thank you for the gifted sub as well. <laughs> thank you so much. Yanks, thank you for the gifted sub to Desifix as well. I really appreciate it. Um, oh my gosh. <clears throat> You're always so positive. I'm always positive until people tell me what to do in games. <clears throat> then you get the force choke. But otherwise, yes, thank you. I appreciate it. I'm glad that you guys just enjoy your time here and it feels like a positive place to be. Is it moving in the blender bottle? Is what moving in the bl blender bottle? What do you mean? The chair is gorgeous. I love this chair. This is the, um, <coughs> hold on, I need some water or something. This is the, oh my goodness, I'm blanking on it. The Fern by, <coughs> ah, by Hayworth. And it's amazing. Mm. The blender bottle is officially alive, yes. <coughs> Drash, thank you for the hydrate. Oh. Absolute hairball. What the heck? Okay. I heard the tab. Are you drinking? No, I'm not drinking. No, no, no. What am I drinking? It's the poppies. I hate the watermelon flavor. I normally like watermelon flavor things, but the poppies, I like getting the um uh the variety pack, but it always comes with the watermelon, so I leave the watermelons for the very last. Mm-hmm. Also, Kel, thank you for the follow. And Adkoto with another gifted sub. Adkoto, thank you for a second gifted sub. Desifix. It's actually just straight up vodka. How did you know? Mm-hmm. Just sitting here drinking vodka while we're playing the DLC. Classic. Classic move. Baranov, thank you for the follow as well. Okay. They should be leaving here soon. It says wait for them to leave, so... I guess let's wait and dance. The shepherd shuffle. While there's cockroaches moving around on the floor. I love it. Add Kodo. Thank you so much. And guys, thank you for a second hype train. Y'all are truly bananas. Asian Glow, welcome back in. Hi. They're friends, clearly. Absolutely. Can V do the Scottish dance? Shadow. Shadow, what the heck? Shadow with the $20 donation as well. Thank you so much. Does it have a message with it? Vodka with watermelon flavor? Vodka pumped into a watermelon. Definitely been days where I've tried that. 
not days, but like one time aged. Y'all, shadow for the Fortnite battle pass. All right, you're done. Nope, you're done. Shadow, you're not funny. <laughs> hey, Aged Core, thank you for five more gifted subs to the channel and community as well. Reed, everything's smooth sailing so far, but the hardest part's around the bend. I'll buzz you as soon as we're out of Dogtown. And don't forget to watch your back. Still a lot of Hanson's patrols on the street. I think it's time. Coach Fred's talking about this. Remember about the thing, Chum Aram. Okay, I'll see about it. I think I got, I think I told you guys my plan. The rum, wait, what is that? Rum ham, what? Um, I think I told you guys about my plan, but I'm trying to do all the gigs, all the side mission, all the main mission, then minus leaving all the boxing stuff. Then I'm going to respect my stats to the all body focused so I can do the best that I can possibly do in the ring because right now I have body level four. What is a rum ham? What is a rum ham? Why do I not know this? <laughs> my plans change as much as the weather. I know this is why I try not to tell you guys like anything ahead of time. Pareem. Scavengers in the okay, so this is a gig objective. So we'll look at the gigs first. Regina, priceless. Regina with another gig. Oh, it's from Always Sunny. Oh. You guys know I haven't seen like all of them. Let's go straight. Wait two days for Reed's phone call. Look for extra gigs in Dogtown. I would say let's do the optional quest. That's what the game's presenting. Rumham goes great with pocket sketty. All right, we're going to add this to another list of TV shows that I need to watch after community. Frank soaks a ham in rum. Oh, I don't know. A whole soaked ram or a whole soaked ham. Severin and as guys, thanks for the follows. Agecore, how are you doing, by the way? Ew, David, it is time for me to rewatch that. Ew. OK, it's officially nighttime. She's five two. watch out if she gets you in a chokehold. All five two. I want to see what the mysterious signals are, guys. Sent to nearby Mercs originates here. I feel like that's gonna turn out bad, but let's go check it out. I can't order a car. Oh, there we go. A soaked ram. A soaked ram. It's just pouring outside. <laughs> I'm a B, I'm a B. Okay, let's turn this down a little bit. No. Oh, okay, we missed it, we missed it, we missed it. You don't know me. Kill the messenger. We gotta find Growl is actually really good, but it's on a no track right now. Judy, by the way, hello. Okay, chip it in, skin, chip it in, skin. Hey, get out of here with the killer eels. Oh, it's actually behind me, hold on. We didn't even need a car. Back it up, back it up. You and you feel it. Sorry. Just trying to give that kid a little, a little heart attack. Let's see what this is. I think the weapons are fine right now, but we might pick up other weapons that I might want to use more. Community needs to be on the top of the watch list though. Zook, probably. I think I'll finish shoots okay, and then there's another TV series that just got added to Netflix that I hadn't seen previously that I feel like I kind of wanted to watch first though. I can't remember what it is. Okay, let me not go uh -huh. straight into shooting people. Hello. Did you need this okay, car back? In tracking me in Dogtown? No, no, not you, the car. Listen, oh. I'll explain, but first, you gotta bring her to me. Okay. Open you the courts. Okay. So that's what it means. Okay, that means we take the car, we steal it, and we go somewhere else. All right. Blue Ranger, have a good night. Thank you so much for hanging around. Yeah, I don't know. Today's a little bit shorter of a stream, but possibly. Uh, Space Scavenger's Reign on HBO is phenomenal. I do have HBO. Okay, guys. Let's return this to El Capitan. I guess I figured out what we were doing here. Whee! Oh no. His car is not gonna be deli- Oh no. You know, I've never tried to get out of the city. Oh, oh? What? Smooth sailing? 
This is intense. Secession is good on it too. Hope he has a good repair, man. Skedaddle, chew. All right, well, that should be easy. Mr. It was because didn't Mr. Hands give us the ability to go in and out of the city now? Or something? Didn't he give us something that allows us to be able to go and move freely throughout? Laughing windows think- Wait! Wait, you primed us up and you weren't even followed? Wait, what the heck? I've pissed everybody off! Alright, hold on. We're not holstering. Oh, gosh. Hold on. How many hits to the head does it take? <laughs> no, I just, I just was like, wait. Did, uh, I didn't see it before because I know it's your first time. Wait, I missed my exit. I saw that coming a mile away. Motherfuckers won't let you go easy. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay, this will work. This will work. Did you come from YouTube? You know, the turning on this car is not bad. Yeah. Oh, no, we got more. Smooth, sunny, can't complain. Yeah. <laughs> I gotta read up my, my nose. You ran into a few uh, speed bumps. Nah, no Honestly, biggie. that wasn't that bad. There's a few speed bumps in a ride like this. V, you beautiful psycho. I can't help but like you. Pedal to the metal. Don't Pedal to the metal. Watch the paint job. Ah, uh, there's not gonna be a paint job when I'm done with this car. Yo, okay. Hold on. Oh no, 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 no. Can you feel it? Wait, hold on. It's the lost in the da da da. Oh my goodness. Oh, well, thank you so much for popping over laughing. Like, I'm, I'm glad you're enjoying YouTube. I hope you enjoy the live side of things. I always say it's twice as much fun. <laughs> twice as much chaos, but twice as much fun. Got out. Some people. You know, I don't even think there was any damage. It will buff out. Absolutely, it will buff out. Uh, I don't have too many. Any of the cars that I've gotten or bikes I've gotten have been for free. My favorite bike is from Scorpion, though. Pedals to the metal, Commander. Oh! That will definitely buff out. The car is too functional. It needs to be about half the size, boxy, and red. I think getting back into Dogtown will take Millie. I miss her. Oh, we're getting rain too. Beautiful day in Night City. Fuck. What shit for brains gone all this Good morning. Day and I, day and I. We're on our way already? Uh, I guess I need to go out this way. Okay, here we go. Mevers. Yeah. Dominic, YouTube's far more better than Twitch, in my opinion. To each their own, absolutely. It's why I kind of do both, is it's two different types of content. So I see it from both sides. I enjoy doing both, but I've done this for far longer. So this has kind of always been my number one. Like, this has been the, like, main thing that I've done for so long. just teasing, man. Anyway, come on. If I wanted my dick wet, I wouldn't stand out in the rain. Oh. Um. Someone deliver this car to you, too? You greet everyone with a barb? The paint job was not great, no. Mm -hmm. Main thing until Rebirth came along. <laughs> How? In what way? Have you guys lost dreams because of Rebirth? Are you guys in any way getting impacted by Rebirth? No. No, I don't like saying like main thing because I do them equally now. Like, absolutely. I just spend more time streaming than I do recording each week, you know? You greet everyone with that barb. You I do like this car though. Barbs at peeps trying to do you a favor. <laughs> I like to check my peeps. It's the bowl check cut and the mullet status. at the same time. Give it to me straight, Cap. The wheels. What's your scheme? Got a need for speed, huh? Yeah, me too. But first, I'm not gonna haze you. The car you brought is looking a little worse for wear. Every scratch is a loss. You feel me? That wasn't me. Two. I'm selling them. Three. <laughs> Town's full of chances, and chances are what I like. Four, you called it a scheme? Oh, no. And I prefer to call it a, a creative license. Okay, creative license it is. 
You know, issues with the electronics and the Mizutani Shian and MZ2 did, are mean? usually the onboard comp's fault. Could help you out. Take a look. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Valerian, I guess. Please. But Valerian, is that it? certain things I don't do halfway. I'm talking my clothes, my cut, my cars. I'll That's handle true. her myself. That's fair. Yeah. According to Twitch Tracker, this stream Cyberpunk takes the number four on longest games played on stream. It is actually a pretty good look Come for on, him, I'll though. Do why did I get tailed? That's actually a good question, too. Salisbury Steak, thanks for the follow. Bloody and Dylan, guys, thank you for the follows. Welcome in. I wanted to ask about those speed bumps I ran into. Ah, uh, Sixth Street? Just a little biz disagreement. Better get used to bumps like that if you want to work with me. I never really said I wanted to work with you. I feel like I've just been coming along for the ride, literally. Right. What's this? creative endeavor need from me gonna need you ready to grab some easy ads listen i got like a gift a sixth sense i can tell when a ride's bored needs a change of hands sometimes i hear him calling over in dogtown sometimes in night oh, his city. Amazing. right and this sixth sense tells you Look that i brought raise the chop, <laughs> chop shop well, please but yeah, you rein in the wheels, you rake in the heads. Of course, it's all part of a larger plan. Larger? Oh. Well, well. Picked up a tail, huh? Mm, nope. No, that so. wasn't me. Relax, we're in my hood. Let's see what they want. Is this how you start having more gigs with all the other fixers in Night City? Because I remember us talking about that. NCPD asshole. You got a license and a ridge for them ugly mugs? Oh, oh fucking believe this. I'm Daniels, not gonna, I'm not gonna. the fuck, man? You take a fucking squad car to pick up a clipped ride in uniform? Not the only one on oh. his home turf, Mama. Hey, Nabaville Fort Alvarado for the top breast, too. I'll get the gear for our little plan. Such a cop. phone. El Cap wow. handing out bribes? I'm shocked. Shocked. There are an honest cop left in this city? There is, but they lay low. Don't Order. got that fire in the eyes, River. Know. River Crane, do have that fire. For the cred. Cars, deets, and docks are on their way. You, you came see? from Walking Dead. It's just biz. Come on, rain stopped. All right. I know, me shocked by Dirty Cop. It's because I was thinking there were more rivers out there, okay? But to be fair, he... He's a different kind of dirty cop. You know, Salisbury Steak, man. I'm glad to see her enjoying the YouTube channel. Thank you for popping out the live side of things as well. It's nice to see you in here. There's been a couple of people that have popped in from Walking Dead more recently. Mojo, catch you later. Okay, you just met one of our clients. So, in on the gig? What's this plan you and Daniels mentioned? Hmm, you drive Another gig. for me, and you find out in due time. So, you taking the gig or not? Hmm. Okay. I'm always driving somewhere. Might always as up well for a good pick time. Up some scratch on the way. You gonna make it worth my while? Come on, man. With El Capitan, your future's looking bright. I fix you your gigs, your fancy payouts, nothing but upsides. Counting on it. Sure, sure. Let's yeah. see what tomorrow brings. El Capitan will be in contacto. We also did. He was kind of part of how we got David's jacket, wasn't he? It was like right by him. I look innocent, but those HR reports say otherwise. <laughs> you know what they say. Don't go chasing waterfalls. Stick to rivers instead. <laughs> River is the Caden of cyberpunk. I refuse to believe this. I think River has a lot to offer. Okay. Mamar will now send you coordinates for nearby vehicle contracts. These are marked with this icon. Once you have the target vehicle, the fixer will tell you where to deliver it. In order to complete the delivery, you'll need to lose all pursuers first. Don't hesitate to accept the contract. The vehicle will disappear if you wait too long. But if that happens, he'll send you another contact or contract for something else. Mm. Good job. Hi. <laughs> Cyberpunk's going well. We're starting officially DLC kind of sad missions and things. And Junior Boy, thank you for the follow as well. Yes, that's right. You came from Walking Dead as well. Push it to the limit. Pushy. Pushy to the limit. All right, let's look for extra gigs. So we need to go back into here. 
These contracts are going to be fun. It's going to be a bumpy ride. There is no easy way out, which is the boxing one. So we're going to hold off on that. We're going to go to this random side fizz. And then we'll also probably pop in and grab some of the gigs as well before he calls us. As soon as he organically calls us, we'll go back on that mission. But y'all know me. I'm all about the side missions. I'm about the side gigs. It's just what you get when you tune in. I don't know why y'all still expect, expect something different. Should I continue to be the chocobo or do you think we need to mix it up? Do I need to go back to something different? Get the Roman haircut for 400 days? <laughs> I wouldn't mind a nice like Walking Dead outfit. A walking Dead had a lot of flannels. I'm kind of here for it. We keep it the honorary chocobo. Chocobo for life. Anything but the shorts. What's wrong with my shorts? Oh, I got a skirt. I got a skirt. What is wrong with my b-ball shorts? Hey, Nan. Thank you for the gifted sub to good job. And also to Oob as well. Oob, hi. I expect nothing less. <laughs> Mister, thanks for the follow. Hi. The big bird outfit is gold. Jig. You guys are just happy truly to see anything else but what I had before. I get it. I get it. Let me see over here. From what I'm reading, Baldur's Gate Act 1 is on average 40 to 50 hours and is the longest act. So I think, again, we could do... I love how you're still... Novus is still trying to push. Novus is still trying to promote Baldur's Gate 3. I can say that, like, whatever happens, I know that we'll play at least two to three shorter games. Like, I would like to do Knights of the Old Republic. I still want to do Andromeda. <sighs> I want to, I really, really want to play the Lord of the Rings games, but maybe that could be a YouTube series. I don't know. Let me tell you what outfit you must use for your character. By all means, crate. You want to get that time out real quick. I was on mobile and couldn't research at the time. <laughs> You're like, but let me circle back just in case you had forgotten. Guys, we're bringing my my back. While I do like the Big Mac, what is his name? What was it? Mac Daddy, Big Mac? I do prefer Milster. Let's do this. If this is, don't do it. Nice, okay, this is a great song to play. But let me just see what else they have real quick. I'm on the search for my favorite growl song. Return of the Mac. The Mick Dumpy. Oh, okay. The McDumpy. I accidentally put this song on my Cats and Cowboys playlist, so I need to remove it. I forgot. Hey, oh, sorry. No, it wasn't Pump Pump. Move! <laughs> so, it's like a combination between Nine Inch Nails mixed with Bad Girlfriend by like Theory of a Dead Man and uh, the other song by Buck Cherry I was telling you guys about. Straight into the violence with Millie. <laughs> What do you expect with her? Ah! Hold on. Oh, oh. See, I need to get this car too. That car is like a different evolution of Millie as well. That one, the big one that I have, and then this one are like all of Millie's evolutions. Skirt. I think it is up here. Skirt. Okay. This car has gone through hell. I don't even know how many times she's had to be replaced. It's not even the same Millie that it once was. Awesome. Anon, thank you for the gifted sub. Also to Darth Vicious. Darth, I hope you enjoy the sub and the emotes. The skin. The skin. No, that doesn't sound pleasant. No. Millie. Wait, we're getting air. I do love all the cars on fire the closer you get to Dogtown. Hold on. I think it's right after. Millie the Pokemon. She is. She is. All right, we should be able to get in. Millie's going to get scanned and rejected, though. Of the button up and down shirts. <laughs> you only used two times and it barely counts. I need to have more button up shirts. Yeah. Catastrophe. Okay, sorry. Sorry. It's all the fires burning on the entrances. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
I just finished a couple of races using the Hellhound. Nothing better than blasting the opponents with rockets. I still haven't gotten one of the weaponized cars. I know. Yeah. FF7 Rebirth episode this weekend or next week? As per usual, Tuesday, Wednesday. Tuesday. Whoa. Never mind. Not usual. Tuesday, Thursday, Saturday. So the next episode is today. Fridays are always, like, minus the drop of Final Fantasy, Fridays are normally just short games for people that maybe aren't a big fan of Final Fantasy but still want to watch some stuff from the community. I've been trying to record extra videos to upload on Fridays, yeah. But the next one will go up today. The Red Little Avenger. The Little Avenger that could. Oh, look at the... She's got wicked rims, though. She gorgeous. Look at her. She beautiful. Let me uh, store some stuff real quick, too. I need to store some of the clothes. I think that's been taking up a lot. Yeah, I'm 170 over 250. Let me go here. She can handle it. I guess I might as well store everything that I'm not using. There's so many dresses that I bought that we're never going to use. Uploads usually. Yeah, yeah, I've tried to stick to that for the most part. Yeah, I think the biggest break in it is typically the Sunday. Sunday, Monday are like the only times I normally go like two days without uploading. Pompon officially abolished. Yes. Yes. Pompon. Oh my gosh, I bought so many clothes. I didn't realize I went on a shopping spree. Uh, this is not this is not normal for me. OK, I normally don't shop this much. I know. No, I haven't sold them. I haven't sold them. I'm just storing them. We're just storing them again. Shadow, thank you for the 1500 bits as well. Uh, I didn't realize how small the car was until now. This is my favorite car. It's my favorite. I know. Justice for Pon Pon. The mods are trying to bring it back, though. To be fair, Shadow, thank you so much. Uh, Slice and Fear the Chop. Guys, thanks for the follows. Welcome in. Mmm. -hmm. Oh, like, okay, yo-yo. Well, I remember the yo-yo, yeah. A few scratches. She's so shiny. Okay, we need to get in there. I reckon I can just walk in. You, like, think I'm scared of him? You scared All right, this is hey! a side mission. Does it pop up with what it is right now? Beat on the brat, killing in the name, blistering love. Oh, we do need to do blistering love. Um, I think I did see somebody had recommend doing it during the DLC as well, before Endgame. You! Come here a minute! Me? Okay, I don't know why, but... The smile is kind of freaking me out, but I think it's because we're up. Balls to the walls, baby. Two bar guest pup pupsers in way over their head. And of course, who else but V to rescue? I always had a soft spot for tragedies, and this one's already got me hooked. You're taking this gig. End of discussion. Think you can pull them out of the shit show? Got my fingers crossed. Barguest. Dogtown and automatically think Barguest. Chances are you won't die straight away. The organization founded by Kurt Hansen is more than just an ordinary Night City gang. No one else has managed to feed... Hold up defeat of carving an entire district out for themselves, kicking out the police completely and keeping it that way for almost a decade. It started small. Colonel Hansen's unit seized part of Pacifica at the end of the Unification War and never laid down arms. Only six soldiers remained from that squad, and as Hansen's most trusted men, they now sit at the top of the food chain. Uh, the nascent bar guest quickly took similar folks under its wings. Veterans who had been forgotten by megacorps, mercs without contracts, renegade gangers from various parts of the city, you name it. Hansen's organization also proved tempting to average Night City residents who, for various reasons, found themselves at the end of their ropes. Hansen gave them a gun, a salary, medical care via his ripper contacts, and perhaps most importantly, asked no questions in exchange for their absolute loyalty. Perfect. For those at the very bottom, Barguest, am I saying that right? Barguest? Barguest is pretty good alternative to a life of petty crime, a career without a short life expectancy. Anywhere else, under different leadership, the band of delinquents that make up the Barguest would have already collapsed like a house of cards. Um, handsome manage impossible, credit, goes into dominating presence, charisma, and intelligence. Absolutely. He kind of like, you can get that with how he speaks as well. For many, this vision was, is, and will continue to be extremely tempting. That is true, though. I mean, you're going to 
get off a lot better than I think a lot of people who are struggling in Night City. So I see the no 401k though. Oh, that's true. Do you think they max? Yeah. Uh, Siler and also Lior and Fontaine guys. Thank you for the follows and welcome him. Do you think it's a 5% match for it though? Could be good. Dogtown. T-Sub, hi. Welcome back in. What is it like? See what I mean? It's because... Chinga su madre. I said come here. Okay. Talking to me? Okay. Looking at you, ain't I? Here's the come looking on, at you. Come on, got like a situation. Look, vodka. Have a shot. Hanson gonna hang me by my cojones anyway. Oh. So what the hell? I love how Cohenis was Paco. highlighted. This here's Babs. V. Babs. Okay. Is that milk v? of magnesia Let's behind them? Like the what's the Like toast the mofo and hope he goes away. Shots? What time is it? No poison, thanks. Here's to our problem <laughs> problems resolution. <laughs> Alright, what's the sage? Good morning, Miles High. <laughs> Where's the Stanley Thermos? Also, square shot glasses? That What's feels weird. Sitch? Why is it a bitch? Making it sound like it's some life or death conundrum. No more. No more. Bab says I fucked big time. But as I see it, like, no shit too deep, you know? What you think? <sighs> um, ain't always sink or swim, right? Okay. Managed to sidestep some shit shows. Looking at someone who got out of neck deep shit, too. <laughs> <laughs> Told you, Babs! Fucking Nova. I like Babs rolling the their eyes heart. back there. Who fucking cares? She did it, didn't she? It's a start. So, okay, can I start now? Uh, all right, 6 p.m. Don't really got time for an epic tale. I'm all ears. Oh, Fine, one more shot. Leave your tail. Just Paco begging you. On the down low. Mm hmm Wall's got ears. This is a good me? mission. Ooh, Axe wait. High. Let's do it right. Go for real feels, eh? Take a whiff. It's deep dive. Oh. And take you there live. No, Make no. Make you feel part of it. No, I'm okay. Day was tight as shit. My ticket to the majors, get me? Wanna feel it? Take a big whiff and listen. I think okay. One more. I'll take a one more shot. Look at his eyes. He's got the red eyes. Shot, shot, shots. Read, Ready read. Thank beat? you so much for 18 months and welcome back in. I skipped the quest not to deal with him anymore. He was grading you. Gotta the collision. Like myself. Same start. Fast forward a few hours and my best friend was dead. Oh, bites, man. I make it out of life of mine. Promise you. I mean, I'm gonna hard pass on it. I mean, I gotta draw a line somewhere. Drugs. Drugs. Dodgy stem. Not in the mood. Story no good on its own? Yeah, Come that's on. true. True. She ain't gonna kill ya. It's Paco's rambling that might get you without it. You're not doing it back there? Telling me to do it. Oh, you. Oh, you have to take the deep dive. There's not an option not to. Yeah, Johnny. All right. Johnny's skulking in the back, here. Achilles. The rugs. Oh, V. Okay, first of all, we all saw how okay, you extracted okay. information for me. Settle down Don't judge listen. me. You can't avoid so, the peer pressure. After this, my first day in Hansen's army, waiting for the boss man, yeah? Legs shaking like jelly. Fuck, no! Imagine you Hansen his cell, and you was pissed. You were super pissed, Kurt Hansen himself. I've done sketchy BDs, woken up naked as well, so this is nothing. Just another day in Night City, baby. Black Sapphire you a week ago. Talk, so said the radio. Do you? I'm the man, the myth, and song. See what we're working with here. Pato and Just the R, guys. Thanks for the follows. Welcome in. Can you manage the meeting with the Dogtown's yeah, gas? Shoot first, ask later, you know? What's the problem, Kurt? I think I should play into how I think he would be. Scav deal. Swear to me it'll go swimmingly. No fucking mishaps. Look me in the eye. He has a good voice, though. Kurt, 
How long have we known each other? They'll want to fuck us. We need to be prepared. Clear? Of course it's clear. Come now, this is rookie shit. Absolute creatine junkie over here. Johnny not allowed to say one word after the stunts he's pulled. Exactly. Him judging me? Now that's rich. The how the turntables. Vaughn, thank What's you for the, the follow. Problem, Kurt? Thank, you. thank you for the hydrate. I'm sick of the incompetence. Mm -hmm. Small fry business only till you prove yourself again. Zip it. Then, dead silence. Cause you know, Yuri and Kurt been in the army together. Militech dropped him here years ago, yeah? Walk away. It's that haircut for me, Oh. He's a oh, yeah, the door is ready to get fucked good. Oh, and snap. I'm standing there, waiting, lost. I actually shit myself a little. Oh, you know what? Good on him for admitting that. That takes a lot of guts. He's randomly taking things Brad's I find on the street. Egging me on like, and I'm thinking, if he don't kill Yuri, he's gonna kill me for sure. Do it, Kurt. Little bitch is begging for it. Fuck him up. <laughs> All right. I thought I could talk to this person, but I guess not. Oh, snap. Hit me with your best shot. Put him up, Grunt. Bring it, Grunt. What? Best shot. Come on. Hit me. Oh, oh. What's your name, kid? B oh, Baco Torres. Oh. 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 Fuck his oh. face down. Oh. Oh, this Wrong. is like no Your chance. Mutt, oh. We'll make a hound out of you yet. Yes, sir. Fuck me, Paco. Quit making shit up. Psh, my oh. story. Wait, so I'm guessing they didn't actually fight? He didn't fight the man himself? There's no way. How, how come I can't do these perfect blocks when what I'm actually in the ring? Me? I'm quick and and clever. Let me see it. Oh, I did not block it. Did not block, did not block. They've been smelling too much spray paint. Oh. 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 He's got a chromed out silver hand, too. I can tell. I drag him around the block again. And we will. We will. Hmm. Beat on the brat practice. Welcome to the pack, kiddo. <laughs> right. Like hell he said that. You'll handle the next convoy. Let's see what you're made of. And I felt like born again, Chum. Blood yeah. running down my face. Here's a 20 I'm body. So happy, I'm howling. <laughs> and you keeping up? Attention all residents. All right. This is Kurt Hansen. That was the best day of your life. Strong stuff. Makes me want to lay one on you myself. <laughs> Give it a week, Chumba. Need to heal. Get in the oh. smacking line, V. Ain't the end. Got his mission still coming. So listen, was one of those gigs, you know? Like garden airdrops or transporting? I was protecting our convoy. Mm-hmm. Tell me about it. Transport, what was it? Something for scavs. But we transport medicine, water, sometimes generators, things for civvies, caring for our peeps, right? But you know, Babs. sometimes it's one for the peeps, one for me, then two for me. Shit went south when I took too much, Chum. Mm. Babs loves complaining, but the opportunity looked real, real good. To the end. We're hopping and popping. Hmm. Give me another whiff. We're going to go further. That's the spirit. He's like, I thought we were going to wake up in a bathroom. I thought we were going to wake up naked. <laughs> Again, not the worst situation that we've been so in, we though. So we drive in, right? Boss man himself next to me. Oh, stop. Suddenly, tires screeching. And I'm thinking, mierda. Esto se sale de madre. Motherfuckers. That's when you know. As if. I mean, I guess it's possible. Get me, mama? He saw it all coming. That's why he went with me. I just am not. I don't. I don't believe it. Is 
he just looking for anybody who will believe his story? All right, that car's done. Mm. I feel like I'm kind of getting better at the... Oh, we got biker bros. Biker bros. Good damage, good damage. Hit the biker bros. One down. Two down. Rats have blocked the road. Oh, is there normally a music? Buckle I was up. wondering why it just feels very lackluster. Who's in charge? Oh, oh, oh. Oh! Boss man got hit. Oh. Thinking to myself, this is how we fucking Ooh. die. Yeah, no kidding. No kidding. What? They're so ridiculous. They did so much damage. There's normally a banger right now. Oh, I'm sorry, guys. There's not a lot. I feel like the DLC is going to be hit the hardest with the streamer mode. Also, Fuki, thank you so much for 13 months and welcome back in. Ah, uh, baby? Am I stuck in it? No. No. Yeah. Hanson would be driving to Millie for sure. Absolutely. Lovely. <sighs> Gorgeous. Love to see it. Better than Pon Pon. Throw a Pon Pon over in the background. That was, I felt like I wasn't doing it. I should have known that was the same save. This is going to be miserable. It's at 111. That could possibly be it. Let's do the 110 to be safe, though. It's a crazy bug. There's one one minute before, and this one's two minutes before, so I'm gonna do the two minute before. Yeah. I think this one might be before we're in the car, though. We'll see. I got this bug sometimes. No! Uh, have you ever had to deal with a hair- cat hair on your keyboard? And? Yeah. You keep yeah. It, huh? Absolutely. <laughs> Strong That's okay, stuff. I'll do it again. Makes me want to lay one on you myself. Give it a week, Chumba. Mmm, fast forward. Sensing oh, combat, right. totally about it. He did way well, you, too much damage with the gun, and then why did we lose the gun and go melee? All right. Fingers crossed. We can't die. The drugs finally got to UV, just back to back. So we drive in, right? Boss man himself next to me. Uh-huh. 500 health. Tire screeching, and I'm thinking, Mierda, esto se sale de madre. Motherfuckers. There we go. All right, I might drop a save if we can do a hard save right before. Get That'd be great. Mother. He saw it all coming. That's why he went with me. It's probably not gonna let me. No, yeah. Okay, that guy is exploding. Oh, nice. That actually worked really well. Got to do a lot of mechanic work today. No worries, Martinez. I hope I get to see you tomorrow. We're going to be doing a little bit longer of a stream tomorrow, so hopefully you swing by for that. But I hope you have a great rest of your Saturday. It was nice to have you here today. All right, hit this. Young, hi, welcome back in. Okay. Ah, I'm getting headshots, but he just doesn't want to go down. Oh! Nice. Beautiful. One more on the head should work. Rats have blocked Perfect. The road. Okay, let me see if I can. No. Buckle up, pup. I need to find some Time more. To remind oh, these bastards who's let in me charge. run. I don't have my normal kit, so it feels weird. Fuck, he was a machine. Uh, like I don't feel like a machine. Precise. All right, I'm gonna go gun versus the melee just because I'm not used to that. Guess where I'm aiming. <laughs> oh gosh. Oh fuck. Okay, get the get the person with the mantis blades. This weapon is awesome, actually. I don't Fucking awesome, Ooh. cream aim. Ooh, and hold she on. was out for blood. I don't have my normal boost. Oh no! Boss man got hit. Thinking to myself, this how we fucking die. I like the. You can hear the echo. Not supreme aim. It's about to get ugly. 
Grenade! Do I have grenades? I don't have grenades! I don't have grenades! I... Mm, it's not bad. Spyro, I'm so, like, I'm doing really well. I was really excited to get back to this. I think it was nice to take, um, our first introduction to the DLC was long. So I think it was really nice to come back after having a couple streams off of this game. It kind of gave me that break. I think that's needed. I, I remember telling you guys this at the beginning. I wasn't sure if I was going to go straight into the DLC because sometimes, uh, sometimes at the point when a DLC comes out, more? Oh, come on. Oh, watch out, kid. Sometimes by the time I get to DLC after playing like primarily the main story, and you know, I get a little blam, fatigued. Blam, blam. Ra -ta 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 Blasting away, yeah? Grenade! But I'm glad I'm going back to back with this because I do think that the DLC would feel a little... For me, it would have felt weird to come back to it months later, even though that's what a lot of you guys had to do. I like that I'm able to like show what it happens if you do DLC before you finish the end game. If there is any differences. It seems like a lot of people dislike Paco. There's so many of them. Mm. A lot of back to back. Whoa. Oh, yeah. Almost three years. That's what I'm saying. No, sorry. I did misspoke by saying uh, like months. But yeah. I do think that for the next longer games, I will probably wait before I go into do doing DLC back to back. I think for this it works because I didn't put that many hours in main game. Lucky Aura, welcome back in. Hi. There should be somebody over there. Oi! Get her, get her, get her, get her, get her. No, 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 not like this! I need him to move! Move! Yeah, he's like an annoying little brother. There was a game I was just playing. Oh, I was talking about that with Kyrie. I was like, Kyrie is such the like annoying little sister. I don't want that cyber remote function. Let me kill him. Oh, there's no way I'm gonna get that. We should be done soon. Masha and Jody, guys, thank you for the follows. Welcome in. Fuki, I feel like I haven't seen you in so long. Oh shit! Look out! I think I know what game we're all waiting for. Oh, do tell. What game are we all waiting for? Prime, welcome back in. Happy Saturday. Hello. We should be almost done. Okay, I really like this. This is a juicy weapon. Spider-Man 2? What, for YouTube? One last one. Slaughtered okay. all of them we did. Metallic smell of blood in the air. Massacre. Yeah. We have oh. a groaner, okay. still breathing. Sure to tell us something interesting. Oh, dirty fucking rats. At least oh. the kids showed some teeth. Yeah, that went over better than when I was doing melee. I could definitely do a melee run. I just, I need to prepare for it. Gotta prep it. Yeah, Dingle, have a good one. Thank you so much for stopping by for a little bit. I highly recommend it, especially if you can get it on sale. It's a fantastic game. Big man, welcome back in as well. And June, hi. Have you ever heard of a version of two? Wait, wait, wait. What is this? A version of what? I song? did good. Deserved a compliment. I know you guys have mentioned Disco Elysium multiple times. Yeah. Metal Gear, all the games you guys are waiting for. I don't think you actually want Metal Gear. Like you are. Thank you for the 200 bits as well. Oh, the West Virginia song. No, I haven't heard this version. I haven't. No, that's just like, I think the Trop House version. Not bad for your but first I time. But I did huh? good. Deserved well, a compliment. Not half bad. Deserved you a compliment. Something. Weren't lying about being quick, kiddo. Good work stomping these rats. You will not get away with this. All right. The goods go back to the sapphire. Just be careful, kid. The leaves blowing. Yuri and I gotta ask our scav friends some questions. <sighs> Interrogation time? Attention all residents. This is Kirk Hansen. Keep listening, V. What this Skonkast did next? 
is a story I've been waiting for. A story. Okay, so listen. Before we left, Yuri gave me a list. No power generators there. I look into the truck, and what's there? Generators. Yeah, Yuri probably grabbed some on the side. Went in to hawk him off for a quick eddy after the scav shit show. And this dumbass thought if he snatched and sold him, he'd be set for a year. That just takes a shot. He straight up robs him. Oh. Only idiots say no to opportunity, Babs. Oh my gosh. Genius idea. Yeah. Um, Disco Elysium's always been like kind of closer to the front, Earth to but it be. keeps getting pushed back for other things. I know, but it's something I am very interested in. Sheesh. In what world did that seem like a good idea? There's more V. See, my little gauntlet here sold them to a dude in India. Probably on the way there. Oh, they're gonna kill him, right? Fuck. And me in the bargain? Come on, I see you thinking good. Can you help, sister? <sighs> I don't do charity. I mean, I do kind of want to leave with this because I agree, I'm not loving it. It's an interesting mission, to say the least. Deep dive hit to Good RV. job, have a good one. Thank you so much for hanging around. Yeah, have a great day at work. And bam, thank you for the follow, welcome in. I know you're cooking with this game right now. Do you know how much better, wait, wait, do you know much about solar panels? No, I, I don't really. I mean, I do sure. and I don't. can help you. Advice no. don't come free, though. Yeah, yeah. We got scratched, Chum. Okay. I know. Do for a price. Yeah, yeah. Gotta frame Yuri. At this stage, run for the hills, guys. See if I can call in some favors. Could work something out. I don't want to frame Yuri. Yeah, Spider-Man 2. There's Deep other games that I'm RV? trying to get back to before I finish that. Tax everyone. Go full fable on them. I'm gonna see if I can do this. Strings, call in favors. See if I can't make some generators appear. Mm-hmm. Attention all residents. This is Kurt Hansen. I don't think he liked that and answer. Or he would have transport so we can disappear. Out there, past the horizon. Cogs are grinding. Give me a little time. Keep your eyes peeled. What? I didn't realize my dress was see-through at the bottom. Let me know if you need a tag, Scott. Message River to ask for help. Pan Am or Rogue? Cause you like think I'm scared of him? I think we could call in a favor or two with somebody. I think we could Not do that. Mana. Making it so I can't think straight. Although, do you think River will judge me? I feel like River's gonna judge me for this. Huh. I feel like he's gonna be like, I don't wanna work, do any dirty work, you know? But we haven't talked to him in a while. We have not. Hopefully for Final Fantasy X. It's gonna be a little bit. It depends on how long Final Fantasy VII is, but yeah, I really hope to get to 10 by this year. River's the goodest boy. I need your help. He's gonna be so sad that we didn't reach out to him for something else though. Got a moment for someone in need? Got a sec, could use your help. Remember when I slept with you, dot, dot, <laughs> Got a moment. <laughs> Of course, what's the issue? A couple of acquaintances of mine found themselves in trouble, talking real bad. I met this pair, both are bar guests, you know, Dogtown goons. They're in a tough spot. I think let's be honest with the whole situation, you know? Eric, happy good morning. You got one night with River already. You can't forget about him. I never have. Aiko, hi. That's why I need four power generators. Whoa, you need what? Generators? Hold on, need to think a second. Ugh. Okay, wait, Rob, you're just saying all the right things. Hold on. F of 10 somewhat reminds me of Graceling. Okay, that's a different strategy than reminds you of Fable, and I like this. This strategy works very well. Hold on. Handsome Caboose, welcome back in. Uh, we're doing side missions in the DLC. Whoa, 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 you need... Okay, okay, there's an evidence locker with some generators on file, but you do remember I got kicked off the force, right? Surely you're not asking me to steal NCPD property or grease anyone's palms. I knew he wasn't the right person to ask. He's gonna judge me. I'll be straight with you. This is a life or death situation. Fully serious. I like River, guys. I really do. Ah, uh, screw it. Okay. I've kept in contact with a couple of friendly faces. Who still owe me a favor? I'll figure something out. I'll get you those generators. I'll even toss in the fixer's delivery fee. They'll drop them off in the dumpsters by Coronado Bay Movie Theater. Thanks, River. Seriously, you're a big softie at heart. <laughs> we should go give him a, pay him a visit. 
I know, I know, smiley face. He did make really good food. He's a great cook. We love that. Um, I guess I shouldn't reach so out to the others. It's optional to reach out to the others, but I need a transport. Oh, interesting. Okay, so if you wanted to do the, if you wanted to transport them out, I would assume that you would reach out to Pan Am, but we're doing the generator route. Mmm. Yeah. Figure something out. It's clutch, bat. It is. <laughs> we love a man who can cook, even if it was vegetarian. Cogs are grinding. Give me a little time. Friend from NCPD. Will help Got an out. NCPD contact. You're in luck. Yoink. Said he could arrange generators. Dumpster near Coronado Bay movie theater. You're welcome. All clear. Oh fuck! Really, V? Just like that? Nothing happens just mm -hmm. like that. Chum. Web of favors. Let me know how it went. They Any both kind of had different. Said any contact dates. Babs. You know, just in case. Babs said like, "Can you transport us out as like an alternative?" But I think they. I think it's not that they wanted to get out of our guest, but I think because of what they did, they were like, "We need to get that heck out of here." So it was just two different options. We should invite River to our home. I agree. Wait to hear from Paco and Babs. Babs. I All right. I will cut off fingers. The fingies. No! Crazy people. Oh, Reed's calling. It's time for main mission again. Hey, I'm back in town. I'm back in town. What's your status? How'd the delivery go? Our special delivery, all good. No uh, delays? Shipped. First leg by sea, then by air. Civilian craft both. Nice. But it got to its destination fast and then damaged. Any developments here? A cyber psycho barged My status? No real changes, I suppose. And it's time we got down to work. I know, my I'm hip. Out, Mr. A big There's a lot of millies here, guys. Alex, former team member. That's three She's millies. Dogtown, under deep cover. She'll help out. No, but just tell me where. Roger that. Got an address? Longshore Stacks, the dive bar called the Moth. After the some moth. Time, yeah. Got it. And sense is trained on any potential shadows. Okay. Very nice. Yeah, this is like home of the Millies. Look, another one. I mean, they're not the red Millies, but they're so cool. Jay-Z, thank you for the follow. Welcome in. He's a big softy. We saw that in the game with his, yeah, with the kids. I do want to go back and visit him. I do want to pursue. I thought about it for a while. I was thinking I wasn't going to romance anyone, but I actually do want to romance River. Um, Dogtown Saints. So this is where we're headed anyway. Find, oh no, that's for fine Aaron. Okay, we're headed this way. But I kind of do want to scoop up just one gig because I want to see if the gigs in the DLC for Mr. Hounds are uh, a little different. We could do this one since we're right here anyway. I want to see if they kind of vary from the normal ones. Dogtown is Millie hometown. I mean, it's where we get the little Millie truck too, like the Jeep looking Millie. Vegetarian, it might be a red flag. As long as he's down to cook me a steak every once in a while, he doesn't have to eat it. But if he knows how to still grill a steak, he can be whatever he wants to be. Oh! Whoa, shit! Sorry. Oh. I thought I was a one Meredith romancer. As if I could ever have another shot. Oh, no. Oh, oh, no. Millie, get off the bill. <laughs> Millie, stop riding it. Okay, there we go. I'm here. Mm, 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 mm. So if we find a yellow Millie, is it? Wait, wait, wait. It's the name Dewalt. Uh, the other car was Dewalt. Didn't we find one? One hour until Popaclism. Oh my gosh, he is gonna be here in an hour. Okay, I do need to make sure. Remind me when it's like two. I would say two fifteen, just so I can kind of start winding down. I think if that's the case, um. Is the next main mission going to take up a lot of time or do you think we can get it done in an hour? If I full blaze for that, I'm trying to think, should we just finish out with gigs for the last hour that are related to the DLC or do we have enough time to kind of get back into the main mission? Spazzy, thank you for the 200 bits, by the way. Do you get to choose the car you drive? Yes, I am willingly driving this vehicle. Mm -hmm. I am. Floppy pickle. Yeah, floppy pickle. 
The next mission is pretty short. Let's do the next mission. We'll prioritize it. And then if we have extra time, then we'll come back to the, some of the gigs around the DLC. Oh yeah, and Balls to the Walls will be finished by then. Let's do... Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. The Damned. Let's go to the Moth Bar. To the Moth. The plot thickens. The cast is expanding and the drama becomes a farce. Don't you think that one more secret agent in this motley crew of downed presidents, missing net runners, and sleeper pigs is one too many? Stay on top of them, V. Don't let yourself get dragged into an even bigger mess. Like, next corporate war big. I actually like his conversation and just like dialogue in this, at least related to the journal, more than even the base game. He's a little bit, at this point, he's more playful. But that could be just because of how much time that we've been together as well. Or just a side gig. 30 minutes of Millie Road Rage. <laughs> If the meg next mission's like 10 minutes, then that'll be perfect. We'll do another main mission and we'll get to see a bar at the same time. And then we'll go do some gigs after until my dad arrives. But kind of sets up for a new chapter. Well, then that's, yeah, that's a perfect place to stop. That's perfect. In the heart of the Longshore Stacks, you'll find a safe haven for any seeking to quench their thirst with a glass of good stuff and a place to relax with some classic jukebox tunes. Regulars know that the owner and bartender of this establishment are one in the same person. It's giving a uh, moxie, like mad moxie bar. Seven years ago, the woman they know as Daffy, Daffy, Daff, Daff, Daffy, Daffy. I want to say Daphne, but I know there's not an end there. Laid claim to the vacant building sitting atop an out of service boiler room and transformed it into a godsend for the Stax community, a bar. To this day, Stax residents relish visiting the moth. After a rough day where they are always greeted by a bartender, bought or by the owner herself. Daphne's, wait, it is Daphne. It's a, it is Daphne. It's a misspell, oh my gosh, it's a error. It is Daphne. But I only see her name twice. So it's either Daphne or it's Daffy. Is it Daffy Duck? Juan is, oh, is it Juan's, Juan's? Thank you for the follow, welcome in. Well, it's Daphne in the second paragraph, but they're missing an N in the first one. <laughs> Daphne's ears are always open to the locals' ramblings and ravings. She has her finger on the pulse of all Dogtown gossip. In fact, if Daphne, yeah, Daphne is spelled with an N twice, so this one's just a, yeah, error. Finds your gossip juicy, as in all get out. She might even just offer you a round on the house. In other words, if you're an anyless Dogtown resident without proper access to a therapist, then you head on over to the moth, order a stiff drink, and talk your heart out to Daffy. Daffy, we're back to Daffy! No, there's two Daphnes and two Daffies. It should come as no surprise that the bar never lacks clientele. Oh no, we're two for two. They just keep us guessing. <laughs> it's Daffy Duck. Her full name has to be Daphne Daffy. <laughs> ah, it's probably Diane. It's actually Diane. <laughs> okay, let's get over and find out. Once we see her name on the... Daffy short for Daphne. See, that's so funny. It's so different. So you said Daphne as Scooby-Doo. I would think Daphne from Frasier. That's funny. I feel like everybody's like frame of reference for like what they think of with a certain name is always different. Okay, we're gonna have to go by foot for some of this. The moth bar to the moth. Hunters, thanks for the follow, welcome in. Flatline's pretty good, I think. Great song for this moment. I pronounce it Daff. She's not a very good secret agent. She keeps <laughs> Forgetting her fake name. <laughs> Good morning, Night City. Mm -hmm. I like the like do 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 do. What in the world? No, our guest, I didn't do it. No, I'm not. <laughs> no. I wasn't trying to be. That person came out of nowhere. Why are you walking in the middle of the street? I gotta go. I think the bar guests are right there. No. Okay, we're safe. We're safe. Mm -hmm. It's nearly spring break and it's Saturday. How do you feel about cracking a white claw? 
in honor of everybody who's on spring break. <laughs> we haven't white clawed in a while. One does not simply cyberpunk and white claw at the same time. Because you know there ain't no laws when we're drinking claws. And I guess I'm already lawless to begin with, though. I think I'm going the wrong way. I don't know, we'll figure it out. There's no roads in Dogtown. Except for us, time to drink away the sorrow because we're not on spring break. And you know, there's a tree in the middle. Clept shards. It's actually kind of pretty. Okay, I see the moth. Of course, yes. We always need to touch up our lipstick. Ma'am, you have dirt all over your face. Do we want to touch up? Here's to you, carnalito. Okay. I don't think I'd recognize you on the street Aww. today. <laughs> this is a cool little area. I don't think we've ever been over here. Why? So nice outside. That's true. Oh, that's the best girl, looking food. Daphne. It is Daphne. She's really cute. I'd love to buy her a drink. All right, get buy it. Go buy Daphne a drink. At the bar she owns. You know how foolish that sounds? <laughs> Sides. <laughs> Go on. I think Does it's still a someone? fine move, even if she owns nah, the bar. Just, there's something weird about that girl. Oh, something weird. We must be shining. Using us as a mirror. <laughs> oh my goodness, you're right. Oh, she's doing it again. You're right. It is like looking in a mirror. Well, what? Okay. She doesn't like to be bothered, and I respect that. People walking in the middle street. That was a total jest. Get out of the road. Get out of the road. That's so true. If you want my advice, I dump that pile of human offal. See how he likes being alone. I like yeah, her already. Maybe you're right. Anyway, better get going. Take care. Chin up, sweet kins. Seeing sunshine round the bend. Just don't you let those bastards walk over you. Oh my gosh, I love her voice. It's perfect. Will it be honey pie? Oh my gosh, it's like Waffle House servers. We're getting called honey. Soda juice, whatever. Surprise me. Let's see what happens. Surprise me. Adventurous. How special coming up. Oh my gosh. It's not quite. Wait, wait. Hey, read, read. Sure am. Waiting for you. I'll be there momentarily. There's uh Show you shady you know. Sensing something stanky. Sensing there's legacy shit needs resolving. You know that op seven years back that went south? Well, Mai's left me for dead. Cover story was I sold out to Arasaka. I never told oh. Alex it was a cover. Okay. So things could get tense. Hmm. You and Alex, two of you were close. I let our cell in the NC was her handler. She wound up stuck here in Dogtown post-war. Thinks it was because I turned coat. Mm. Do you see what I'm driving at? I'm picking up what you're putting down. Could have mentioned this earlier. Sent me into a minefield. <laughs> I'll just say it. Got it. Might tell us to go fuck ourselves. Something like that. I'm nearing the entrance. Was he nominated for and voice actor for the are. awards? Enjoy Honey Bunch. Honey Bunch. Thanks. I love First it. Time in here. I got that right? We see it. coming. It's coming. Returns welcome in. Oh, hell no. Oh, oh, let me drink. Let me drink. Let me drink. Let me drink. Mom and dad are fighting. I'm looking for an Alex. Oh, he was. Like, fuck you are. So she You're not on here. The awfully short list of folks we just don't serve here. <laughs> Turn the fuck around and get I'll out. I have a gin and tonic. Make it a double. He is bold. He's with me. You've got some balls. All right, my people. We gotta close up for the day. Well, I ain't going fucking anywhere. Oh no. Come on. You serious? But it does feel like they, well, I think they respect her, though. I, yeah, you can see it. Like, they don't like it, but they know it's her bar, her rules. Everyone out! Now! Mm. 
Oh. Alex. Seven. Seven fucking years in this shithole. Cause of you, Solomon Reed. Mm. Sol ain't getting it. Maybe you will. V. I should have disarmed her. Meyer sent us. Got a mission in Dogtown. It's a good thing I took that drink before. I should have disarmed With her though. him? FYI, seven years ago, this scumbag stabbed everybody in the back. No, seven years ago, I was ordered to go to ground. And you were fed a cover story. I had to take the fall. There was no other way. Expect me to believe you? Just like that? Get the fuck out of my sight, both of you. Oh, I got orders from the prison. You want to spend the rest of your life here? Hey, I Hit get it. Where? You and Reed got some mutual splaining to do, clearly. Have at it. Then live out the rest of your days in this musty armpit. That's some kind of convoluted threat? <laughs> no, we actually need you. But maybe you need us more. The possibility of getting out of here will bite. Yeah, it'll cause her to bite. Of some mozzarella sticks. Fuck this. Need a smoke. Should be fucking ashamed, Saul. Yeah, but I feel like also it says a lot for him to show up. I think it does say that his story about it being a cover story seems like it kind of... Why else would he come in here, you know? I think sometimes you have to think about it from that perspective. Like it would take a lot of guts. Like he knows that he could possibly get shot if he steps foot back in here. So it's gotta be worth the risk enough for him. Tense, he said, shape shifting. I wanna ask about that. What was that? Did, did she just shape shift? Metatropic cloaking, perks of the FIA Militech connection. You get to call dibs on their latest gen, cutting edge tech. That's sick. Full mystique mode. Could get tense, he said. Yeah. Yeah. I like that that was shown though, because at the beginning when we were reading about the FIA, they said uh, cutting edge technology. And I told you guys, I looked at y'all and I was like, I hope we get to see this. Oh, that's so sick. Uh, drink and stand. Yeah. I love it. Let me try this. Give me a minute. Seven years old You're cutting edge. Someone's gotta better me than you. Dimensions look good. We got a good neck to shoulder ratio. Traps. Waist. He does look like a prawn, kind of like hunched over there, but he looks sad. Well, yeah, I mean, I think all of these situations. Yeah, he looks really sad. I'm sure he's lived a pretty lonely life being you know, in the FIA, I think, and being in the situation. Like, yeah, he's a bouncer and he probably has kind of curated some friends and people to call like a community of some sorts. But at the same time, it's like people will never know who you really, really are. I think there's just a loneliness there. And then to have other people constant or like to know that other people see you in a negative light when you also almost died because the president, Mr. Judgy McJudges in here, <laughs> the preem traps. Always. Hmm, better traps than rivers. All right, well, don't, don't. You cannot compare river and Idris on another side. Like, you just can't do it. And I saw that you guys said that he was nominated. I didn't realize that. Maybe it was because, did he not show up for it? Maybe it was because he didn't show up for it, even though he got nominated or something. Cam, Lolo, JC, and Mystery, I think it is. Thank you guys for the follows and welcome in. <laughs> Couldn't wait till I was done. Met you'd spin and Reed's drink in the chance. I'm V. He wasn't there. He wasn't actually at the awards. Oh, I think there's definitely a resigned sadness in his voice. Absolutely. Yeah. I'm V, by the way. <sighs> he knew Baldur's Gate would win. Alex. It wasn't worth So NUSA's tossing us back into the fray, huh? New mission? Yeah, great so. Well, fire away. Serenade me. 
Your real face, what I'm looking at now. Uh, is that like the first? Uh, I kind of want to ask it though. You right now? Yes, Bowser. Looking at the real Alex. What's it to you? I mean, what's the diff? Nobody who's anybody cares about the real Alex. See, that's what so if I lonely. Do? Then it's solely your problem. Now, about the mission. Spill. Hmm. FIA agent went missing in Dogtown. I wonder, she must know, she must know her. FIA agent went missing. Ben Star. Reed and I are tasked with finding her. And all of a sudden, FIA remembers I exist. You know Dogtown better something. than any other operative in their ranks. Their ranks? So you're not FIA. Curious. <sighs> what leverage they had on you. Look at this from the shop perspective, though. It's beautiful with the red lights kind of casting on her face. I love the lighting in this game. They've done a phenomenal job. Deals are one off thing for Fine. Me. I'll wait. Deals just okay. for this one off. Then I'm out. <laughs> Very atmospheric. <laughs> yeah. count on brevity. Me? One in the same mission for the last seven fucking years. Been working the local arms and tech dealers since the war. My one op, that. Going real swell. Well, I got a lot less time than that. Always starts the same way. Do them a favor, they promise one in return. Sometimes even deliver. I wish I could see your face. Then one day, they nail your dick to the wall. This op mean that much to you? Because you're clearly hoping to get something out of it question is what I like everything that she's pulling from even just the phrase that we had said yeah Larvair welcome back in yeah after the same person FIA and me gotta know who I'm dealing FIA with and here me. we're after the same runner interests aligned so you're looking at agent V now right and the chair jock is Songbird. <sighs> she knows. Oh, fuck me. Gonna take more than one sig to process that. <laughs> sheesh. <laughs> she also banned from your bar? I wanna hear her say sheesh. Something the matter? Oh, she doesn't. Ah, so you don't know. This is know what? You are now in dog town. Story of a clusterfuck op. One that led to Reed disappearing and me being holed up here for seven years. Here's the list of operatives. Reed, Songbird, and me. Haven't heard this, have you? Beautiful view, That's yeah. That's just perfect. Tell me you believe in coincidences? Or, fuck it, fate? Cause plug the same variables into an equation and surprise, gonna get the same fucking result. Shit in, shit out. <sighs> well, you and that hangdog Judas are in luck. Cause I got a nasty habit of repeating the same gonk mistakes. Got conditions though. Hmm, naturally. But I mean, I think it also kind of comes or stems from the whole situation of what does she have to lose at this point to continue to work at the bar, which I didn't realize her, I think her voice was also a front too then. Like, same as the face. Because she speaks entirely Scabbed differently. Out your tongue? Yes. You in any position to have any? Sit on their payroll. Don't care. Tell Saul I'm done letting everyone walk all over me, expecting me to lick their boots. Way I see it, this is a favor I'm doing, a transaction. Want my back scratched in return. Conditions. So what's I like your her ask? freckles. Everybody has freckles in this game, and Monaco. it's so cute. Want to burn rubber along the Riviera? Drink champagne on a yacht with a fucking duchess. <laughs> Want a spy's retirement? Diplomatic posting in a warm, gobsmackingly gorgeous place where fruit off the trees is sweet and demand for field work is zero. You know what? Think I think we can make that, that work. Yeah. Reed's sure to set it up. Mission comes straight from 
That is true. I mean, we could definitely set it up by telling her that it's for. Yeah. Orders came from the like the press. So, yeah. Preem. Go back inside. Tell him I'm in. Gonna need more nicotine before I look at his face again. <laughs> okay. Thanks, Alex. The the. <laughs> oh. But again, I don't think she has a lot to lose with that one. So. Wreck and snug guys, thanks for the follows. Welcome in. Hold on, let me get behind the bar. I like this better. I no, I can't promise something like. Oh, that's funny. It won't let me talk to him on this side of the bar. Absolutely not. No. There's no way that we can promise it. It's but that happens in games a lot. Like a lot of people will like ask you as the protagonist, like, can you make this happen? And you're like, I don't really have the power to, but we'll give her, you know, maybe I can trade my dinner with the prez so. for what she's asking, you know. Some kind of sort. Slayer, welcome in. Monaco, that'd be nice. I was thinking something like Mediterranean. Uh Alex wants a spy's retirement. <laughs> Kept some crap from you, Raid. Still care about you. Alex does. She's Let's in. Let's lead with Show. this. She wants a spy's nice retirement in return. Don't we all? Can't say I blame her. Oh, oh, she's come back in. I should have picked a different voice. No, no, no. So, heard you need someone to hold your hand, Reed. Take you on a tour of NC's asswart. I came to you because I trust you, Alex. Look at his facial expressions. If you say so. Fine, Songbird. Heard we got a sniffer out. Song's in my in Dogtown. Can't say if she's alive. Could be anywhere, that one. I know, I don't want to say with it. Like, I definitely believe she's somewhere in Dogtown, but I'm going to say it could she be anywhere. She could be anywhere, for all we know. Mm. We were linked, comms like. Song ventured into cyberspace, then got attacked. She vanished just after. That's all we know. We need a net runner. Kind who spends all their waking hours parsing teraflops of data. Might have caught something. You have someone in mind? A new net runner. Wilkie Slider Laguerre. Slider? I should have figured. Went rogue a while back. But I know where that little rat nests. Okay. Slider, care to fill me in? Renegade voodoo boy, murderer turned CI, all around piece of shit. Sliders. Outside Grr. the net, he's blinder than three mice. Damaged <sighs> occipital lobe. Not even a Kuroshi could mend it. Really? Oh my gosh, the... I think this guy will be willing to help. Slider? Always looks Don't like a piece of gum. Breath. Classic repeat offender, no scruples or principles. Had a titty twist him to work for us. Likely this time you'll just have to twist a little harder. How's an intel agency lose a blind man? In the Hold net. himself up with Haitian buddies. Operates a large-scale tech and demon mill. Hmm. Think Kabuki's home to Night City's soft sorcerers? <laughs> no. They're just there to push product. Be snappy. Why haven't you collared him yet? Claim Slider dropped off your radar, went rogue. But you know where he is? Why haven't you brought him in? Uh, I don't know. Not the voodoo boys again. Maybe saving him for a rainy fucking day. Okay. Slider wasn't on my list of prios. Not like it's any of your biz. Smoky bar. All right, we'll start by paying him a visit. So, we paying him a visit. Not the voodoo boys Slider again. hides out in a would-be spa in Luxor Heights. Flick you exact chords in two secs. Or we'll rendezvous there. Alex and I have some, uh, catching mm -hmm. up to do. Right. Just don't gouge each other's eyes out. Need both of you alive and healthy. Oh, this, this statement every single time. Flynn, welcome so, back in. Oh, let's listen. Let's listen. Shh. Where you been? Involved with someone? Oh, oh. I was. For a time. It didn't pan out, though. There's more, there's more you? to this, I'm sure. You know no poor bastard would have put up with me longer in a month. <laughs> Come on. 
Stop pretending you would have lasted any longer. Got numerous hobbies. Sue me. Speaking of which, if I know you at all, you ain't dunking and swishing balls anymore. Am I right? Sorry, what? Only in my neck of the woods. You know how it is. Yeah. Surprised you didn't I'm not used to up. this phrase? Go home. Used to go on and on about those fucking tacos. Myself I couldn't have the follow even if I wanted to. As to what kept me here, must have been something. Hmm. Which begs the question, Reed. What about me? Why couldn't I go home? The only way FIA agents left Night City was in body bags. Not you? No. No, there was a bag with my name on it. Definitely. Just dumb luck that I'm sitting here in one piece. You never believed in coincidence. Still don't. There's so much juicy dialogue to get if you wait around as well. Yes, 156. Good, good, good. Thank you. Yeah. That would be really hard, though, to be stuck somewhere on, like, a job for... I think... Whoa! For seven years, if, especially if she is trying to, like, be undercover ginger, I swear. Wait, what is that? Now I want to come back in here. Is this the cook? Is he going to the bathroom? Want some tacos now? It is! It's like the cook. Ginger's got hair everywhere. Mmm. It must be... Yeah, I guess. Oh, this is a nice place she got back here. Oh, oh let's see her emails. Oh, she's got one message. Robot software. To Phoenix. Hold on. I'm coming back with the software thing I mentioned the other day. The robot's all set up. I need you to wipe the old programming clean so there's no trace of the previous owner on board. Gotta upload all the new data from the shard I prepared. Oh, and I need this wear of yours to work flawlessly. And the robot will tend the bar and serve customers, so no cutting corners here. Can't have her glitching or crashing while she's pouring coffee. I still want to double check it all before I send her to work. Sounds good? Sorry, but no such thing as flawless soft, especially with complex soft like this here. Ain't no calculator to make perfect results every time. It will crash occasionally just the way it is. That said, I can promise you high speed customer service. She'll go out and I'll send you a patch or even pop in to install a hotfix and have some hot coffee. Plus, I'll scrape the old wear. The bot will feel like new. Trust me, I aim to satisfy. It's kind of a cool tidbit. I'm snooping on the laptop in front of her. Alex too saggy. Hansen's lapdogs are buzzing like an angry hornet's nest. They're recruiting left and right, buying stadium combat implants in bulk. Something's about to go down. Your informant's talking. I heard the colonel setting up a meet with buyers and allies. Maybe he just wants the, to bolster security? Nah, there's more to this. They're setting up new posts, reinforcing existing ones, and placing spotters in key locations. Sky monitoring systems are on high alert too, as if they're expecting an airstrike or something. Maybe it's nothing, but I'm still letting you know just because it is an, an anomaly later. Hmm. Okay. Well, we got to learn about her cool robot. Let's go see him in work. Uh, okay, robot slacking on the cleaning. Bear. <laughs> Bear with the gifted sub to eavesdropping. Would you expect anything different from me? Naturally. Also, can we talk to him extra? No. Okay, so this is a great spot to... Oh, Johnny. Back Welcome traitor. back in, by the way. Yeah. Maz and King, guys, thank you for the follows. People come here to commemorate the dead. No Colin Barium in Dogtown last I checked. People gotta have some place to pay their respects. Oh, that's true. Problem with that is the dead don't give a fuck about flowers and lit candles. They're fucking dead. Wasteland high. Let's see your email. She says so casually. Hey, I'm getting the extras for you guys. All right. Y'all weren't willing to do it, but I am. Mm. Yep. Somebody caught the grumpy bug this morning. You deserve a candle too, Johnny. Aw. Come on. Would have lit one for you if I wasn't fresh out just now. Shit, maybe I am as sentimental as everyone else. I was wondering if that's what it stems from. When I see those two, read Alex. Went through something similar myself. Landon, 
thank you for five whole years. You are truly bananas. <laughs> thank you so much and welcome back in. And yes, I hope you have a wonderful day as well. Thank you for believing in me. Just five plus years. <laughs> and yeah, and Maz, and then there was one other. Guys, thank you for the follows. Welcome in. Empathy from you. This is a good moment with him, I feel like. Hmm. Share a bond, those two. True friends. What could possibly know about them? Empathy from you? Got a bond, two of them. Took maybe four minutes and they buried the hatchet. See it clear as day. Any shred of friendship they've got left will fizzle out. Not right now, but soon. Hmm. Could have spilled the truth years ago, stayed tunes. But no, stubborn old Reed had his orders. Friendship and duty, not mutually exclusive. Oh. Just saying that because you had never had friends. Their soldiers stick together no matter what. They're fighting for a common cause. I like the top one, I think. I do. Growth through consistency and time has been great to see. Absolutely. Landon, thank you for the kind words and just being with me for so long. Punchy Goblin, Punchy Goblin, welcome back in too. Landon, thank you. Yes, have a great weekend. Mutually like this one. exclusive friendship and duty. Matter of fact, they are. Had good reasons to fly the army coop. Think, how many times you willing to get burned before you stop trusting someone? To be fair, that's a great question. If you guys have seen an ounce of this playthrough, you realize that I put my trust in too many people and I constantly get burned or end up naked and my weapon's completely taken away from me. <sighs> Valid question. You might be right. <gasps> mm. Might have a point, Johnny. Sir Fresco, Replace hi. Replace someone with country or corp. How many times you gotta take a bullet for these motherfuckers in the name of empty promises? Chew on that when you look at those two. I don't think it's so bad if you like learn Hello, from it, Doctor. but it's. This is Kurt Hansen. He just walks away. Ramos, same, honestly. I keep falling for it. That's why I was saying, no, no, it not the Voodoo Boys, is because I fell for it. I trusted them, and I got backstabbed. Armed, dangerous. I, th I think that's there was a part of that that I really liked though which was the aspect of oh ginger I saw you the side of him kind of admitting yeah maybe maybe he does care something like that about having like a candle lit I mean you saw how he got one of the most emotional conversations we have with Johnny is when we go to see where he was buried um I saw you grumpy little girl come here She's walking away, but I'll leave it open. She's walking here. Felina Kiss. Felina Kiss, thank you for seven months. Thank you so much. And also for just everything you do for such a good friend of mine. Like, I thank you through and through. Uh, yeah, it's been chilled out of, out of action. The broken collar, but wait, had you mentioned that before? Watching lots of anime. <laughs> What's been your favorite so far? Slayer, welcome back in. All right, let's do a... Actually, we're, there's a gig right here. So let's... Uh, yeah, we're going to do some gigs for Mr. Holmes. Um, and then we have about probably like 20 minutes. And then I've got a skedaddle for today. Um, my dad's coming into town. But tomorrow, like I said, we'll do a much longer, much longer... We'll probably do like an hour or mo more so than I normally do. Hi! Are you coming back now? Now you're coming back? Come here. I see you. Come here. Of course I'm still dressed like a chocobo. Of course I am. Hi, baby. She wants the box. She wants the giant fractal box. Okay. Yeah. Not grumpy bun. Also, Skywalker, thank you for the hydrate. This is all I have to hydrate right now. Hmm. Where are you going? Oh my goodness, did you just wake up from a nappy? Did you just wake up from a nap? Are you tired? Say, I didn't get my wet food this morning because mom forgot to buy new wet food, so I haven't had wet food and I'm grumpy and I'm angry and I want pet and it's raining outside and my arthritis is flaring up and I'm just not happy. Mm hmm. You're watching One Piece right now. Isn't that a long series? It's like super long. 
London, thank you for the three gifted subs to the channel and community. Bear with the 12 hour stream for tomorrow. I don't think so. But we are doing all cyberpunk uh, streams going forward until we finish the game. You're so cozy today. No, her hair is going to get all over the black case. Oh no, maybe it is best for me give, to give that case to my dad. I decided to get into One Piece 430 episodes later and it's damn good. That's just a lot of episodes. That's a lot. I mean, I'm still catching up on other things. Your hair just went in my drink. I, that's nasty. That's disgusting. Elder Zoomer, thank you for the follow. And Crate, thank you for two gifted subs to the channel and community as well. Are you a happy girl? You feel very chonky today. Like, is your food sitting with you? Are you water weight? Are you carrying water weight? Your dad will appreciate hey, the gingivitis hair in the case. If he sees the gingivitis hair on the case, he's going to be like, there's no way I'm going to get this. He does not like cats. Well, and he's going to be sneezing up a storm as well. Yeah. I recently started One Piece with only 17 episodes so far. So many more. You know when sometimes your cat just feels like she's holding more water weight or something? What are you doing? You're wanting scratchies. I see you are. Yeah. How does one not like cats? I know. Oh, my brother's new girlfriend. She has a really cute cat. I'll have to see if I can snag a picture. My cats are incredibly friendly. Ginger is pretty friendly. Like, I will say she likes her family. Like, she definitely prefers her family. But, I don't know. For the most part, she'll growl a couple times, that's for sure. Quali! Oh my gosh. Quali, thank you so much for the raid, guys. Welcome in. This is, oh, we're having cranky cat time. Yeah, cranky cat time. Not the time to come in. Quali, thank you so much for the raid, guys. Welcome, welcome in. If you have never been here, my name is Casta, and this is my 17-year-old baby ginger. Uh, Mr. Norris, welcome in. Quali, thank you for the raid. What were you playing? What were you doing? Bang, thank you for the following. Guys, if y'all are on my channel, please go check out Quali. I feel like our times never link up to where I can raid you. Yeah, she's an old lady. She's having arthritis issues today. It's super rainy outside, so she's grumpy, especially today. Quali, thank you so much for the raid. Guys, please go check out Quali, variety streamer, incredible person, and I think I finally get to meet her at TwitchCon. I do. Gia, welcome in. Giant Wombat and Sunny, guys, thank you for the follows. And Mr. Norse, thank you for the 100 bits. And other than that, I'm a variety streamer. I love cats. Taco Bell. And we're doing our first playthrough of Cyberpunk. And then sometimes I play games on YouTube as well. Yeah, Ginger sounded like a cartoon. She's so darn cute. She is an old grumpy lady, but she wanted to come in here and get pet. She like wants attention. She's like a pet me with your eyes. Like she rubs all up against my legs and then she's like, no, pet me with your eyes. Yes. Is Anna going to TwitchCon as well? I will. I'm going to hold off and let her. Has she announced it herself? Um, yeah, I will be going. I will be going to TwitchCon EU at least, not NA's version. Yeah. Quali, is it official? Did you get your tickets? Are you going? You're like going? No kidding. Also, let me solo them. And Sean, guys, thank you for the follows. Ken as well. Yeah. Alrighty, I'm finally free. Cam Jam, welcome back in to see you at TwitchCon EU. I'm so excited to finally get to meet you and link up. And we definitely need to hang out and catch up and just share stories and talk. London, thank you for the gifted sub to damn it, Carl. Carl as well. Damn it, Carl. I thought she would. My button is hovering over the treat redemption. She doesn't have treats right now. Right now we just have, I don't have the like crunchy treats. She has delectables. But no delectables for today. No delectables. Get the plane tickets. She still hasn't bought in the plane tickets yet. Also, bro him, welcome in as well. You did buy the tickets. Okay, awesome. Yeah. Oh. Are you ready to get down? Yeah, we're gonna do one gig. I'm actually getting ready to gear up and end here soon, probably in 20 minutes, but we got ginger time and then we're gonna do one gig as well. I'm so excited. Also, if you have to raid and dash, I totally understand. Thank you so much for bringing your incredible community over here. Yes, Ollie and Castor Meetup will break the universe and I'm here for it. I am super excited. I've been wanting to link up with you for a while, so it'll be a blast, absolutely. Yeah, Yanks, thank you so much. Wait. Thank you for the gifted sub also to Gia. Thank you. Looking forward to catching up and seeing you. Yes, absolutely. And it's your first TwitchCon. You'll love it. Last year was mine. Okay, you're super grumpy. I get it. She says, if I come in here and I don't get treats, I'm mad. I'm mad. I know. So mad. 
Can I have Ginger? No, I've had her for all 17 years and she will stay with me for 17 years. Okay, maybe like a good five more years. Here's to hoping for 17 more years of Ginger. <laughs> One small favor, welcome back in. And also Polka, welcome in as well. Polka Warlord, is that what it is? One small favor. Thank you for the resub and full sword. Thank you for seven months of continual support as well. She just wants snacks. Yeah, she's just always acting grumpy, but I get it. Her bones hurt, her heart's barely working. Like she's like, let me go. Yeah. How goes one to sign up babysitting Ginger? I'm asking for a friend. My dad always has that honor. He gets to babysit her anytime I travel and he hates me for it. My dad calls her gingivitis, if that's any indication of his feelings for her. Small favor, thank you for 15 months. I really appreciate it, truly. Uh, Mr. Norris, hi. And again, thank you for those bits as well. And full sworn, where have you been? Thank you for seven months of continual support as well. Yeah. Sounds pretty clear. Yeah, I don't think we have to spell this one out. <laughs> Ginger Vitus, what else does he call her? He's got a couple mean names for her. My dad is so mean. No, my dad's awesome. He's awesome. He just is allergic to cats. So that's why he always like, he's like, somehow I always end up babysitting your cat. I swear. Pseudo, pseudo and Triz, guys. Thank you for the follows as well. Yeah, Quali, I forgot. Have you done Cyberpunk? Because if you haven't, I would definitely say avoid spoilers get the heck out of here um but you should absolutely try it as well i'm doing the dlc we're finally at the dlc so we've got probably another month of this and then moving on to other things as well willie dave thank you for the follow yeah we're gonna be doing knights of the old republic next my mom's cat is 10 years old and he's great other than waking me up and paving me <laughs> with pawing you in the face at seven in the morning i mean as you can see she's still i guess i would say she still has full orange cat energy like she's a mess even at 17 years old she's finally slowed down probably five years ago she really slowed down but still a menace she's just been she's on a she's currently showing she hates me by pooping in my shower right now she gives no craps yeah knights of the old republic not subnautica trash not subnautica <laughs> rob thank you so much for the gift of to spyro as well thank you you said one more month what what, Ginger? I don't have snacks for you. <sighs> she's giving a lot of craps. She's actually, yeah, she's actually giving all the craps. What are you coming back in here for? Are you trying to poof all over the new PC? You're a mess. You're a mess. You're a mess. Almost 215, probably enough for one gig. Yeah, I think we can do one gig and then we'll probably move on. Are you enjoying Cyberpunk? I've heard mixed things about it. Johnny, welcome back in as well. I... Let me like I did not think I was going to enjoy it because aesthetics wise, it's not normally my my thing. I'm not a big like futuristic cyberpunk esque. like I never thought I was into that kind of genre. The story is so good. The world building is so phenomenal. It just has become not I wouldn't I wouldn't go as far to say one of my favorite games, but it is among some of the better games that I played for sure. Get out of the box. Oh my goodness. Now she's in the box. Hold on. Now she's in the box. What are you doing? Oh my God. What are you doing? Oh, if I did, I... Okay. <laughs> All right. Yep. If I fits, I sit. Now she's scratching it. Oh my goodness. What are you doing? All right, she's gonna enjoy that one. You can get them all of the, all of the things in the world, all the treats, all the toys, but yet a box will still, she'll be more enamored at a box than anything else you could possibly buy her. Exactly. Yanks with the gifted sub to shower poop. Thank you. Yes, thank you so much. And London, thank you for the gifted sub to trash. Kling, thank you for the follow as well. Uh, but I highly recommend it. I think that there is so much incredible content that you can get like, like for what you pay for it. There's so much that comes with it. And just like any, I would say, I would say it's a really great follow up. I think I did enjoy Witcher 3 more just because it's, it's totally, I'm more of like a fantasy kind of person, medieval style and everything. My favorite game of all time is actually Witcher 3 now. It used to be Fable and uh, Witcher 3 usurped it. Mm-hmm. She's like, box? What box, Marky? 
Yes. If you haven't played Disco Elysium, saw it on sale right now. Oh, how much of a sale is it on right now, Animal? We were just talking about that. We actually were just talking about that. Your cat looks good for 17 years old. No doubt she'll be there for many more. My own cat has 22 years, but well, your own cat was 22 years. Also, Sir Positive, welcome back in. Uh, thank you. I do think that she's like I joke about it, but mine is like the arthritis and she has like a heart murmur, but the heart murmur she's had for a couple of years and the vet doesn't think there's anything wrong. Like it's not that big of a deal, I guess. As as small of a deal as it can be, it's nothing to worry about in the long term. Too, too bad. Mm -hmm. You got good taste. So many good games you just listed. Yeah. And if you ever want to see all the lists of the games I've played, you can definitely do X Marsh Mark. Um, Ah, uh, completed, completed. And then I play a bunch of games on YouTube as well. I'm doing Final Fantasy Remake or Rebirth on uh, on YouTubes right now. So lots of, I definitely do way more narrative games than I think anything else, but I'm always open and try just about anything. I'll try anything just about one time. All right. But this all came about because everybody was telling me I was gonna enjoy this story. I didn't think I was. Let's go, oh, let's go look at the clothing options actually. I didn't think I was going to enjoy it, and then I really ate my words. And I guess I probably need to start sometimes, maybe, considering that you guys may or may not know me just a little bit. No, we're leaving the pond Welcome pond area. Welcome to where the magic happens. If you're looking for preen threats, okay. you found them. My cat's 19. And she's not doing so great, but we will. Oh, I just missed that. A movie buff. Hold on, What's let me look to buy first. Town these days? You, you know, know you guys always I used say to be I like... a designer at Ejai once upon a time. Taught me one important thing. I know. Your clothes are a tool, not an accessory, no matter what life you're trying to build. And in Dogtown, practicality is king. Now I can get behind that practicality. Wait a minute. What about some of these says practical? Hold on. I don't know about that. I still love the cowboy hat with these blazer tops. Yeah. Um, I mean, especially at 19, like 19 is really good. I mean, Ginger, even especially the older that your pets get, like a year can make a big difference. Like Ginger's, Ginger's, <laughs> I know she keeps coming in. She's great right now, right? But like, you never know, like a year, you never know what could happen. Um, which is why like you have to pay attention to their health and their eating and everything and so much more. What puppy? Uh, okay. Fast fashion. Okay. Right now we are currently rocking the chocobo look. So I'm trying to, oh, I could, oh, maybe different. No, the chocobo yellow boots are good. Are we here to buy my Palata land so you can drill for oil <laughs> with this? <laughs> oh my gosh, it's the skirt that says beach. <laughs> motion, motion, motion. We really know why you'll enjoy. You know I'm not going to. Joshua, thanks for the follow. And depth with the posture check. Oh, I know. Yes, I often forget there's a preview to be fair. Okay, we're not gonna be able to see that. I think I already own that. Um, is this one of the ones that has? Yep. I hate that stuff on the back. Although that's kind of cool. Like maybe we should, maybe I should just get over it. You know, maybe I should, ugh, I'll buy it. I'll buy it. Why not? We need to do something with all the money we have. Maybe I could buy River a new coat, a new coat for River. <laughs> yeah, we are tatted out in this game. It's, again, I, this is only working because I'm intentionally going for a chocobo look. Otherwise, I would not be rocking these sleeves. But it is cool, the new clothes that they had introduced with the DLC. <gasps> okay, solid pink latex dress. Good luck getting this thing off. Oh my gosh. River loves the sheepskin. River needs a new eye. Oh, is that the only reason why you guys don't like him? There's so much hate for River. <laughs> so much hate. Mmm. Nothing that I really want. Maybe the white pants. Like, I could possibly see, like, a use for these. Impractical, for sure. But they could go with the red, the red and the white. Let me make sure that I know exactly what my, my dad's getting here. Uh, Judge, thank you for the follow as well. Is the story for this game good like Witcher 3? I would say the story is great. No, the story is phenomenal. I will say that even just the short... this. I think it took me longer to get into the main mission story, but then the DLC just completely has swept me off my feet. I think it's hard. Like, I would never compare Witcher's story to this story, though, because they're, it's just like oranges to apples in a lot of ways, even though it's by the same team. I got to head out for the day. Thank you for the stream. Absolutely. Congratulations on the sponsor as well. That's so cool. And I hope you have a great rest of your day and see you in the next stream. Yes, Shadow, I hope I see you tomorrow for a little bit longer of a time as well. And I'm headed out here soon too, but have a great rest of your Saturday. Thank you for absolutely everything and for 500 more bits as well. Do something fun. 
Um, yeah, I'm gonna leave all the jackets and everything alone. Okay, so I think we have time. If I, I think we have time for one gig. Plus I wanna do something with Mr. Hands. Knowing the ending, I say the story here is much more robust. Main story on Witcher 3 is a tiny bit rushed at the end. Ending does make a big difference. I do talk oh, about on. that in a lot of games. Like that's how I feel about the Grim Legend series is every time you get to the end, it felt so rushed. Ribs, ribs sound good. Why is Pon Pon on? Okay, here we go. V. A few days ago, scavengers had a more. transport. The tech vanished, as did the guards. The latter will presume for good. Now that would just Love be another Mr. day Hens. in Dogtown, until I receive word from Zeta Tech CEO. The transport, though unmarked, happened to be theirs. Among the plethora of tech stolen, there was one precious eye implant <gasps> and its schematics. River's eye? The poor scavs seem unaware of its built-in GPS tracker. You'll follow their SIG. Go to the scavs nest and the scraper in the longshore stacks. I've sent you more details in writing. Okay. Let's look at more details in the writing. Get all your dancing out of here. <laughs> more. All right, retrieve the prototype implant and its schematics. A few days ago, the scavengers raided a convoy returning from the stadium. Soon after, I received a call from the regional director of Zeta Tech informing me, said, informing me said convoys was theirs. Now they'd tried to, uh, now they'd tried to keep their transaction on the down low. Unfortunately, it seems that the scabs go lower. Zeta Tech lost a valuable prototype implant along with its technical documentation. They'd like to retrieve their lost items. Fortunately, the prototype is emitting a trackable signal. It's pointed to the scab hunt haunt haunt in the longshore stacks at the construction site of a long unfinished skyscraper i've sent you the coordinates i trust you'll do the rest make this work easy all right let's go sniper on top side oh i don't know if i can inflict enough damage to one and done nope no yeah i was like one and done is not gonna happen but but, oh, okay. Oh, oh. Let's go Widowmaker. Grenade. I gotta kill the people on the bottom. We're getting weapon glitch too from the bottom side. I'm gonna destroy you. Get her, get her, get her, get her. Weapon glitch done. I wasn't knowing if I could shoot through that. Oh, we're getting messed up. You guys did say that DLC is a little bit more difficult, and I gotta remember that. I took the base game for granted. There are two more. Okay. Short circuit down bottom. All right, he's dead. Woo. Big boy, big boy, big boy. Big boy. Big boy. The music's good. Is your scavs music? Uh, where's it coming from? Uh, hold on. Did their range? Absolute quarterbacks out here with these grenades. He's gonna weapon glitch me. Gonna pressure him. Fuck it. Mm. Oh, I gotta get this guy. Mm. Nice. More? How many are there? What do you have left on Cyber 77? Uh, DLC. Kill these, we should be good. Wow, look at all this. Yeah, uh, we're finishing up DLC at this point, so we're getting kind of close to the ending, I guess. But you could put so many hours in this too, so like, I say we're close to the ending, but that's probably not true at all. 
You could probably put another 60 more hours in the DLC. All right, let's initiate overload. I believe it's the scabs music. Yeah, from the first mission. Mm. Was this the music when we were playing through Babs and the other guys? Break these. Babs and, uh, oh, what was his name? They still have to call us back, the generator squad. Was that the music that was playing for that mission too? The DSC is like 40 hours kind of rushing it. Yeah, and we only really just started, although the last stream we put in solid hours into the main mission, so we probably have another 30, I would say 30 to 40 more hours of gameplay, to be honest. Dark, Tabonely, and Gange. Okay, Guys, thanks for the follows, welcome in. Sue Taylor. Loot all impact, grenades all in the scrapper. Great, now the car, about it, get rid of it, moron. To trash a good ride, hold, how to check. Signal beacons, no whatever, dump is in the shady shithole. Sink it, burn, then sink. Burn it, then sink it. The Widowmaker's so good, oh yeah. I mean, I like all of my weapons. I'm hoping to find some good weapons because y'all said that there's some weapons that you might prefer in the DLC, so I'm trying to find some of those. Uh, you didn't touch the DLC until you beat the main game. Explains why you've been playing this for so long. Uh, yeah, no, no, no. I wear... I know that there's... Okay, I know we initiated overload on that. I know there's a guy somewhere. Yeah, oh, shoot. Well, I didn't even finish. I haven't finished all of the main game either. We still have two, three more missions for main game. We're down to Nocturne and a couple other things. Merlin, it's everything I was hoping for and more. It's, there's so many hours in, oh, so many amazing hours. Side missions. Uh, there's just so much to do in Rebirth right now. It's everything I was hoping for and more. Oh, nice. I know, how far into the game are you, Merlin? So much queen's blood. All the queen's blood to be had. All right, let's switch our win for this. I like this sign, coming. Is there a story for what, Pengu? Which one? There's some stuff down here too. Kind of cool little outpost they've got here though. You're in chapter nine. Oh, oh my goodness. I'm still in four. But four was really long. Four is a, a juicy chapter. Noise. Yeah, story and this are in rebirth. Many people just did the main story and the odd and odd side stories and then moved on. For this game, are you talking about for this game specifically, Echo? Or um Piffin. Hold up. Hold up. That's not good. That's not good. Yeah. Mm, 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 mm. I need to listen to myself and skip through a lot of the open world content that you covered. What do you mean listen to yourself? Yeah, I mean, I'm covering everything. That's the other thing about my... I am trying to show what chapter... Um, I'm trying to show what chapters are what for Rebirth, but... Okay, we're good. We keep pressing. Yeah, especially because it's 2.30 right now. I don't have a text from him, so we should be good, but my dad's pretty on time with things. Chris, thank you for 15 months of continual support as well. I might have to jet out of here and not do a raid today, guys, because I have a feeling it's going to ring like any second now. Pedro and Tony, Tony, you guys, thanks for the follows, welcome in. Yeah, I'll be doing just about anything that I encounter, but I am going to try to do a better job at, uh, I did this for, I did this for Final Fantasy 16. I actually wrote out and did timestamps, so I might just do timestamps for people that do want to, like, just focus on the main mission. I know, Blue Tendo, I've got a jet, I've got a jet. Bear with the thousand bits forgot a jet. Woo! Yeah, tomorrow we'll do a long one, though. Sure. We'll get a lot done tomorrow. And then I'm hoping for Monday or Thursday to do a gigs day for main day. Mm. Bear, thank you so much. Okay. There's a lot of dudes. Weapon glitching, not nice. Oh, he's weapon glitching? 
snap. Not ideal, not ideal. What am I doing? What am I doing? Woo! Tomorrow's 12, like normal. Yeah. Take the sides. Actually, he's almost he's actually pretty close to die. Oh uh, yeah, 12 is right. I'm gonna see. Oh. Nice. Did you say the mark side quest? Oh, I have a text from him. Hold on. Oh, bad news bears. We're gonna see what happens. Initiate overload. Oh, another guy. Go Widowmaker. Mm, bad news bears. Hold on. I gotta go back to my Widowmaker. That's so damaging, come on. Come on, hold on. Let's see. He's here, he's here. My dad's being left on the doorstep while I'm finishing this night. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh gosh. Oh no, I totally get that. I don't expect anybody to watch the whole Let's Play for... Especially for all the side mission that I do. Yeah. Sorry, I have to kill a couple more people. I have to hide the XL. Well, I have to make sure he just doesn't come in this room. Okay. I don't know if I can do this in time. Okay, hold on. Uh... Okay, hold on. Hold on, let me let him in. So he's not waiting. Find the prototype that's emitting signal. Uh. Uh, hold on. Okay. Uh, three more. Prototype's gotta be somewhere. Okay, wait, no, no, we saw that. You're that guy? deep shit. I watched you watch Flowers for almost three hours. Uh, I don't think I was watching Flowers for that long, but it was certainly a long. Grab a beer out of the fridge. Prototype's gotta be somewhere up here. Okay. It's gotta be in like a side room. Actually, it's telling me to go this way. It's inside of this. Oh, and we have the tech. Nice. It's gotta be around here. I'm gonna get such crap. You have like five plus minutes to end this gig, just in case. Five plus minutes. Oh, you're talking about before it's over in the first place. Yeah. Oh. You, over here. Prisoner. <laughs> Was that you shooting okay. up the place? Yes. I almost feel sorry for them. Almost. Okay, hold on. Let me guess. Zeta take higher. I think I know why you're here. Is the eye inside of him? Because he has something going on. Does he have the prototype inside of him? Looking for the stolen tech. We can't waste time. Client lost some items. Tech stuff. Like. I can't even save. Oh, I can save. Say a prototype. I'm even talking to him. Huh? They might have locked me up, but I kept the signal pinging from my prototype. Mm. I knew the corp would send someone eventually. Mm-hmm. Cute. Now the short version. Who are you? Hassan Demir, Zeta Tech Engineer. Only survivor of the scav ambush. Okay. Didn't check the transports route. How'd you get caught with your pants That's... down? Oh. Zeta Tech didn't map the route. It was an undercover operation. Minimal security, maximum secrecy. <sighs> Only language scavs speak is brute force. Think you forgot to Thicker dog down an eight city. Yeah. Noted. Now, I have a proposition. Get me out, and I help you find the tech. Yes? Conditions. Cut to the chase. Soul Survivor is kind of suspicious. Soul Survivor, huh? Doesn't Mercy's know not in the scab's MO. <laughs> Gotta have something they want. Hmm. You could say that. What they need is my implant. Yeah. And that, my friend, is priceless. Wait, wait, wait. Telling me you planted that tech in your own damn skull? Well, I figured it was the safest way. 
The border control scans don't recognize unreleased tech. Oh. In retrospect, it does seem uh, rather foolish. I'm surprised they didn't just then pry again, it out of his eyeball. It bought me a few hours of life. We're a package deal, the prototype and I. You won't get it while I'm here, withering away. More luck than sense, this one. These gigs Our are dog, good. You gotta beat it, chip yourself with prototype tech. No offense, V. Of course, unless Zeta Tech forced him into it, made a guinea pig out of him. Hmm. Prototech's capricious. Erratic. For a Zeta Tech engineer. Sure took a big gamble planting that thing. Indeed, a gamble. Yet the alternative was far more dangerous. Kinda just like when I stuck right. the chip in my And Big neck. Daddy Zeta Tech. All cool. Yeah, who put an unknown yeah, if in exactly. fuck around with Papa's priceless Prototech. Papa was not informed of the decision. Hmm. Now, can we please take this conversation outside? It is. It is, Keanu. Yeah. Also, Tiger, thanks for the stretch. Noi and Bask and Remco, guys, thanks for the follows. Welcome in. Why all the drama over some measly implant? Some implant? Where are measly? you? Please, this design is a potential Kiroshi buster. <clears throat> we at the firm learned some Santo Domingo riffraff stole it from Arasaka Industrial Park. Naturally, we investigated. I like his pants. I was to conclude the sale at the stadium. Hush hush, not so much as a beep on Arasaka's radar. And well, here I am. Mm, no, he's inside. I let him inside just now. But I do have to go. The say no rescue up. How about I just take it? I don't see why I can't just rescue him, but I feel like Shouldn't he's not going to give going? it. Uh, yeah. Relax. Yeah, rescue hostages. Look, if you want the implant, you need to take me to a ripper. Extracting it is a delicate process. And we're going to need a good ripper. Prototype's all I need. It's condition? Whole another gig. That still leaves the schematics. Uh, listen, I can show you where they're holding them. Hmm. Okay. Fine. I'm Fine. trusting them. I need to stop trusting people. Wonderful. I knew we'd come to an understanding. I wonder if you can shoot him, though. I don't think you can. Yeah, yeah. it keeps putting it off there. Let a crack open this door. Bypass the security. If you can't, the guard room's nearby. Maybe they have a passcode. Right. Mm. Back in a nanosec. You know, um, um, look, great talk, Hassan. I'm going to be back in like 24 hours, okay? It was great talking to you. Stay in that cage for just 24 more hours and I will be back. <laughs> and I'll be back, guys. I got to skedaddle. My dad is downstairs waiting for me. Um, plus, I don't want to rush this gig. I didn't know it was going to be. I was expecting the gigs from like the base game where there are a lot more to him. But yeah, no, 22, a little less than 24 hours. He'll be fine. He's already been waiting this long. He can wait a little bit more. Yeah, just the mods in their basement. <laughs> Guys, thank you so much for tuning in today. I've got a skedaddle. Um, like I said, today's a little bit shorter, but tomorrow we'll do a, a decently longer one, get some good progress done with the DLC. Um, but yeah, thank you so much for tuning in today. As always, thank you for your time more than anything. There were a lot of gifted subs and there were a lot of first time subs too. Also that stretch. I got that stretch and spazzy. Thank you for the 2000 bits. Crate with the 500 bits reiterating. Congrats on the sponsor guys. Thank you so much. And as always, if you want to check out fractal, you can do exclamation mark fractal. Um, but yeah, thank you guys for absolutely everything. I will see you guys tomorrow at 12. I might start a little bit earlier. It just kind of depends, um, how the morning goes, but I would expect 12 probably. Oh, and the next episode of final fantasy is going up at four. So yes, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Sorry for the quick, but I got a jet. I got to go. I will see you guys tomorrow for more. Bye.